hard to get set up. Hey, Wolves Den, Mr. Rogers, Jonathan, Kentucky Lake Fisherman, Sherry, Frank Lamperon, any fan? Been a lot of people in here. Awesome. Uh -huh. 351, Sampy. So your wait is over, Jonathan. Here we are. We're waiting on Anthony, but he'll be here shortly. He said he was on his way. And then um, Mark from uh, Everything Catfishing is on his way here. He's almost here. So I'm going to go. Stacy there is fishing for carp. Carp? Yep. Or a night crawler. Or a night crawlers. I want you to do it in hooks. Um, I brought them out here. I think maybe I didn't. Yeah, they are. They're here. Hey, wolves, Dan. Hey, Jonathan. Stacy made it today. He's carp fishing. Ooh. He's got his bottles. He said it's hard to get it thrown out there, though. I don't know if that's going to be the task. I've about got one rigged up here, so we're going we're gonna to see what we can do. I don't know. I might get a balloon and stick on it, let it float across through there with this wind. You got any balloons with you, Stacy? Nope. Except the wind's at your back. Been raining here, so <laughs> Monty said, Let's see a new PB on a bottle, Cindy. <laughs> Let's do it, Monty. <laughs> well, you gotta look at it this way. Any anything we catch is a PB. On a bottle it is. If we catch one. I wish we could get this uh tarp to quit fla flapping around, but it's not likely to happen unless the wind dies down. Yeah, so I have to figure out the sinker on this thing now. I got the hook on me. First catch of the day is a stick. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Stacy. <laughs> Let me measure it. <laughs> hey, Mr. Rogers. Hey, Chad. <laughs> brought the big daddy. <laughs> we did, didn't we? Oh, you're going to be warm. Look at that heater he brought. Heater. You may have saved us. <laughs> Listen, now, we didn't know what the weather was going to be like out here, Stacy. What you do is you go and get you a tarp and make you a shelter. And, and then you, we was out here last night. <laughs> It was cold. I'm gonna go get that clip. Huh? Ah. Oh, was I? Yeah. I didn't think there'd be enough back there to fish. Everybody. About it. Oh, stuff. I back here. There's a bunch of little baby back here. Bank fishing. <laughs> Adventures. I don't know how this is going to work. And bottles. Tell me, please. Bank fishing adventures, Mitzel. He's fishing for carp today, but hey, Lance. Crib cat tackle in the house. 
Travis painted his last night, but he didn't get them rigged up. We was busy playing games on Sam's channel. <laughs> I wish we had some. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna see if we can even get this out here, people. <laughs> this is gonna be. Stacy said it's a problem. Why don't you put it on a balloon? Well, I may do that and let it see if I can get it across the floor, but I don't have no wings right here in front of the scalpel. Mm. We're going to try to get it out here. We're going to watch him throw, everybody. <laughs> we'll go with that one to begin with. We can offer them a, a, a buffet of baits. Creek chubs. Well, there's two. Okay, we got one out, so we're fishing. We need a way to set drag. <laughs> huh? Mr. Rogers said, Travis, watch those videos I see. Hey, Mike Chavez, what's going on? <laughs> Kentucky, on Kentucky said, I think Anthony J got scared. <laughs> Mr. Rogers said, you got to loosen the brake on that, Stacy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's going to be interesting. I hope you're dressed warm. Are you feeling better today? I feel a lot better. Drinking my spray. Yeah. Huh? Oh, right oh, he got some big bottles though, back too. Check this out. Can't recall that is. That's a blue. You know, Travis was gonna. Uh, we've That's got one cool. of them big water bottles that go on the cooler things. Yeah, the big ones. <laughs> he was gonna bring that one. Yeah, I started to bring it. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. <laughs> Jonathan said, Cindy, Tony will be late for his own funeral. I don't want to use that. Listen, I, I think that I'll probably have to work up to lunch on the day of mine. Mr. Mr. Rogers said yeah. he's, he slung that some gun from here to there. <laughs> oh, we didn't go too far. We may put a balloon on one and see if we can get some distance out there on it. I think that's a pretty good idea. Brought a, uh, since the wind's blowing that way, I brought a BB gun and a got some helium balloons. Well, I, exploded, hey, that's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> I told Travis we should make us a tater cannon for this. Yeah. <laughs> Just shoot them bottles <laughs> clean across the lake. Have you seen them bait launchers they got? Uh, boat? Oh, no. Like that won't even give you the day off. Or something. It's like a potato gun. I guess it's air compressed. Right. They, they've got to set them on the beach and boy, it, it launches them things out there. Well, see, that's what I told her. I said, we need to make a air gun to do it. There he is. Yeah. Oh, he, you know, he's done got, he done fixed up some fancy rigs. Here's Anthony. Hey, hey Anthony. Anybody. Oh, boy, I wish I had some clips. Close pins or anything. Uh, okay. oh, yeah, they are. Jonathan said, Tony, about time you showed up, brother. Yeah, because the water rose, the water actually rose up on us. And, uh, Messed us up. Did it mess you up? He's already set up, though. You got them in the water and stuff. Did were you able to get them out no, there any no, distance? I I, they're not in the water yet. I got my oh, buddy, okay. my bro Gary over here. He's getting. He's setting up. We're all setting up. Oh, okay. Travis is good line on his right now. I got one okay. out. Oh, 
We got skip jack. We got these catfish nugget bite things I seen at Walmart that I never tried. So yeah. we'll give that a go. We got we got night crawlers as well. Night crawlers. We we've got everything. We've got chicken livers, chicken. You can move that in front of this so the wind won't blow it if you want to. Yeah. Hey, he done brought the ultimate heater over here. Look at this. We don't believe in being too awful uncomfortable. <laughs> it's like a flamethrower or something. Yeah, just get it to where it is. Actually, if we want to put it behind Travis's chair, it'd probably keep that thing up. As long as we don't get it too close to the floor. Bonnie did melt his pants that one night. He's standing up on it. It, it melted his pants on it. <laughs> right. It'd probably be fine on low, as a matter of fact. I got these catfish legs. Well, let's see how hot things. it gets to. Oh, that's what you got at Walmart? Yeah, it's made by uh, Catfish something. I forgot the name of it. I'll show you the package in a minute here. I've never tried them. I've never tried them. Jonathan said, Tony, I gave you my word I'd be here. All right, Jonathan. You uh -huh. uh -huh. like, what? What are you right. On the bigger tank. Get the one to the on the tank. Now this is just an adapter just to screw onto that uh, bar that I've got that put on my oh, okay. that's right. But you can get the one to screw onto the tank and it'll screw into the buddy piece. That way you don't have to burn through. I'm gonna try to keep up a chat here. Cool. Yeah, good luck. That was a blank. What was it? Well, I saw those good tortillas too. They're uh, Mike Chavez. They look good. Who's yellow? Blue corn, corn tortillas. I can't see it. Hey, any fan? What's up, Ernest? Hey, Stacey, what's awesome up? Good people morning. in here. What? I said good morning, Stacy Travis. Is that Mark? I thought I heard. Good morning, Cindy. Are you ready? Yeah. Stacy Travis and Mark. Everything catfishing. Hey guys. Hooks and hammocks. Hey Chris and Telly. They're getting ready to pull into the river and launch. Hey, you can Where you put it on the main screen? I'm gonna try to cast this out. Okay. Let's see if it works or not. <laughs> Here, let me. My my phone ain't recognizing my fingers. There we go. There you go. Sure. Full screen. All right, I got an over under, and I got these catfish blood. He's got over under. Kind of like wax. Oh, there wow. you go. Yeah, he's, he's got two hooks on his. Two sets of hooks. Right, over under rig. Where you got? We got you some weights in the car. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Man, he yeah. go he muscled it right out there. And any fan said good form, Anthony. I don't know you need them today. Thank you. <laughs> No. I got a coat. Well, I got a baby spray, and I have to get another thing of baby spray. This is that. I was going to get away, but after I looked at the back of it, it said, uh, I have $50 or more merchandise in your shopping cart. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, okay. You got to get some other ones ready. 25. Here's the twenty-five, but I mean, well, I guess I'll just go get a twenty-five dollar gift card. Or I'll just send somebody twenty-five dollars, whatever account they want for the twenty-five dollar giveaway. I said I'd do for you. Mid South said, "I'm sure. How, I'm curious how plastic models will work for this. We shall see." Turn out. Sure, 
You won't see the spoil forever. Because I do that, because I keep talking about That way I don't have a sense. <laughs> hey, Stuart. Yeah, but I do it. I do that just because. Yeah, penalties for lost fingers. Anyway, I don't have to yank on you. So, yeah, the videos we saw on this, uh, there's one little boy but in another country that catches big fish on these kind of rigs. You, you got to remember which is which and everything. That's what I like about this. I always do uh, try to get the hot start that way. You can put the lungs and drill down for you. Wow. Lance said, when I learned to fish with cans, bottles, I, I was told to put a rubber band over the line to keep tension on it. Yeah. What? You're referring to the reel and end part? <laughs> he had one on that new rod and reel. And man, she kept missing the fish. Kept missing. She missed like three in a row. She cut it off. I said, cut this, cut this hook off. I kept pulling it on them. Yeah, I usually use sinker slides with it. And the only reason I do that is because of the uh, everybody. That's like if you use your clicker. <laughs> then it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we'll hand over hand it. Yeah. Maybe it, depending on, you know, what's going on, we'll uh, wrap it wrap it back around a bottle or just hand over hand it. And she is going to get that piece any way she can if it takes it off. Any way I can, for sure. Yeah. And I did not like We might. They were very light. Yeah. Yeah, we've got molds to make egg sink sinkers. Yeah. <coughs> Alright, you wanna put me back on full screen for cast number two? Okay, here we go. Online. I think uh all right, Stacey's fixing to throw his too. Like I said, I got an over under. I've, I've got garlic night crawlers and regular night crawlers. Night and crawlers, all right. Week. And I'm doing it kind of Santee Cooper style with the floats. So, all uh, right. So we're going to top it up. He's doing it Santee Cooper style. Yeah, that one's got like a uh, two, three. Oh, yeah. Did it? Got five, six. <laughs> you got something? No, he's casting them out. But, uh, he's getting some pretty good distance on them, too. Everybody usually drops in fours. They went four and five. And I made a crap ton of them, all them other ones. Which I don't care. I'll put two on. He backlashed. backlashed. <laughs> That's what Mid South said. Anthony backlashed. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on. Let me make this full screen. There he goes. Hell yeah, that's what's up. <laughs> what's up, Anthony? How you doing, Mark? Said, what's up, Anthony? Did Stacy throw his out yet? Hold on. 
Gary, hold on. Right. Gary's about to throw. Let's see. First time ever doing this. You, you want to put me up? Oh, oh. Stacy's about to go. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Stacy's going to throw first. Now you're good. Oh, okay. okay, hang on. You're good. Let me I switch it back off. All right, here goes Gary. This is my bro Gary. He came up from Tennessee. All righty. How well it's going to work. I just got to run out. Do it. Oh, not enough. <laughs> we got about four feet. <laughs> <laughs> right, There's three, definitely a, a technique to it. Do you want me to fix up a bottle, Travis? Were you, were you pulling a bunch of line out already? What'd you do? Just tie it around it? Uh, no. Are you pulling a bunch of line out? Are you letting it come off the box? Yeah. <laughs> All right. It was on here. I reckon it goes inside here. <laughs> Men South said, New at CatCon, big bottle fever, bottle fishing rods. Big and battle big bottles. Bottle fever. <laughs> All right, here goes the second attempt. Oh, yeah. Uh, All right. Oh, yeah. Woo! That was a good cat. All right, we went far. Getting out there now. It's not enough on them. Uh, this is going to be attempt number three. <laughs> we got one more bottle in the car, Travis. But I don't think we have any more small hooks. I got a guard dog I got to set up, too. I, I brought a fishing rod. Yeah. Mid-South said Yeti will probably make a $200 bottle for bottle fishing. <laughs> <laughs> Look at them. Right, oh. number three. There Hang we on. Go. There it is. Now he's getting it. Yeah. Look at these hooks, Mark. Mark bought. Well, Whisker Seeker. Jesus, you going to put that on the bottle? That's going to be that's <laughs> going to be for summer fishing when we're using no. the big skipjack. Yeah. Oh wow. No bottle on that one. All right, I got well, to that's that's the slap on Gary. He's about to do it again. <laughs> we, that's the hook we would have used on that big old uh, water bottle if we'd have brought it. <laughs> Travis is going to put a balloon on this one, I think. Hey, no way it's given. What's up? Sometimes it's hard to find the leader line anymore. Yeah, I think I got some of that kind. Sometimes when you go to Walmart, they're out of leader line. They won't have anything over 50. Mm -hmm. Stacy's getting, he's winding up. Are you making one up, Stacy? Yep. Get him, Stacy. Don't let Anthony show us up with his fancy rigs. Hey, yeah. James. What's going on? Happy New Year to you. There we go. No, no F's given said BFA. Howdy. All right, it's out there. I'm getting ready to catch 10 pounder on this bottle. It might water must be stuck in towards the main channel because uh, it seems like it's pulling the lines that way a little bit. Over to the left? Yeah. When you're fishing with a bottle but don't want a bottle, Guard Dog Pro Bottle Edition. Guard Dog Pro Bottle Edition. Me and Sal. Right. I'm telling you, they're going to have to make you pro staff. Car, but I got it out there. Whether you whether you fish Man, with one or not, not you got all the yeah, the jingles. There. <laughs> if the wind gets to blowing good, it's going to start spinning. <laughs> okay. Now, if, if your bottle starts spinning, you got to yell at me so I can yeah. put you full screen. What are we going to yell? Spin the bottle! Spin the bottle! Spin the bottle! Bottle! Fish, fish, fish. <laughs> You'd have to be amateur staff. <laughs> it's, since it's uh, since it's spin the bottle, does that mean you got to kiss the fish? Ew. Yeah, let's let's make it so you have to kiss the fish. 
Stacy's if he catches a carp, they have their lips ready already. I better not catch no silver carp. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it might be hard for it to stay on. Yeah, it's not going to suck your bottom lip in, Anthony. I'm telling you, it'll give me a, and headbutt me at the same time. <laughs> Maybe one of us will catch a drum. They're ready to kiss, oh, too. Man. That'd be cool. All right, I'm going to cast out my third one here. All righty. This one's got, uh, this one's got Cindy's favorite, Skipjack. Yeah. Oh, look at the box. Are you? Well, Hang on. Travis is hey, getting so the box. The that was this. Yeah, yeah, let me see. It pulled on the last one. Yeah, it pulled on it, but it's not. Oh, no, that's Monty has a restraining order against you already. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Monty? Guard Dog Pro? I mean, Smouse is the one that said it. <laughs> Go ahead. I got you up on full screen. If if, uh, if he goes right. to spin in the bottle, we'll swap so it I up real the, quick. I got little pieces of skipjack. And this is oh. also Santee Cooper style. Santee Cooper? Some, yeah, you know, with the float on it. And then uh, this, I got some beads coming off the main and blah, blah, blah. All right, let's go. Cool. And the wind up. And the throw. <laughs> I like his follow through. <laughs> you got it. He sticks his bottle way else <laughs> for the follow through. All right. I want to see you pick that bottle up and set the hook. <laughs> I know, dude. I, I was wondering. I go, man, how, it's going to be, it's going to run, I'm thinking. Or, or what if it's just nibbles? You got to grab the bottle, wait for the nibble, and then wait. Right. <laughs> I'm thinking. You know. All right, I got I to I get up this ride. Is, I got to ride. Are you using braids? <laughs> yeah, just some extra I had it. I have to go Look, Mark's wrapping his with braid. He's been wrapping, wrapping, wrapping. It still looks like he got hardly none on his bottle. Dude, my arm was getting tired wrapping these things. <laughs> There's still another bottle in the car. Is that the one you're going to put the balloon on? Yeah. You want me to go get that other bottle out of the car? Yeah. I'll be right back, guys. Don't catch anything while I'm gone. We got night crawlers, skipjack, this catfish blood stuff. Uh, yeah, I was thinking about that too. I'm not worth a lot. But We've got chicken, chicken liver. It's the Catfish Pro. The oh, okay. Shows a big old blue cat on it. We'll see. Uh, we got Chad Creek Chub, chicken liver, carp. We'll just keep going. Skip Jack. <laughs> we got all That's the baits. Bank, what you using? Bluegill and crappie? Oh, corn. 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 Corn and car. Sweet. Here, I'm going to throw it out real quick. Um, Jonathan, we're from East Tennessee. <laughs> my foot. <laughs> <laughs> he switched <laughs> bottles. <laughs> he decided he didn't want to wrap a line around that other one. Yeah, we're, it ain't got no indention at all. Right now, we're in Northeast Tennessee. Anthony J. Yeah. That that background in yours, it looks like all the water is gonna run out. <laughs> you really? see how it looks like it's tilted? It's not because the shoreline is straight. But the way oh, that yeah. the, the way the horizon the is, it looks like it's tipped up. <laughs> The camera's kind of at an angle because of the we had to 
like I said, the water rose, so like the flatter spots gone. So we're kind of on a little slight bit. Yep. I, I'll get it straightened up here in a second, but no, I know it looks. It is it running looks like out. Calvin, your water's running out. Running out. Okay. All right, I gotta set the guard dog up. Gotta set the guard dog up. Guard dog, boop, boop. I'm gonna fill him up with water to add drag to There you go. What am I getting? A balloon? Oh, yeah. Are you, are you watching it over there? You, you, know, you can say, you can talk to everybody too, you know that. Well, I'm going to get talking to the chat, too, you know. Tell me, what's going on? Look out, homie. Sorry, I have a hard time talking about it. I've got a spinner already. Oh, you know you can talk to everybody through the chat. Oh, yeah, I will. I'd like to see a little blue or something. Thank you. Yeah, there you go. I'll pick up another bottle. I'll pick up a bottle. I got you. You can use more wine. Oh, it's brown pearl in the place, right? Yeah. So, so blown Okay, hang on. Let me make you full screen. I'm back. All right, there we are. There we go. Here we go. Ooh, I got that out there. Nice. Dude, nice. I got some distance. Got some distance, yeah. bank. Yeah. <laughs> I got real good. Yeah. Stacy sailed his out there. Dude, he almost hit the other side. <laughs> There's a lot more numbers when you watch the water. There's a lot more numbers. Stacy's went. <laughs> We're going to put a balloon on this one and see if we can't get it to oh, yeah. go out there, son. Woo! Chad, come I hate the incredible bulk. Uh, I'm just hoping for anything. Be nice to catch a monster, but Travis put a balloon on his bottle and left it unattended in the wind. It's about to go. <laughs> Stop flopping. Hey, uh, when you get done with that wine, never mind. I'm gonna cut me off a little bit and do some work on this. This. What? I'm going to use it to tie some of these. These things got holes in them. I'm going to tie it. What is the cone-shaped thing that the line spools have that holds the spool? What is the cone-shaped thing that the line spoolers have that holds the spool? You know what he's talking about? When you put it on your rod, a cone shape. Got a creek shovel on that one. 
Tina asked, "Oh, you have comment? Uh, you have family in Murfreesboro? Yeah, Murfreesboro is um, probably about close to three hours west of us. But I've been there. I stayed there about a week one time." That's closer to Anthony, probably. Dog. Oh, you got you gotta put the, are you going to put the guard dog on the bottle? No, I haven't figured that one out yet. I have oh. an idea. I actually have an idea. Uh -oh. This is going to be... <laughs> Mid-South had the guard dog for a bottle edition. I thought Anthony done come up with it. <laughs> I, got, I got an idea for it. To put tension on the pole that's holding it. But I, uh -huh. have, I need to make this one little other piece. That I forgot to make. Oh, okay. I'll put this on the fishing rod. What contraption of a rod and reel is this that a hand line called a bottle toward 25? <laughs> Come on, everybody, catch something. I hope everybody catches something, honestly. I hope the bite is improving. It has been crap. I caught one last night, though. I had three skunks in a row. I was determined to catch something last night. Are you going to set your camera up over there, Mark? Or you just want us to put our camera on it? Kentucky Rednecks uh, Outdoors, Gary Hornsby. Right, Gary, so you're fishing bottles. with? We got three bottles of guard dog. Gary's got one bottle out so far. He's doing another one. He's got two more to go. Okay. We're working on it. Let me show you the guard so, dog. Okay, let me make you full screen. Cool. I don't know if you can see it. If I get my fat head out of the way. Yeah. There we go. Awesome. So looks like you got a little bit better weather than we do. Uh, yeah, yeah the she's ready out. to go. The sun's coming out. It's like fifty degrees. And you got it. You got it set on the light. Light back. I have on the second setting. Okay. Light. And then we got the bottles right here. There's one. We might put two, out a couple rods. Uh, two, three. If we can get this set up. Gary's got his two. over here. He's got his set up, Gary. Right there. Got the line going out. Now it's a waiting game. Now it's a waiting game. Whoa! <laughs> Mark about lost the bottle. Uh oh. It's so windy here that uh, if you set your bottle down, then you stand a good chance of losing it. <laughs> That's really good. Yeah. 
And I got an ex I got an extra rod. I brought another rod just in case we a bottle happens to take off in the water. We can grab it. Gary's got a few extra lure rods too. He can snatch them right up in case that if we lose one. Miss Beth, I ain't heard a commercial in a few minutes. He's got the guard dog pro set up, so you got to do a commercial. Me? If you don't have Kristen, a guard dog, you ain't got nothing at all. Christian Telly said, let's go BFA. Yeah. Woo! Get one. Make that bottle clean. Oh, I thought I'm Gary getting the bike. Once uh -oh. Gary gets all his thing. Once Gary gets all his set up, I'll we'll put the camera over there on him for a little bit. Are you getting a butt? I thought I was. Let's see. Mark's over here making super rig. See that thing started whipping. <laughs> My clicker will go off. <laughs> his clicker will go off. <laughs> Mid South said, "If your no name is Tony and you don't want to look phony, Guard Dog Pro." <laughs> <laughs> okay, Ernest. Yeah, not yet. Not yet, Cindy. Okay. Yet. All righty. It looked like one. What am I doing with that? You put it on your bottle. I'm letting her do that. What do you do? What do you mean? What do you do? You put it uh, under your line? Whatever you want. Put, oh, okay. Here. No. Here. What? You can tie that corner up. Oh. Look what I did here, see? You're talking about tying the corner. Tony, Tony, Tony. And that does not look phony. <laughs> Mix out, you're such a poet. Yeah, that's a great one. Tony great stuff. Oh, yeah, that's what he had. That's what Tony's got. Yep. Yeah, I put it on, I put it off that dock. That balloon, did it go? Well, see it out there? Oh, yeah. Like that was it. I can't see it. Here, let me, put it on. let me put it on solo. Can you see the blue balloon? I can't see. Is that on the left, right, middle? Yeah, it's sort of in the middle of the screen. Yeah, that's it. I can't see. I can't tell from my my phone. Oh, okay. Uh, Is it real far out or? Pretty far. Yeah, quite a way. Um, Mensa or uh, okay. Hooks and Hammocks said Superman wears Hooks and Hammocks underwear. Right? <laughs> Watchless. Chuck Norris is afraid of hooks and hammocks. Mint South said, when you're miffed because your last hook set whiffed, you need guard dog pro. Pro, pro. <laughs> hey, the a little. Yeah, I'm, I'm rigging one up. Yeah. At least get out of the wind. <laughs> hey, Mink T. He said. 
Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and gentlemen and ladies attire. <laughs> Just whatever. Hey, Corey's Magnet Fishing. Hey, BFC Cats. Hey, hey. Okay, look, Tony. Come a little closer. Yep, Closer. Tony, he's got your rig. Hey, copycat. He said copycat. His was already pre-tied. <laughs> oh, they're pre-tied? Oh, come on. I made all mine. I wonder if I turn the sound down on mine. Put yours. I can't hardly hear. How deep is it here? Where we're fishing, it's probably only about 10, 12 feet. Yeah, all the way out there in the middle, probably 10, 12 feet. It's not deep. Man, How deep is it where you're fishing, Tony? It's about to say maybe 10 to 15. Uh, I got the guard dogs probably in 30. And uh, Stacy, you're fishing in a pond? Yep. So two about three four. to fifteen, maybe. Two to three. Oh, two to three. Probably. Hey, Miss Jones. Hey, How are Jones, you doing Ms. today? Stacy gonna get a big old cart with that corn. Hey, um. You might want to. Sure. It's going to take me 42 years to rig mine up. I'm still wrapping line. <laughs> Cindy, you'll be joining us in the next year's oh. tournament. I want this ever gets done there. <laughs> yeah. you know, BFC Cat said, done. Tell Mark I don't got bait. I don't understand why this is so fun. I don't make BFC said to tell Mark he don't got bait. Yeah, we got some bait. Oh, he don't have bait? That's what he said. Uh, he's all right. <laughs> Big said, if I was there, the only thing I'd catch is a cold. I can't yeah, fish for shit. <laughs> you know, when you're sick of the bash because you can't see over the dash, Chris needs guard dog pro. Yeah, not my best work. <laughs> Keep trying, Mid South. You got it. Good around here, Mike. Hey, Travis. What? That depends on how far you wanted to go. Well, I don't know. Far. Hey, Ashley Brady. I think that's enough line. What's going on, Ashley? What are you doing today? That creek shovel is probably like, dang, this water's cold. Is <laughs> <laughs> that water over at Green Bell still running? Is that water over at Green Bell still running? Yeah, I just got to do a little creek right there. Health department. This pond. I went right there. I had that little hit that. I was trying to hit that stuff right there. And I just went right there. What? Hey, Kim Burris. And it's still got the little weird dam. 
We have, have see, we have Greenbelt Park. Does it got these little weird? We have things? chicken livers, chicken. Seems like it used to have a weird shed, skipjack, uh, creek chubs, uh, and a little bit of carp. We got a little bit of everything. Hey, puffin' mutt, puff muffin. Hi, Ashley. Good. Hi, everybody else. If I missed you, hello. We have 35 awesome people in here watching us. Somebody got to catch something. Somebody got to catch something. You're right there. Hey, John Boyd. We've also got Mark here with us. Uh, everything catfishing. He's relatively new. To, to Not new to catfishing, but new to YouTube catfishing, so. He's going to have to start. Well, he's going to be needing to work on watch hours soon, so. I think he's he's got a playlist. If y'all get a chance, everything catfishing. Put his stuff on in the background while you're doing stuff or whatever and let it play through. That's the easiest way to get some easy watch hour. Thank God the ladies finally showed up. I came for pretty ladies and Cindy's been hiding behind the camera. So, hey, beautiful ladies. Well, you can't see them either, Mid-South. Oh, Mid-South. <laughs> I don't blame her. Listen, I, I don't like to, I can't get warm once I get cold. So I fully understand. I just can like somebody, fishing. Go can, ahead. Somebody, can somebody drop our, everybody's at fishing here and uh, up here today. Can someone drop our links uh, periodically throughout the show? That'll work. Hey, All right. one of the mods, that'd be great if you could drop our links. Anthony. Anthony's got, how, how many subs do you have now, Ant? Uh, 377. So Anthony's needing subs. He's probably pretty good on watch hours. Yeah, but I'm Anthony's needing about. subs. So. Shares. I'll get Oh, somebody fell out My connection ain't worth a crap Uh oh Um, Anthony, is it alright if I can mark your Facebook information So we can get you on Messenger and stuff There you go uh, I'm I'm there. Another bottle. <laughs> like one bag. You got something on a bottle? I'm sorry I'm yelling, but I can't hardly hear, so it makes me talk louder. <laughs> Who's got 87? Yeah. Cindy, you got my Facebook link. If you, I don't know, I can't bring it up from here. But oh yeah, I'll give it to him while we're all here right. today. It's all good. Okay, I just don't like to give out anybody's information without their express permission first. Uh, you can, so, you totally can go to my YouTube from my channel. From my, I mean, my Facebook, my YouTube channel, Anthony. Just send me a friend request or message on there. Did you hear him? He's got his Facebook link on his YouTube. If you go to oh, Everything okay. Catfishing, uh, you go. To, it'll have his YouTube. I mean, his Facebook link, and you can send him a friend request. Okay, friend, I'll do that when I when uh, later on this yeah. evening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. None of us can do anything while we're streaming. Oh, this is good old guy. I've been soaking in there for days. <laughs> If y'all need a link to Cindy's channel, I can't help you. What? Why not, Mid South? Come on, Mid. Stop being lazy, Mid South. Yeah. 
He said, and on the topic of beautiful ladies, Travis asked, showed up. <laughs> I think Mid South has a thing for Travis. I'm about to be jealous. I like them little skinny tight ones. All right. Do I, I probably need a sinker on this thing, huh? Sounds like a yeah. You can put it on the bottom. That's what I did. Just clip one of them two and it's on the bottom. Oh, okay. I'm going to put this over here. I'm going to dig my box back out. Oh. Uh oh. Stacy's spinning again. Yeah, if you get if you get a bite, you gotta holler out, spin the bottle, spin the bottle. <laughs> spin the bottle, spin the bottle. Okay. Actually, Mid South, I, I really don't need my link shared out too much. I'm pretty good on, on the subs and watch hours. Oh, Cindy went Hollywood on us. You I did not. But anyway. <laughs> she got like thirty five thousand people. <laughs> not quite. Stacy done bumped out again. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's back. He's back. That's a good that's a good shot of Stacy. Actually, we can see yours really good. Yeah. Really? Yeah, oh yeah, we can see your bottles real good. I'm about to move my camera around a little bit, I think. Hey, 710. You might have mine spaced out a little too far. Right. Uh, when you figure out where the fish is, then we'll both know. They some in here if they want to bite on these rigs. Gary's rigging up his food bottle. We got two out. He's got one little rod out, too, at the same time. Hey, Donald. Hey, Donald Long. Welcome in. What's up, Donald? Brother Down. Is brother Brother Randall in here? What's up, Brother Rand? Randall? I haven't seen Randall yet. Never mind. <laughs> What's up, Paul? Red said the postal service has absolutely pissed me off. No wonder dude went postal. Ain't Red, Hang, do ain't you Red have a two six? ounce, Travis? I thought Red was six. You have a two ounce. Sinker. How come Red ain't up here doing the bottle challenge? He worked last night. He ought to be sleeping. There ain't no time to sleep when there's catfish to catch. Guard You're God. right. Mm -hmm. All right. I need to find. I need to find a really deep ledge that's close to me so I can throw these out. Because like you can, I can. Only, I'm only getting like maybe thirty to forty feet out with these bottles. Thirty or forty feet. Yeah. Actually, I think you're doing pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. It, it, it's deep. It's taking line down too when I throw it. You know, so it's settling. So I mean, min, 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 hey, pre-retirement days. Look at that. Got it rigged up. See, I got my lines fairly tight. I had I got the bottle caps on, and I I. Uh, oh hi hi Monica, she just texted me. I can see you. That's my ex. I love her. Anyway, um, she I got my bottle caps on the bottles, and I drilled holes in them, just the right size for the for the for the post for the stick. Yeah. And uh, I, I had to jam some rock in there because I couldn't get them tight. So I had to jam some rock in there. It should release it though if we do get a bite. Okay now. Oh, you gonna put on the other hook? What we got? You got everything. Well, give me something. <laughs> give me some. <laughs> give me something. I'm gonna put chicken over right here. Let's try. Let's put one of these down or three bit on it. All right. I ain't throwing this stuff. <laughs> I will. Get over here. Why is that bottle screen? Oh. 
I was thinking, <laughs> I was thinking, why is it spinning? Somebody was going spin the bottle. Did I hear spin the bottle? No, not yet. He get ready oh, to throw he here. He was spinning his bottle, but he was doing his stuff. Oh, he's uh -oh. way down there. Uh oh. Woo! Or when his bottle was like an all star cast. He got it out there quite a ways, though, actually. He got it out there deep enough. Nice throw. We're, we're fishing on the Tennessee River, uh, on the Paducah side of Tennessee River, underneath the Paducah Ledbetter Bridge, if anybody was wondering. Uh, we're not too far from the Ohio River, where, where the Tennessee River ends, only about a mile and a half, maybe. That's Kentucky. Ah. You have to grab that thing out the bottom. No? Oh. There you go. Um, are you talking about BFA, Bank Fishing Adventures? Mid South Bank Fishing Adventures. Mid South said, Megan, if I was your man, I'd drive to the manufacturer and get that rod for you today. Oh. oh. Anthony would, Rod said, Anthony would make a heck of an African fisherman. Hey, Rod's Fishing Adventures. They know how to fish, man. They catch them hey, catfish over here, man, like crazy. Hey, hey Eddie Gross. We got a barge Welcome coming down. In. We're looking for a barge bite. Barge bite, barge bite, barge bite. Man, Gary, you were out fishing here the other day, man. I had a barge. See, this barge was moving like 15 miles an hour. The other day. Travis tried to make ours colorful, but there's a lot. Um, I can't monetize my lives with my phone. There's a way to do it, but I can't so far. If you the way you do that is to open the desktop site on your phone in order to monetize them when you get monetized. But I can't, uh, I have to have my laptop for that. Don't work too hard, Ashley. Come on, fish. For real. It's cold and windy. We want you to bite now. Oh, shoot. I forgot to put my shiny on there. I've used everything so far that we got. Okay. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, bring your chair over here. What happened? Did my line come off? For real? They kind of break. Happy New Year, Ashley. Yeah, I brought my ball there because I'm the one in the water room. They're still us. They feel like wax. They're over here That's next to you. Barge is passing by. So what are you now. having to do? What are you having to do? Try something good. Hear me. Spam away, Mid South. Gary's getting his other bottle ready here, ready to throw out. Are you throwing it out right now? Got to. Okay. So in a few minutes, we'll have to go full screen, Cindy. And uh, okay, we'll let me Gary. know when you're ready. Okay, I'll let you know. He shared your link and said, whoever that is, do you want to add some line to it or you want me to? I can wrap some more on it. It looks like a lot of line, but I guess it goes fast. So 
know what if you bottle fish from a boat? Okay. We get it out a lot further. Yeah. Then your line going to go straight down. Mid South said, no BS catfish and whoever that is, tell them Cindy's future ex-husband sent you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold on. We're ready. Full screen. Hold on. The rules were no. Okay. Hang on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. The rules were no rod and reels, just a bottle, but they didn't specify you had where you had to use a bottle. That's right, bud. Listen, knock yourself out, man. Go up on right. a boat right. and bottle fish. Here we go. All right, let's give this a shot. <laughs> there you go. And you can fish the heater over so you can get two bottles. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't make it out too far. There's not a fish right here. <laughs> you got well, the link to this. Gary's, to send it to he's you. got a rethrow. Gary's got a rethrow. We're going to see. You got a wound too tight? Okay. Mine's been I've been catching mine at five percent. I was like, Ooh. All right, here we go. And the wind up. And the up. There it is. Yeah. Double, yeah. Double, double, yeah. Yeah. And double, 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 Get the crap out of that, hook. That's right, hanging up. It's a big problem. We got one, two, three, four, okay, five. We got five bottles out so far. <laughs> five bottles out so far. Gotcha. Is he got Woohoo! Right. Somebody got to catch one. We got bait in the water. Uncle Red's catfish and the bot commands for this channel are available at Skipjack Sandy Commands. What? Damn. Hollywood. Yeah. It says not bought Uncle Red's catfishing. The bot commands for this channel are available at and it gives not bot TV. Skip, Skipjack Sandy Commands. I have never seen that before. Ooh. You want to cut a piece of real chicken chicken off? No, yeah. no luck yet. Um, I think Tyler. Um I think Stacy down the bottom's the only one that's had a bite so far. Who are you calling a pitch? <laughs> Yeah, that's, a good that's what I'm saying. There's, it's got, there's some death though. No, I was reeling it in. I was reeling fast, but it never came up. You go see all the commands you do on the commands. Mid South said, Cindy, you want me to drop your OnlyFans link too? Sure. <laughs> if you, you can find a, an OnlyFans link that's going to pay me directly, sure. You don't want, you don't want to know what she does with them skipjacks after dark, okay? Right? Right? I have to pay for my boat somehow. They don't call her skipjack Cindy for nothing. <laughs> they don't call me skipjack Cindy for nothing. Actually, they kind of do. I'm just messing with you. <laughs> or am I? Or am I? So far, no bites. Same here. There you go, Travis. Can you send me? 
Okay, uh, Travis. Um, you got uh, where's your phone? What? Hand me your phone. Where I had you fishing, I told him the secret spot. What? I don't know where you're fishing, I told him the secret spot. <laughs> Monty's got a video on his own YouTube, I think. YouTube. And uh, caught a big trout. <laughs> they didn't tell him what he was using for bait. He said secret bait, but he's probably about 15 or 16 in the video. It's secret bait. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. We got another barge coming by for another barge bike. Hopefully, we didn't get one. There you go. That's it. Yeah. Might get a little bit of weight. Yeah. Get a little bit of weight. Yeah. 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 Right here are the GPS coordinates. Okay. Hey, in the mouse. Are you over that one? Uh-oh. We got an echo. You have to turn your sound down. Uh, let's hit your down button. Let me see how that's up there. Yeah, there you go. Always. Speaker it should be. Your other ones. Angel here. Yeah. That should kill it. Yeah, maybe not. Let's see. That other barge is coming up right now. Barge bite. Barge bite. Mid South, everything catfishing is marked. Yeah. Are y'all hearing the echo? I do. Brad Burrett, um, Bull Run Park. How are, how's the sound, guys? Okay, no echo? Okay, cool. That's all right. You're good. There you go. There's Juanita. Hi, hi Juanita. 
She said, fun, fun, fun. How? And she waved. I'd share the weight out to you. Uh, Can y'all see the balloon yet? Let me see. A little bit, okay. So that's probably about the furthest we have of. So that's probably about the furthest that we have one that's out with the balloon. Stacy's not saying much, Rod. Oh, I'm quiet. Not to catch carp. He's going to sneak up on him. He's being quiet. <laughs> it's cold out here. He, he, no, he's, Stacy's, he's all for it. He's been out and I saw ice on the, the water behind him. <laughs> That is true. He was out there for a long time. Is that thing swimming or blowing around? Hey, I got a quick question. How many of us are on the Tennessee River right now? Uh, everybody but oh. Stacy. Stacy, huh? I don't know. This isn't Tennessee River, is it? bottle. This isn't part of the Tennessee River, is it? That bottle right there, oh. it looked like it was getting a bite. You're getting a bite. We're getting a bite. We're getting a bite. We're getting a bite. Get him. Oh, oh. Oh. Did you get him? Got one. Did you get got it? One. We got one. He got him. Got, got it. one. He got one. He's on. Watch out. That thing's about That's to hit that in here. Bottle oh, oh, it's a sniper. It's a big, big wiper. <laughs> it's, a oh, God, it's a big wiper. No way. <laughs> dude, Drop spin it. the bottle. Right here. Dude, that's a fatty. That is true. Dude, he's a perfect hook. Well, Lisa just caught a fish a little over 37. Nice. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The skunk right, is dude. off the toe. It's a fishing Whoa. show, y'all. Nice. Yeah, cool. Night crawler. Hey. Night crawler. Night crawler. He was kind of pulling, like real small, like barely pulling. And I was like, I because the barge just came by, I wasn't sure if it was the way he was not coming loose. Oh man, look at that hook set! Nice, perfect. Yeah, it's a perfect hook set. J hook, that's the J hook, Anthony J hook. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Anthony J <J-hook>. hook. <laughs> what do you think about that, dude? That's a fatty, bro. That is crazy. The first ever fish caught on the bottle contest is a that's white awesome. Of course it is. All right, let's throw them back. I didn't hear the echo. Yeah, it did. It didn't spin. It just it just kind of pulled on the on the uh, actual pole. Huh. We'll just have to keep our eyes out for it to be pulling. Oh, he's gonna get a picture. Hold on. Hold on. This is for bragging rights. Here, I'll take the picture. Also, if somebody could screenshot. Way to go, Gary. Yeah, that's a fat one. Dude, we were just talking about catching wipers. Whoops. We were just talking about catching wipers today on the way here. They count. Way to go, Gary. Sherry said, way to go, Gary. Mom said, way to go. All right, thank you. Gary did, yeah. All right, thank you. Get him back in the water. Turn him for, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, we've got Anthony with bottles out, Gary. All right. All right. Uh, Stacy, right. us and you. So that's not, yeah, that's not bad. 
See you later, Wiper. Five people. Right. Yeah, Anthony's got a guard dog out. Team Paducah on the board. Team Paducah hey, on the board. There's more than just one in there. Yeah, there's more than just one. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's a couple of hands. I was like, doesn't feel like. Come on, Captain Team Tennessee. Tennessee. Dude, that was so that cool. Strikes on it. What do you think about that? We have three states represented. Yeah, we got three states going. Uh, I believe uh, Stacy's in Indiana. Yeah, it was. That's the nicest one I've got in. That's the best one. Lisa's was on a rod. I wish I could get me a 37 pounder. Lisa caught one. I casted that one, by the way. <laughs> Welcome back, BFC cats. That was on night crawl, dude. That was on night crawl. Randy and Lisa, are y'all over next to Yarbury? Uh. Ernest said, awesome, awesome job, my friend. Congratulations. I'm watching from the TV. He said it was awesome. I bet. You're going to video yours? Right. Lisa, I got rid of them hiccups. I had them twice. I got them again when we got back to the house. Tell you what. They about did me in. I'll rethink for you. That was a mess. On the board. On the board. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I went back and listened to a little bit of that, Lisa, where I had them hiccups. Man, it was funny. I sound like I was stuttering. You got another balloon out? I got an idea. Oh, you did put a spiral on. Yeah. It's a tighter spiral. It's a great idea, man. Yeah. I, I got, next time I'll put a little more effort. But it wasn't. Bridge? Yeah. I thought it was. Oh, when I cast it. Well, when I cast it, I hold it. But I don't think I'd ever, I would ever get rid of them hiccups. I kept them a long time last night. Dude, the bottle works. The bottle works. The bottle works. The bottle works. <laughs> All right, he's casting. Gary's, Gary's, going through. Gary's casting. You didn't have any line up. Hey, are you messing with that one, Travis? Are you messing with the balloon? It's going different directions. Don't it look like something's messing with it? Randy said the video will be up later today. I need to catch All a right, big fish. There he's casting. Oh, a lively little creature. Yeah, there it is. It's off here. All right. We got that bottle back out in the water. Awesome. That's about what? Seven, eight pounds white? Seven, eight pounds dropper? <laughs> cool. <laughs> I bet that was fun on the hand line, wasn't it? You should have seen him pull it right in. He hand over handed it right in. He looked at me all spinning. I didn't know what to say. I was like, pull it in, pull it in. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the I, that, I dropped that bottle in the in the water over. 
Oh yeah. And went and grabbed it and grabbed a handful of paint. Oh man. Oh, no. <laughs> all his paint came off. <laughs> Not all of it, but some of it. It's still wet or what? He dropped it in the water. Oh, what do you use? The water base? I use spray paint. I use primer and then I painted the whites with uh, some I, leftover. I just had acrylic yeah. paint. He just had some acrylic oh. paint. He was painting them things at three o'clock this morning. I was like, nope, I am <laughs> laying down. I had to bring mine inside the house because it was too cold. The paint wasn't sitting. <laughs> Like BFC beans. said I'm fishing with rods, so it don't count. Counts for you. <laughs> All right. Anthony's All got right. a rod with a guard yeah. dog in with it. But the hand line caught one first. Is that? Oh, that's a rock. I thought something was boiling. Oh. BFC. He caught one on a pole. Yeah. yeah, we made sure we tested that sucker last night. It was a little bit hard to put up tonight than it was last night, actually. Yeah, we have a few more technical difficulties. But yeah. yeah, a few more rocks. So uh, let's, refresh, let's refresh everything here. What's the score? What the team, team can team Paducah won. Everybody else is big fat goose egg. That's it. You know, whoever wins, you guys got to send me all your bottles. <laughs> <laughs> you actually, Anthony. Actually, Anthony, it, Gary is in the lead. He's part of the team, though. The so dream team. you better catch some. It's like no, oh, no, it's the every man for himself. A, a scrapper. I thought Anthony did. No, that was Gary. Oh, well, no, that was Anthony. Gary. Anthony and caught Bocas. It was my <laughs> bottle. He's throwing himself in the team there now that now that Gary's caught one. <laughs> now it's a team. <laughs> team effort. It's a team effort. Mid South said Cindy going to do a bottle reel giveaway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you want to autograph them. Hey, autograph. An autograph bottle reel. <laughs> Anthony keeps trying to get me to send him an autograph rod and reel. If he'll send me one, I'll sign it and send it back. There you go. Yep. <laughs> It'd be like a rookie card, wouldn't it? <laughs> that's that's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have trading cards made up. <laughs> the rookie card. Oh gosh. Oh, there you go. Pink oh. Distracting and Cincy Whispers. Yep. <laughs> Yeah, I see that word. It come loose right there. That's cool, though. Who done them? Oh, okay. He got like a Sandy is sleeping mid south. It's the middle of the night for her. She was uh, she was in Wednesday nights. But yeah, uh. Let's see what time it is there. 1 30, 2 30, 3 30. Well, she might not might be not be too long before she gets up. It's like 3 30 or 4 30 in the morning for her. Juanita said, I want one when you do Ricky card. Oh. <laughs> I 
You couldn't trade one of my cards for a hook. <laughs> right touch of fishing. Hello, welcome in. If we can catch something today, I might do some sticker giveaways. I can see them. Oh, okay. on the bottle. These bottles have clickers on them. Right, Mintel said sleeping without me. Dang her. Well, you could be sleeping right now. You could keep her schedule if you wanted to. Right, Tessa Fishing. Um, Gary up there on Anthony J. All Day's camera. He caught at about an eight pound striped bass. It was a wiper. It was more of a wiper. It was a wiper. Yeah, hybrid. Wiper, hybrid wiper. wiper. Yeah. A wiper. It's a hybrid. They don't get as big as, even though they got the hybrid name, they don't get as big as stripers, typically. That blue balloon does that. Don't you don't. Yeah. It's kind of all over the place. It's coming against the wind and everything. If I didn't know better, it's where you had a skipjack or something swimming around out there on it. A big <laughs> it ain't big enough to make oh. the balloon go down, is it? Oh, okay. He's getting a bite on his rod. Getting a bite on the rod? Yeah, he's got he's got a little bass rod out there. Is he fishing for catfish on the bass rod? Yeah. Woo! That'd be fun to get. Yeah, everything's on the bottom. Everything's on the. We got what? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six bottles on the bottom. I got the guard dogs on the bottom, and Gary's also got one rod, the bass rod on the bottom. Mansell said, "No BS catfishing, whoever that is." And he dropped your link and said, him, "Tell him Cindy's future ex husband <laughs> Oh, How's it going right touch of fishing? Hey, Mick. What's up, brother Mick and Nick? Mick and Nick. Nick's is, Nick's is, Nick's is uh, lady, Nicole. But they go, they, they say well, Nick. Yeah. And I tell you what, the uh, when you catch it like a channel cat out of here, it's usually pretty big. Yeah. I mean, for a channel cat, yeah. you got some fat yeah. channel cats come out of here. A lot of my... Um, the channel catch you see on my shorts right in here. Channel catch you see on my shorts are almost all out of here. Yeah. Right there. Them fat ones with the grass in their butts. <laughs> Come out of here. Well, we had a good time in Mix uh, Live earlier today, this morning. They're Did on that British time. Yeah, that chat was on fire. It was a good, it was a good show. <laughs> I got to sleep till like a little after nine after playing them games on Sam's channel last night. You know, she didn't, she doesn't let no one else play unless you're on panels. So it's a little boring to watch. Yeah. I suck at them. She let me play one time. I felt so privileged. And never again, though. <laughs> Can you not know, get the link to come up on panel? No. No, she didn't. She didn't. I, I asked her. I don't know if she saw it or not. But, well, but next I time morning, I, I can I, send you. I still watch. I still watch. She always sends it to me. Next time I'll send it to you. Right. It's okay with her. Before she used to put it in the chat, you know, and then you could just. She'll put the link to the game in chat, but she'll never put her link. Yeah, yeah. I meant the game link. That's what I. Yeah. Mean. Yeah. Yeah. She just don't do that. I'll send I'm it in, to you if I've got your messenger, but I won't drop mine in chat either. I, I uh, normally I fell asleep. I fell asleep with it on, actually. Now, Red was playing it when he wasn't on panel last night, but I think that's after you left or went to sleep. Mucky Mick said, "Hey, you guys, I'm watching." All right, Mick. 
mix out there banging out them big old curps and whatnot over in England. I believe it's Mick T. Mick T said it's 6 40 p.m. here in the UK. I'm just popping a, a bottle of Stella Artois listening in. Stella Artois. I think I, I, think I got a bite. Whoop. Uh oh. Well, small pool. Spin that bottle, fish. Yeah, spin it. Small water charters. Uh, hey, John. The team What's from Paducah, uh, Kentucky. Gary has a. He caught it about an eight pound wiper. A wiper. A wiper. Strapper wiper. 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 Is it the one on Gary's the right? Famous. Yep, on the right. Yeah. That's Gary's favorite too, by the way. <laughs> What's the run across through there? Yeah. Spin it. You know why they say wiper? Because it's you know half half white bass, half striped bass. So that's why they call it half striper. So that's why it gets the name wiper. That's why you call them wipers. Yeah. Um, he stepped back down, so I guess we'll take it off solo. Yeah. Oh. Bite, fish, bite. There is a load of mix in here today. That's the red worm. Come on, red worm, do your magic. Yeah, don't close Rod, that. Rod's Fishing Adventure said, get him, Stacy. Yeah. Gary almost clotheslined himself on one of on one of the bottles. <laughs> <laughs> Now that would be, we'd have to go back, go back and pull that one up. He, he, he caught it just in time, though. There's <laughs> limbo under it, man. I only caught one fish, but we caught a Gary. Well, that might know. Take click on the link. Yeah. Probably somebody when you drop the cat. It doesn't mean to watch the live either. Uh, where are you guys at? Are you guys on Fort Lousy? No. Nope. We're on uh Clinch River. On the Clinch? On the Clinch. We're in actually some backwater creek that goes onto the Clinch. Oh. I can see both your bottles perfect from here. I can't Banks see your pole though. Banks got the best one out of all of us. This bottles look yeah. like neon. Yeah, you can see his uh, bottles real good. That's a vicious line. Vicious. Yeah, you can see. We've got that neon yellow line, but you just can't see ours real well. I think it's because of the hottest of uh, Stacy's bottle. Oh, oh my God. God. Stacy got happened? one on. Oh, fish on. Get him, fish on. Woo. I think I got him. Yeah. Fish on. Spin the bottle. Spin the bottle. <laughs> What's he got? <laughs> Woohoo! There he is, oh, Blue Gill. Get him, get him. <laughs> right. Mate, mate. Oh, we got there a bait, bait, baby. <laughs> Woo. Hey, give us the give us the Anthony for bait. <laughs> no, there, there you go. Here I am back out there. More luck than I've had on rod and reel, baby. Man, that's, <laughs> that's nice more luck than he's had on rod and reel, he said. Thank you, Anthony. Good. Oh my there god, you go. I catch nothing. <laughs> I now the pressure's eight, on for Team Tennessee. I still, got like, I still got eighteen. I still got eighteen bluegills frozen, man. I don't know what to do with them. I might just feed them to the birds. Hey, Anthony loves bluegill. <laughs> My gosh. <laughs> Dude, I tried them every way. The only thing I haven't tried using them for bait is cooking them and using them for bait. <laughs> Mid South said that's a three pound gill if Anthony's was eight pounds. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't catch it. Listen, it's got a, a cool, like, uh, Christmas decoration up there at night, too, like a power thing that's lit up. 
That was pretty cool. That tug where you guys went down uh, when you went on that, where you went the other day, where that tug we had all them Christmas lights going. Yeah. Yeah, I was down on Chicken Marble. Yeah, that's the one where we drove two hours and skunked. <laughs> no. Dang it. <laughs> Sherry said, way to go, Stacy. Thank you. Rod said, I've caught some huge blue cat on blue kills. Uh, somebody asked a minute ago if we had blue cats and uh, flatheads on the clinch. Um, yeah, we've seen a flathead come out of right here. We normally catch more um, channel cats here, but they're big channel cats. Oh, I got a mess. Just need one to bite now. Yeah. We got two balloons and two regular lines out there. I think there's something on that balloon. Oh, it's been moving real odd. What do you got on the balloon? You got what? You got something live on it? I don't think it's live, is it? It's chicken liver on. That's chicken That's liver. Sure. Some kind of construction barn. Come on, we got to put Team Tennessee on the board, Travis. You don't feel nothing on it? That was on regular good old night crawlers, the, the one we got. And night Stacey, crawlers. You're using, Stacey, you're using corn? That was uh, red worm. Oh, red worm. Okay. Yeah. Worms for the win today. Worms. Worms. Worms so far. <laughs> Somebody's wasting ammo. They got catfish in that pond now, Stacy. Bullheads. Hey, that's a catfish, brother. Yep, bullheads. If, if I ever catch one. Is it uh, them yellow bullheads? I think so. Man, Sal yep. said, I posted Anthony's link and he caught a fish. I posted BFA's link and he caught a fish. So, Travis, get her done. Get her done. He's posting He's posting. Uh, posting your link now. Time for some action. For real, though. I want to see a bottle spin. <laughs> we want that bottle spin, baby. For real though. Spin the bottle. Kiss your fish. Oh man, Gary, you didn't kiss your fish. Youngest one was oh. oh, it's got a weight on it. Nick said, I don't eat corn. I avoid anything that stays in you or can lick its own arse. Oh, and it still comes out the same. Way. Comes out whole. Uh, it's magic. Corn is magic. Sam M. Rogers said, Anthony J. all day. Let's go. There was rats in the water, Anthony, bro. Oh, Nick is a vegan. That we get the same thing. I think that some of them are even foreign. And then there's kids. Oh, yeah. I get them all the time. Some of them will just have the letters. Backlash. Oh, no. Backlash. Oh, God. Tornado. Tornado blew through Knoxville. under the bridge. I bet that was a trip. It's supposed to just be a small shower thing to do, you know? A red away from the bridge. You almost said soy boy, but didn't mean to be mean to be rude. But you did say soy boy, Mid South. 
Come beat him, Mick. Then the next one is that Then the guard dog. He said, don't swear at me. I ain't no vegan. I'm eating lamb kebabs as we speak. <laughs> oh, uh, before yesterday? Yesterday. Everyone I put out bombed. Bombed. I don't feel the odds. I just... That thing helps, but it ain't the end all be all. Um, yes, Jonathan. Um, Gary was Anthony J all day. Team Kentucky. They caught a a striper or wiper hybrid. And then um Stacy down there on the bottom caught a Pretty good size for you, Gil. So this is a fishing show. There are fish on it. It's a cold day, though. I'll let you know that. I'd be sitting in a car if it wasn't for having this shelter. I mean, having the wind is a lot of... A lot of be said for just having the wind knocked off of you when we when we put this thing up last night before we put the heater under here uh i mean you could tell the difference when you stepped around under here just because the wind wasn't cutting into you well, listen i don't believe in being uncomfortable if you don't have to be now if you have to be then that that's so be it but if you're in a place where you can throw up a shelter real quick you stay out longer. <laughs> you know, though, I'm one of the people that gets cold and stays cold. I'll be home two hours later and still be froze. I, I, parts of me don't warm back up. So how's it going, Rich? I, I thought you might be out fishing today. Sorry, I didn't say hi. I was just reading your comment. I was I was explaining to Gary how the guard dog works. He's never seen one. He's uh, oh, okay. thoroughly, thoroughly impressed. He likes it a lot. Yep. And uh, if you're not sure how it would benefit you, if you'll go back and read Mid South's little limericks, <laughs> he can tell you. <laughs> And you know, uh, somebody's asked if the clinch went into the Tennessee River. They probably all eventually go in together at some point. I'm just Did not exactly sure how that works. They all headed towards the Gulf. <laughs> when in doubt, guard dog it out. <laughs> Guard puppy. I need to come out with one for kids called the guard puppy. Right. The guard puppy for the little Snoopy rods. <laughs> for, yeah, for them little dog demons. Right. Jack <laughs> Claus got a video out. He, he got a, he got a setup for the guard dog. And um, you know how when you ice fish, you kind of jig them in the hole? Uh -huh. You kind of jig them. He's got it to where he's got the guard dog on it, and he's made a machine to where it does an automatic jigging. So you can just steady stay drinking when you're ice fishing. You know, you're not jigging just, them. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Nick like said, here in the UK, we don't get a DUI for riding lawnmowers. LOL. Don't make me shrink your dungarees, mid south vegan. It's more offensive than French than, than being French. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna get you. <laughs> this is it right here. This is Tennessee Hilton right here, fishing Hilton. Clinch goes into Mountain Hill, then walks far, then Chickamauga, which is part of Tennessee. See, there you go. Answer to the question. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
Riverette said 49 subs to 500. Is that what you like, Riverette? Ernest? And Anthony J. Also, if if there's anybody in here that doesn't happen to be sub to Anthony or everything catfishing, go give them a like and a sub. We like we all like to have fun, and we do a lot of fishing. So give them a sub. Randy said, "Mark, we needed your net today." <laughs> Right. Meg said, we call ice fish and crackle donking. Puff Muffin said, I'm subbed to both. Also, uh, Stacy could use some subs too. I think he's got his, he's monetized, but you can always use him subs. Get you out there further. And I believe, uh, Mark over here, everything catfishing, I think he gets to do a lot of his fishing on Mondays and Tuesdays. Um, but look for him. He gets out and fishes a lot. And he could use them watch hours also. <laughs> hey, hey. How are you doing on watch hours, Stacy? I'm good. Okay. If you the, the secret to them watch hours is is just go live consistently. Even if you don't go live a lot, go live consistently. You know. If you can manage a couple of lives a week, it'll keep your watch hours up. Once you get them, already got them. Yep. Not that I mean it wasn't too far. It lasted pretty good, but still. Mid South said the secret to watch hours is getting watched. Well, that's that's true. And you're not gonna get yeah, you're not gonna get watched if you're not out there being live. I don't watch TV. So I'm always looking for a live to watch. I mean, I watch a little bit of TV if I'm at Travis's, but typically I don't watch TV a lot. Men's South? And you like it. <laughs> he said, I feel a peg. <laughs> and he likes it. Okay, Rich, be careful. Thanks for coming in. Matt, look, I'm on my way out. I went to the candy pool last weekend. I think the wind's blowing your styrofoam out a little bit. Now look at the red blowing it's going back on your Isn't that weird? I can tell spider. I wonder if the current's pulling that way. So the wind's the current's fighting the wind. I don't know what's going on. I don't know said, I put out a video just a year ago. But it was a well. <laughs> Lance, thanks for coming back in. Everybody have a happy new year. It's going to be here before we know it. Yeah. Yeah, we got uh, some of the other sticks are beavers. They were beaver wood. You see all the bark's been bitten off it, gnawed off. Awesome. You know? so they even know, leave it sharpened in, don't they? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Well, it's pretty good. Like, I pushed it all the way down, and yeah. the stick is holding it up here. You know, and, well, and they always awesome. strip the bark off. They strip the bark off so you know, your wood gets, you know, the wood's always a little harder. You know, <laughs> get some really good hard wood, you know what I mean? <laughs> That's the secret to a good stick. It's hard wood. That's hard wood, man. Hard wood. <laughs> you got fish on or no? Hey, uh, no. They're using a, a stick to the beaver cut down. So it's got a sharpened end on it already, and the bark's all been stripped off of it. It's team effort. Beavers and hard wood, they just go together. 
Right. Beavers and Sticks. Beavers and Sticks. This fishing trip brought to you by Beavers. The authority on the wood. Contact your local right. beaver and he'll hook you up. Jonathan said, Ann, Tony's out of here. Blaine <laughs> said, I've been here, Cindy, just swapping rods and reels around for tonight. Are you going to be fishing tonight on your show? Who? No, that's tomorrow night. My bad. You going fishing tonight for, for Burbo? Burbo? Bourbon. Bourbon. Would you say Burbo? Burbo. 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 Listen. That sounds like bourbon. It's almost spelled like bourbon, except for the T, there's an N. I mean, except for the end, there's a T. Yeah, and R. <laughs> he ought to name one of his show Bourbon and Bourbon. Right. After hours, <laughs> fishing for bourbon. <laughs> oh, no. Go oh, now, meow. Oh, yeah. That's the one that was uh, back there with us, wasn't it? Off the drop, though. Right. Lance said, I'll be live at seven today. Bourbon. Bourbon. <laughs> we'll call it BBB. Bullets, bourbon, and bourbons. There you go. Oh. Jonathan said, Bourbon, what? <laughs> okay, Mid South said, I have a couple of stupid questions. One, if saltwater reels are sealed against water, why aren't the internals lubed against using an oil bath, kind of like gear oil? Why aren't the internals lubed using an oil bath, kind of like gear oil? There are they is, not? They use, they use grease. But they the should. grease eventually wears out. BFC Cad said, "I got a hundred subs. You got enough to go live." Yeah. Okay. Mid South's number two question is: Has anyone removed the level wine system from a bait caster? And if so, how did it affect casting distance? Have you ever removed a level wine from a bait catcher? Does it, uh, have you ever took it, taken one off? <laughs> and yep. does it affect casting distance? Oh, it definitely uh, affects the casting distance. So how do you work it out? <laughs> when you're reeling it, you got to move the back. Yeah, you just got to know yourself when you reel it back. I could not do that. It definitely affects casting distance. Uh, That's what Catfish Dave does, doesn't it? Yeah. Hey, can you put down, can you put down full screen real quick? Well, when he bank fish, he did. There you are. Okay. Me and Gary, we got we got we got a couple of nice beverages real oh, quick oh, here. You got that? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Anyway, cheers! Happy New Year's, everybody! Happy New Year's! Happy New Year! Right. They'll match. <laughs> good, good. Boy, these things are cold. Good and cold. They just toasted in the New Happy Year. New Year. <laughs> Happy New Year's! Let's catch some more fish. Let's catch Happy some more New fish. Year. It's all I just want to see start going nuts. online. Yeah, I'm, I'm working the more evening. Try to play this spin the bottle. Rod said, uh, Finn and Daiwa make reels without level wine. Yeah, I think, to the best of my knowledge, Catfish Dave uses uses a... He, he used to. I he don't used know to when he fished yeah, in the bank. I doubt he does. Yeah, he's the boat, he probably no, I, I still see his thumb moving around on them reels when he's reeling in. Yeah, he can cast a mile. Travis said you well, do not want to be fishing next to him because he will outcast you. Oh, he's going to outfish you. <laughs> well, he's he's, he's, he's going to throw in deeper water. 
He's still a mile, too. Travis can flat fling one out. But can he bottle fish is the question. <laughs> can he bottle fish? Would he bottle fish is the question. <laughs> Lance said an open face is far superior to a level wine because a level wine is like a governor on a vehicle. Yeah, I see, but see, even a level wine still casts out farther than a spinning rod. Hey, Mid South said, Anthony, why aren't you using the case of personalized Bud Light you were sent? Bud <laughs> Well, they didn't put the HSK team logo on it, so I couldn't endorse it. You know what I mean? There you go. It stands for a huge money catch. This we're we're on um we're on uh, fish angler app. There's like ninety of us. Yeah, Lisa, post a link to your video. Was that your personal best at thirty-seven? Oh, that's a nice one. You got it today, Lisa. Yeah, that was our that was our big thing. Huh? Oh. She just uploaded it. She said so. Told her to drop a link. He still uses a dial without level wine. That's what I think um, he uses the Rod said. Does he use the habit too? Oh, are you not a lot? I thought I made you a mod last night. You're slacking. I know it. I'm always just about half put together anyway. <laughs> hey, was Anthony oh, on full screen? Was Anthony on full screen? Because I'm the man. He keeps telling me to put him on full screen, then I forget. There you go. He ain't gonna catch nothing. Here we go. Solo layout. This is a. Uh, <laughs> this is, come closer. This is Lisa's personal best. Come closer. Closer. Nice. There you go. She uh, just got it today, guys. Dang, that's, awesome. that's a nice one. Yeah, that's it. Sweet. So what? We've been live for two hours, and we got a bluegill and a uh, white. <laughs> that's better yeah. than the last. Couple of fishing trips. Better than the last couple of fishing trips I've had. <laughs> Stacy caught a stick earlier. Woo! Stick. <laughs> stick <laughs> fish. That's a favorite uh, for beavers. You can get, you can get you, you can attract a nice beaver with a nice stick. Yeah, he wasn't in no bush. <laughs> he oh. can. It wasn't a bush. Wasn't a bush beaver. <laughs> and when I come in, I'm gonna get absolutely nothing. BFC said, <laughs> "When I come must, in, must, when I come, I'm gonna get absolutely nothing." Well, that's what we're catching so far. Beaver. Must have been some bratty beavers. Bratty beavers, yeah. Um, it was almost 38 pounds. 37 point something, I think. Rod. Congratulations, uh, Lisa. That's a beast. 37.75. That's right up here next to my personal beds. I'm afraid to check the lines because I don't, I don't want to snag any of them. I don't want to snag any of them. Yeah, getting hung is going to be a problem with these. Right. <laughs> hey, Dominic Hollis. What's going on? Oh, he's welcome in. Why is Dominic not up here with Anthony? Yeah. Bottle fishing? I don't know. I heard it does good. He was just sick. Yeah. He said, Travis, howdy, brother. Where you doing? <laughs> she said it was too big for their dip net. <laughs> <laughs> I got a few on that line that I 
work for it. That's why it's been tattered up. And so I said, perhaps the reason Cindy hasn't caught a fish is I haven't dropped her link. So. <laughs> now, bottle spin. Spin bottle. Lisa said we needed Mars. <laughs> Yeah, we've been so good talking about more. Yeah, yeah. Fuck y'all did a good job. Yeah, y'all ain't yeah, in it. On the boat. Get up there next and get down there and grab that thing by the mouth. Get <laughs> that boat stuck. They all hey, slip. Uh, hey, we are not. They're just uh, giving it the old wind up and pitch. I posted a short while I was live. I'm good, but I ain't that good. It's out. <laughs> Where at? Where? Where at? Huh. I remember they uh oh, they shut they shut the gate on Dave over and he went over the bush come <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna move it. I'm gonna move it. Okay. I see the gray one the other day. Oh, the gray? Yeah. yeah. I said, yeah, it's probably one. I think they, all, they may have all got new trucks. I don't know why they're gray. They probably just probably changed the color up on them. You wouldn't come to visit us? I was going to say, wouldn't it be funny if they come down here and said it was illegal? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Yeah, that would be crazy. I'd be like, what? They'd be like, no, you can bottle fish, just not in the park. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the bottle's like a reel. I know, for real. I'd be like, man, I can't afford a reel. <laughs> We're trying to catch supper. Got to go broke out here. I don't see, I don't see any problem here in Kentucky because it's pretty much wide open oh. for fishing. We don't even have a limit on rods here in Tennessee, so yeah, same here. Lisa said, "Caught on my mad cat ghost." Now my goblin needs to get a hit. Yeah. I caught a piece somewhere. I used to like to be through nothing. They run us off and went to the uh, Concord Park. Yeah. During the summer. Where I took that point. That's a channel rat. Uh, channel rat? Yeah, I figured we would have had a couple channel rats by now. I know. I can't believe we haven't caught one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. For everybody, even. I think we ought to put out a rod or two. I was not expecting <laughs> Come on, Stacy. Oh. <laughs> You're so quiet. <laughs> Reading my butt off. Yeah. I looked at the forecast. And it's not supposed to really get much warmer in the next in the foreseeable future. So I guess we're going to have to get used to fishing in this. 
Maybe if it'll stay like this for a while, the fish will settle down and start biting again. Dominic said uh, to ask you, Anthony, when you want to go to invade Tennessee. I think he's away from the bottle. <laughs> away from the bottle? I think Anthony stepped away from the bottle. Yeah, step away from the bottle, Anthony. He's got the can today. Oh, that's right. He's got the can fish. Well, he drank the, the Budweiser so fast, I'm pretty sure he might have had to go take care of something. <laughs> <laughs> it runs right through you. With, you went to visit the beaver tree. I'm shaking a bush. That red one is still going to be fast in it. I mean, it seems it, it my way over here all the way over. Yep. Moving around. I guess they could be sucking that much water out of it. Well, the other one was hanging out and going that direction. The blue one was. Pretty much just staying still. Something may be pushing and raining. I think it's on the bottom now. I don't know. No, that's like it's going back to the wrap. Oh, fishies. Did your lady get hot? Yeah, I'll get warm a little Okay, because my toes aren't. Hey, uh, Anthony. He's still gone. Wow. Dang. Are you able to see the guard dog on my line with slack? Hey, see. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can see it. See, he had a bird on his line. A guard dog. Oh. He's on got the a ball. pole. Oh, he's got a pole out. BFC said, I'm going to go, but I'll be there soon. Dominic said, Lisa Swank, congratulations and howdy, howdy. Hey, what's up, Dominic? Hey, Anthony. You know where he we're wanted at, to know. Come on by. He wanted to know whenever you, uh, when you were wanting to invade Tennessee. Dominic said, wants to know when you're ready to invade Tennessee. As soon as possible. You heard it, Dominic. Hey, Bud Files. We'll just go. So, we'll, we'll we'll take your boat from right here, and we'll go all the way up till we reach Skipjack Cindy and everybody else up there. <laughs> Let's keep going. We got to visit the Alabama folk too, because it swings down there. <laughs> They've been eating on that bottom piece, Mark. Good dang it. Stubborn fish. Oh, this bottle started to spin and scared the pool out of me. Hey, you got to hold up it again. He keeps doing that. Walking across through there. Then turn coming back to visit. Oh, is that what he does? Pull some line off of it and leaves it on the little on the stick. That's it. Dominic said, I'm mobile now. All right. Oh, when you get a truck, you get your new whip. And Gary lives in Tennessee. He lives over by Clarksville. He knows all the spots over there. We can go over there anytime, he said. <laughs> wow. 
He's clean it out there. But that, looks, that braid is alive. Like, these things look like tiki lights, man. I'm telling you. They do look like tiki lights. His is tall. Stacy's kind of tall, too. Ours is short. Mine's like up it's okay, to my, though. Mine's just below my chin. Ours it's touching really the ground cool. is Greg. Yeah. <laughs> Our bottles touch the ground, so it's Greg. Hang him he low. Said it's, he bought a 2006 Jeep Commander, and it's road ready. Oh, wow. The Commander. That's a BFC nice said, see ya. Go on, Commando. Uh oh, he's Commando. <laughs> Go, you better not pick me up, going Commando. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Tone, jump in. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> We're going balls out, literally. <laughs> All the way to Tennessee, baby. All the way to Tennessee. Oh, go. That'd be a great thumbnail. Paul's out. <laughs> hey, Freddie, you always come into my life at the weirdest times. <laughs> you see our, our fancy fishing reels? Look what we've been resorted to. Look what we've resorted to using. You see these fancy tiki lights? They catch fish, believe it or not, and right. they keep it. Uh, the they keep the mosquitoes away at the same time. Tiki tiki lights that catch fish, and I didn't get a rod and reel for Christmas. I got a bottle online. <laughs> What's up, Tyler? Now, Juanita, uh, um, Stacy also caught a bluegill. The other day, Tyler. It's all about sagging or dragging her balls out, huh? Freddie, we were talking about um, Dominic just bought a uh, Jeep right now, Commander. People in Tennessee and Indiana. And he said something about coming to Tennessee, and Tony told him not to come commando. This is Tyler. This is Gary. Gary, Tyler, Tyler, Gary. Dominic said, balls out with the windows down. <laughs> Second day and her balls out. Rod said, I'm dying over here, Anthony. Juanita said, bah ha ha, homemade at that. Dominic said, F away, howdy, howdy, brother. Juanita, did you see that Lisa caught her personal best today? I guess you already know, but it's it was awesome. I'd like for y'all to check out my Coke bottle reel custom. Yeah, we're live right now. It's got that fancy ground drag. <laughs> what is he walking away over there? Yeah, I was like, wait a minute. Is he running and, and, and throwing it? Oh, oh okay. <laughs> Red is somehow in the news, I think. Will. Great job, Lisa. All of our lines are, are are headed in that direction. So I'll probably I'll have to step out of the little shelter if one gets on. I'd like hey, to get something this on this little uh hey, hey, it'd be big cool. Tea. Here, get cool. That's Big T. Hey. I just met him the other day. He's on YouTube. He just started his channel. And uh, he came down here poking around. He said, I can't believe it's you guys down here. I didn't I didn't think anybody would be down here. Anthony J all day. <laughs> yeah. Anthony J all day. Oh yeah. Nice to meet you. You too. That's good Jack Cindy. She's famous in Tennessee, believe it. <laughs> Today's today's theme is bottle fishing. First time. 
If you need a fish with a stick and need a rod that won't quit, <laughs> FOA Customs and Gear. Guard dog on that one. Oh, I see. Yeah, I see. Wow, you did that at Falls River. Yeah, well, exactly. one uh, I need the fish to do the other part. I haven't caught in no damn fish. Here he goes. Hang on. Mark's, Mark's winding up for the cast. And wind up and swing. Oh, dang it. It tangled around your leg, Mark. <laughs> dang it. It happens. That was a swing and a miss. I don't call him striking for nothing, he said. <laughs> well, Nita, he didn't hook his leg. He just got in the, he got his leg in the line. So it wrapped around there and didn't go nowhere. I think he lost his bait, too. She said, oh, babe, what the hell? <laughs> he thought you hooked your leg. He hit the ground, I think. On the last uh, round there. It went, it wrapped around his leg. I saw it wrapped around his leg. Huh. I thought he was getting ready to go a long ways, too. He had it going. Now it's in the grass tank, but I think you might have to pull it out. <laughs> a swing and a miss. Oh, oh, line to pull off of it. Back the further it'll go. <laughs> he said bloopers are supposed to be at the end of filming, babe. Yeah. That's what happens when you got live TV. You have no control over the bloopers. <laughs> I'm about to scoop a couple of these chicken livers out of here with my fingers and pull them out there. <laughs> Those are only a dollar at the dollar store. <laughs> I hope we get the opportunity to find out. What new Robin? It just felt like She said, she said it's too early for that yet. <laughs> bloopers, yeah. I don't think it's ever too early for bloopers for me. Sometimes I start out that way. You just have to watch out for the little rut. Otherwise, it's not going to be a little rut coming up. So, right here. Yeah. Oh, fish. Are you still wanting the line up? Uh, Chris said, I know there's a three rod, rod limit in Indiana, but what is the bottle limit? <laughs> That's a good question. Ask your local game warden. Say, I know that there's a. I bet they give a kick out. Huh? You know, what do you mean a bottle limit? Travis, you need to do a little filming, a little video, a little video of our little bottle array there so we can do shorts and marks too. We did this thing today. <laughs> this is what we did today. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's out there. <laughs> he's, he's not going to... <laughs> He's not gonna be either happy till he gets it way. Hey, a long way yeah, he's not gonna catch a fish out there. Hey, uh, you wanna go? You wanna put me on screen? Getting a bottle bite. Getting a bottle bite. 
Uh, uh, Anthony, bottle I think. Bottle. bottle bite. Bottle bite. Chris said, uh, or no, Lisa said, bottle limit is when you're too drunk to fish. <laughs> bottle bite. I'm going to make you full screen. Five or six bottles. <laughs> That'd be funny, wouldn't it? Oh, Roll it down. <laughs> oh, I feel it. He can feel it. It's oh, he can feel it. Bob, you feel the bottle in his thing. He pulled the bottle up off the thing. He's he's got the he's got the pole and reel in his hand. Let me mess up. He yanks it out of his hand. hand. Don't let it yank like it out of your whack. hand. I feel like I'm gonna whack myself in the face <laughs> if I pull this thing. <laughs> Walk backwards. That's it. Like run, run. <laughs> Men run self said Anthony adjust the drag. I just adjusted it. <laughs> I think he just did adjust the drag. He's got tension on it. It's him against the fish. Who's gonna win? Is that worms you're fishing with on that one? Yeah, that's nightcrawler on this one. Nightcrawler. Let's see that hook set. Juanita said her too drunk to say let's fish. <laughs> Mid-South said if you need a jingle, call a fat, ugly guy that's single. Mid-South jingles. You are not single. <laughs> you're not you're not ugly, you're fat either. Stop it. Right when I right when I thought there was no bite, I gave you a little You're rotund. Get him, Anthony. I gotta know. They keep slacking. It's coming at you. Hey, Piggy Spittles. Welcome in. Piggy! Oh. Man, what is that? It's so small. All right, Tyler. <laughs> is it still a... Is Tyler leaving? Yeah, it keeps it keeps coming in, real, real, real small. Like the bite, he's biting this towards the shore. <laughs> Lance said, "Reel down quick, Anthony." <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Uh oh, uh oh, this is ridiculous. <laughs> it's not as easy as it looks, huh? It is not. It is not. <laughs> he said, "This is ridiculous." It keeps pulling towards the shore. It's weird. I got a feeling. I got a feeling. I'm just. Well, Nita said, it. "Roll down. Don't reel down. Roll down. <laughs> roll up. Roll up. Roll it. Roll out. Roll out." <laughs> All right. Well, you can take you can take me off the big screen here. We're gonna put it back. Okay. If your name is Eileen and you want to get jiggy, get undressed and call a piggy. <laughs> hey, Chris wants to know if that's a medium heavy bottle. That is. Oh crap. <laughs> that didn't work out. Overhand it, Travis. <laughs> we got a stick. And we have a stick. All right. The first ever stick. Or no, no actually, Stacy caught a stick earlier. That's right. That's right. Okay, well, that almost was exciting. That chicken liver ain't cutting it. Cut a piece of this star, the chicken chicken. Chicken oh, chicken. Oh, there you go. It's chicken chicken. It's chicken chicken. It's kicking chicken. We should have, should have soaked it. There's Stacy with the cast. He threw across the pond. Ah, he's on the other side. <laughs> hey, Oki Grower. What's up, Oki? 
Piggies, Piddle, Eileen's Please. show is today. What's it, Saturday? Eileen's running her show. Uh, I think it's it's usually six o'clock my or I think it's six o'clock my time. I'm central. Lisa said that's no, I think that's called basswood. <laughs> She's laying down. She said to tell everyone hi. Eileen. Hi, Eileen. Eileen. Rod uh, said, better check your bait. That fish might have stolen your worm. Well, I got, oh, oh, I'm getting a bite on it again. Hold on. Right, you know, I got over under, I got two hooks on it. Yeah, this is the over under. He's got two hooks on there. So if he, he don't have bait on one, he'll have bait on the other. Yep. He's got a medium heavy uh, reel. It's a Gatorade bottle. <laughs> I got medium heavy. There's 30 pound test with a 50 pound liter. <laughs> 30 pound test with a 50 pound liter. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, Travis. <laughs> the man who can cast a mile is having trouble. I think you need a bigger hook. P uh, Piggy said, uh, yep, 6 p.m. Central. <laughs> 7 p.m. Eastern. If your bottle is spinning but you still ain't winning, Guard Dog Pro. <laughs> Arru. 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 All right. All right. All right, all right. We need to come out with a with a pitching device, Travis. <laughs> pitching device. Yeah, let's think about this. I, you know, I tell you what, out. let's put the rod out. holder up. We can't, but then put it on top of a pole and bend that pole way back and let it go like a catapult. Uh, that's exactly. I already have an idea how to use the guard dog with the bottle fishing. I'm going to come up with it. In the next couple days. <laughs> He's gonna, gonna come up with a way to use the garden dog and bottle fishing. I already got it in mind. Uh, it, it, in my mind, it works really good. It's already caught a 60 pounder. In my mind. <laughs> in my mind, it works really good. You want me to hold that down? That, that bottle. <laughs> Mid South said, I kind of ragged on the guard dog one night and I'm trying to atone. Yeah. You guys haven't had any bites or nothing, huh? Not much, so, no. Y'all got to play catch up. No, Bank and I'll tell you here. what. Mark is getting out there a mile. He used a. Uh, uh, Braid, and I think that lighter line is allowing him to like really throw it out there. How much weight? How much weight? Are you one ounce on one and two ounce on the other? Yeah, I'm using twos myself. Woo! That one went. <laughs> it was exciting to watch a bottle spin, though. That's the most action that bottle's had all day. Bottle spin, bottle spin, baby. Uh, Piggy Diddles, uh, uh, BFA is Bank Fishing and, uh, Adventures. Yeah, he's out of Indiana, and he does a lot of, he's got a pond that he fishes in. And I think he does crappie fishing and cat fishing. It's not a matter of thinking, he does. <laughs> Mid South said, This one is bad, so I apologize in advance. And then he goes ahead and says it. When Aline wants to do it, she calls Piggy's Piddles. Right. 
shirts. Oh, share some links out there for everybody. Y'all can uh, subscribe to them. Click on it. Click subscribe. Don't even have to click the live. Stay in the live. Stacy, kind of quiet over there, Stacy. I'll get there. Get ready. <laughs> Yeah, feel free to talk. I'll hush. And I'll make Anthony hush. I'll meet him if I have to. Oh. <laughs> Not sure 1 800 Rena Fish can come up with a jingle for that dingle. <laughs> a jungle for that dingle. If the bottle's spinning, then you're winning. That's right. Buddy, just tell me and I'll talk to your link and post it. Someone hey, dropped uh, BF, someone dropped BFA's uh, link for Piggy. Ellings. And I do, yeah. Yeah. She does like she does awesome trivia uh, in the evening, and I really thoroughly enjoy the show. It's a great conversation. Ellen's kitchen, I think hers is. Yeah. Piggy, are you a? Uh... Piggy said, "I'm out of luck. I ain't even got a bottle to spin." Hey, Don R. Buck Williams. Don R. What's up, Don R. Our road. Guard dog. Guard dog. We got a guard dog on my rod over here. Though. I don't know if you can see it. Got our put a guard dog on it. A rope. Rod's fishing said Stacy's in it to win it. Ain't got time to talk, Anthony. Ain't got time to talk. We got bottles to spin. He's like so far down the bank. He's trying to catch some smallmouth bass down there. I'm gonna have to take over his uh, bottles. Are you about to cast, uh, Stacy? Yep. Stack with beer can over here. Hey, we got beer can sticks, bluegills, and wipers. There you All go. Right. That was a good cast, Stacy. All right. All right. I lost my bottle. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Almost spooled the bottle. <laughs> Travis did that a minute ago when he threw that one in. Uh oh. He didn't pull off enough line and dang near spun the bottle off the stick. Let's pull the bottle. Pull the bottle. Buck Williams said, I got great northern beans, green beans, onions, ham, sliced taters, and the crock pot. Ooh. And now it's an, official, it's an official laugh because somebody talked about food. Yeah. <laughs> it's official. Well, we're cooking fish. There we go, got it. Woo. I'm a John said, "Still sway from home. Rain, rain, rain here in Washington State." Mid South said, "If you want to avoid hooking a fish in the gut but can't seem to get off your butt, guard dog pro." <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, everybody wants to see Cindy throw it out. <laughs> cast it, cast it, Cindy. Did I try? <laughs> Try throwing it out. Yeah, no. I don't think so. It's about his life, but you still want to fight. Guard dog pro. Oh, bro. Aline's got some beef stew in hers. It's been in the freezer. She's going to cook it up some more. Mm -hmm, good. Man. What? Bust out these sandwiches here. I'm talking about all this food. So I'm willing to try to throw it, but 
thought he'd throw my shoulder out. Got a bad rotator cuff. We got. We found BFC some, said uh, I'm finally on my way. Get anything else? There's a short nosed gar carcass. Yeah, we found uh this little guy. Oh, that's cool. The Whoa, head bro. is. <laughs> that's a that's a that's a guard dog. The whole gator. bank is littered with uh silver carp bones, and I found a little short nosed gar skull. You don't find them in one. Got all the round holes from the bottle. Uh oh. Yeah, you did see a post on Evolution. All right, hey, I, I gotta, I'm gonna recast this bottle if you wanna. All right. Go big screen. We're going big. Here we go. Hello, fishing with Domingo. About cross every time. About cross. Oh, I almost threw all the line out here. <laughs> cross every line there was. I think you're good. I think we're good. We'll just leave it there. <laughs> nice. That one sailed. <laughs> Mark's got a damn fat now. He does. He can really fling it out there. Mark just threw it out and he went a, a mile. Get it. He put some weight on it. He said he put the gloves on next time out about cut his finger. Yeah, you thought you had, yeah. Looks like a good product. I I think it'd be really excellent for people who are like uh have mobility issues and aren't gonna be able to get up and run to the rod. You know, if it'll go ahead and hook them. Give them a minute to get there. Oh god, it did cut you. I had about, uh, I had 30 pound braid uh, on the back of a boat get mine, four of them. <laughs> she, grabbed a, she grabbed a rod. Yeah. John Parker's a perfect candidate for the guard dog from itself. Oh. I thought he was getting a bite. Cause his, because his uh, styrofoam spun, but it was a win. Oh. And Sal said right. he can't fish worth the except he can't fish worth the lick. It's it's not that he can't fish, it's the fish don't cooperate. There ain't no fish in there. Buck said, Piggy, that's just for supper in seven hours. I'm doing cheese steak with onions, mushrooms, and bacon cheese for lunch. Dang y'all eat good. <laughs> like the river bread, it takes me a minute to get to the rod. Look, I have a catfish kiss. Wonderful. <laughs> it's been a long time since I had a... Feels like it's been a long time since I had a scar on my hand for my catfish. I was happy to get it last night. I was like, <laughs> I caught a fish. <laughs> That's a that's the biggest. I mean, like, I hadn't smiled like that over a channel cat in a long time. Well, there ought to be some fish in here. This is one of our go go to spots. To always get something. Mm -hmm. Not Two forty-eight. Kevin Fish has said, "Hey, I'm running around with the wife. Thought I'd check back. How's it going?" Um, Gary caught the one striper, wiper, whatever you want to call it, and then Stacy has caught a bluegill. Team Tennessee is sitting at a big old goose egg. 
But I know there's fish in here. They want to come home. That's correct. No. No. Mark's way out there. He ought to. <laughs> right. <laughs> we get this whole club dog covered. For real, though. Well, we need to start moving. Mark's pretty good. It's funny to hear saltwater guys talk about how poisonous and painful the barbs are on hard headed cats. They resemble small channel cats, minus the coloration. Yeah. I'd hate to get on one something like that. Okay, Don. Devin Fisher said, I want to see a 50 pound caught on one of those rigs. <laughs> Me too. That would be a fun. Ben South said, We've all been finned. It ain't fun, but they make it sound like they're going to die. LOL. We was in Daytona and we did that on Charter Inland fishing trip and uh dude he was he cut the line on it. He wasn't even he wasn't even putting it on his boat. Oh saltwater cat fish. Salt Come on, fish, we want to see these bottles ball spin. Ball. Come on, fish. Where's Cass Blast Cam? Probably in the woods. What's that time of the day? I'd like to talk to him about a tool. Uh -oh. <laughs> did, I, did I hear something? Did I hear something there? <laughs> oh. He said, "I can't say anything on that. Anything on that because I don't fish. I just love the people and why I come to the fishing community channels. Great folks. We are a bunch like of good a people." And Stacy disappeared. I was going to say, did we lose Stacy? Yeah, his camera turned sideways and then poof, he was gone. Uh oh. Hopefully, it didn't nothing happen. He's had a few signal issues today, but he's been in there for a while. Been doing pretty good. He's got one. I know. We need the prize, though. The catfish is the prize. The wiper, that's a bonus because that was like super unexpected. But, uh, right. Catfish is the prize. That's funny. Uh, because I bet he took off that little, that little wiper swiper. It was weird. It was, it was like he was running down this kind of along the bank because he wasn't pulling really pulling much. It, it was a kind of pull when you're, yeah. you know, they're going to the side. Yeah. Oh, 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 what do you say, Gary? Yeah. Fish on. We got fish on on the rod. Oh, on the rod. Hey, oh, log man. Oh, oh. Bottle just spun. I think she swam across the water. Uh -oh. Uh oh. I don't know what I just did. Oh, yeah. Oh, you crossed all of them. Is he in your bottle line?
Is that here? Uh, okay. Logman K's in here. Hello. Anthony's got some blue sky where he is. Puff Muffin said, Fish on. It's Whittle. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it looks real skeptical. Oh, yeah. Not on the rod and reel, not on the bottle, but. <laughs> Put his face up here again. He's giving us the eye. He's like, I don't know what you people are up to, but I don't think I like it. He's <laughs> <laughs> a night crawler, though. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> See you. <laughs> Such a face that fish did. <laughs> he was like, I got my eye on you. What is going on here? <laughs> got my eye on you. <laughs> Stop twisted. <laughs> Uh oh. They have ball by them. No. The line was down off the bottle onto the pole. He's reeling in the slack. There we go. Yeah, I about walked through it. Oh Lord. You have to limbo under them. Well, I'm kind of disappointed in the fish here today. <laughs> and again, I've been disappointed in these fish all week. You know, I went to Bass Pro Shop for the first time the other day, and we know a lady that works there. And she was talking about there has been two people recently that jumped in the tank down there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> one got escorted out, but the other one jumped out and ran out himself. <laughs> it's cool though, in that uh, one tank, how the bass were hanging out back in that little thing next to that structure. They're just hanging, they just hanging out there. I was like, that's cool. The sturgeon was swimming around everywhere. He had no ifs to give. <laughs> no, he was swimming everywhere. And then the carp, if those were carp, I don't know. Don't jump on me for not knowing the difference between carp and common carps and grass carps and boat flows and that other kind. I don't know. I'm not a carp expert. Not a carp, even amateur. I don't know nothing about them except they all kind of look like they got lips. So, but anyway, there was some kind of carp down there in that uh, tank. They were cool. And bass. Some good sized bass. Kind of made me jones for the old days. <laughs> I got a tackle box full of bass gear. That's what I used to do. Oh, shoot. See, y'all need to remind me. Somebody needs to remind me in chat that I've still got somebody on solo. I need help. The only one, I only know one kind of fish, Piggy said, the fillets in Elaine's pan. There you go. Well, Stacy's still gone. His phone may have died or something. Mine ain't got much longer to go. All right, well, we got one on the ride. There you are. 
That was a, a suspicious looking little drum. He looked at us kind of funny. Oh, did he? Yeah, he was what like looking at us sideways, giving us the eye. I better kind of make him a comfortable talk. a little bit. I'll be right back. I'm going <laughs> to go find him and have a talk with him. Okay. <laughs> That was fast. Yeah, it's a little cold. <laughs> what are you talking about? You wanted to catch a drum, Cindy? I caught one. No, I was talking about them fishing in the Bass Pro oh, tank. Oh. oh, those are nice ones in those things. Jeez. Oh, yeah. yeah well, the, uh, yeah. I caught about a nine, I think it was nine pounds, a nine pound drum once. That's about the only drum I've caught. It might be empty. It lasted a long time. Over two hours. And it wasn't a full tank. Yeah. I went and got that one from under the uh, storage can. That's the one we've been working on. It did. We were not catching us on rods. If we had a, some more uh, rebar, I'd say put the rod holder up. Yeah. If we throw the rods out on the rod holder, I put that one rod out right there. It's all blizzard. If we put rods out there, they're going to get blown out there. Yeah, it'll be a mess. There's bait in the water. We ought to, uh, we ought to be catching something if there's something to catch, you know? I'm thirsty. Did you get your drink on it? Uh -huh. I don't think so. No. I'd message Stacy if I'm getting on my phone. I think I got him on. It's in true. Yeah, dude, because I see him in one. <laughs> Come on, fishes. Yeah, it, it just hit the bottom. Yeah. Listen, this version of spin the bottle letting off all that fun. <laughs> Ain't no one kissing the fish. Oh, if I can catch one, I can kiss it. This bottle's fish. We got a little bit of sun finally popping out. Feels good. I see that. Look at our clouds. It is not a beautiful day here. Yep. But it's not raining and it's not snowing, so. Right. We got them snow flurries yesterday in the morning and turned into like a kind of a drizzly day all day. Kind of wouldn't bother me if it was raining. At least it wouldn't be cold. I know it'd be snowing if it was to rain now. Um, Rod said, "If stupid question, if there's multiple people on a live, do they all get watch time, or just the person who starts it? If you can co-stream, I'm not quite sure how to do it exactly. Um, you can co-stream, and both people get watch hours." But if it's just people up on your panel like it is today, uh, two different chats. Too. Yeah, there's two different chats also that way. But oh, um, not this way, the way we're doing it today, just the person who starts it gets watch hours. Yeah, Sydney hogs all the hours. I'm just kidding. Yeah. She's hogging well, uh, listen, Anthony, if you would get you some subs, I pop up on your panel. <laughs> Get you some oh, subs, man. Yeah. Get your subs up. <laughs> man, I got a sub problem. I'm not submissive enough. Did you say <laughs> subs or subs? Get your subs up. You had Get a subs, subs up, up yesterday. If you do subs up, it's subs up. Subs up, subs up. 
<laughs> <That's a bit laughs> I enjoy being up with you, Cindy. You know, you guys are one of my favorites. You're my top five favorites on YouTube. All vault, you know. Oh, thank you. You're right up there in the top five too. Woo! Woo! Of course, my favorite is Catfish Dave. I've been watching him a long time, but it's kind of hard to jump on panel with him. Right. Piggy Piddles said, Anthony, she just told you to get it up. She I did. did. I, I did. Got to get some lead. Get it. Pencil. Listen, get it up. Just hide it from Cast Blast. Oh. <laughs> we don't want Cast Blast catching wind. He starts blessing out them tools on you. It's going to be a bad Listen, day. Cat, Cast Blast is sitting pretty himself. He must be about 7,000 right now. He don't need me getting up and up. <laughs> that tool up at that tool up at deer butt. But he's over real like mid south. <laughs> he said, "Did Anthony say catfish, Dave? I got an unsub now." <laughs> uh oh, don't be, don't, don't be a hater. Don't be a hater, mid south. Don't be a hater. Be a congratulator. Don't be a hater. Be a congratulator. Now you know that mid south zero is Dave. I know it's secretly. Secretly, you be watching him because you you know too much about what he's doing. I know. Uh oh. No puff muff and that deer isn't sitting pretty. He better not be Mid sitting down at all. He <laughs> better be sitting down. <laughs> he should have hit it. Take your frame. Mid South's mad because Captain Day never responded to his comments. That's why. That's it. <laughs> but he don't respond. To he eats steak sitting. for breakfast. Hey, uh. Anthony Piggy said, you know they make pills for that, right? I don't really have that issue, to be honest with you. <laughs> they don't make pills for getting his subs up. No, not for that. Not for, that you got to do manually. Well, you know, it kind of helps put content out there. I'm not putting nothing out there either. Cat Blast can help you work on that. No. Cat Blast can make you. Uh, yeah, he can help you get your subs up. Is that a baby drum? We got a yellow bass, a little tiny yellow bass on the, on on rod and reel. Yeah. Really? Jerry's you only got five hundred feet. Jerry's over here catching oh. everything in the river with a little piece of worm and a little half ounce weight on rod and reel. <laughs> yellow bass. That's cool. Old little yellow. Guy. Should use him for bait. Yeah. You yeah. should use that yellow bass. I'm a, I'm a yeah. What is that? It looks like my old, uh, what you call it? Oh, A32. Dave Garcher, welcome in. Good afternoon. Coming to you from sunny Tennessee. <laughs> All right. Mom? Welcome. Time to go put uh, big, big lost battery power. I'm gonna miss the uh, card shot. Mine don't. Did he really block you? And South said, no, I used to watch him until he blocked me on Facebook publicly, and I don't support people to do that crap. Cannot imagine anybody blocking you there, Seth. You're the bee's name. No work. I think I got 250 to come on my phone. You ask about why he keeps a boat outside when he has three plus garages. Oh, it's a little fishing here. I could send all the videos to Cindy that way. I could record. Mine's at 24. <laughs> I 
He's going to be moving around and stuff, you know what I mean? Whatever hits that, it's going to be way oh, yeah. He said it wasn't even blocked that did it. It's when he publicly posted that he blocked it. Leave your drag real loose. Dang it, Mid-South. He said, I don't like drama. Even through mentioning, even though mentioning it is drama. Yeah. I love drama. You love what? Drama? As long as it ain't mine. Yeah. I'm not a drama llama. No, I don't care. Unless it's my friends or something, that's different. Well, if you're BSing, that's different. Yeah. But real if drama? You're no BS, if you're no BS and catfishing drama? <laughs> no BS and catfishing drama. Oh, thank you. Nobody's caught a catfish yet, yak, 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 yak. But what's up, yak? what's up, yak? And An yak. Uh, Anthony's friend Gary there caught a what he calls wiper, wiper, and uh, Stacy, who's gone, caught a bluegill, and I then they fun. caught they caught another drum and another little striped bass. Yellow bass. Yellow bass. At a, yeller. Oh, yeller. Because Anthony is yeller bass. Is yeller. And we threw that out live. Oh, yeller. The fish one year 1v12. 1v12. We're going to do a rematch in the spring. Not spring, February. <laughs> Well, I wish one of these bottles would take off spinning. We get a little waves, this little tug went by. They, uh, I saw it tractor supply where they filled them. Yeah, I go right there above Walmart. Pull the rope. Got filled right there for. I can't know oh, we're casting playing. out. We're casting out on the bottle. Casting out. All right. That's about a ton of pound tank there. Okay. Five foot cast. Thirty-five foot cast. Two hundred dollars. I don't know if it's a tank or if it's for the tank. It's gonna take a nap. The wind was brutal. Yeah. It wears you out to be out in it. The body's like, listen, I've been working hard. It's not so bad if the wind's warm, but when it's bitterly cold, it sucks. Are you not even wearing a jacket, though, Anthony? No. I just got a long sleeve and t-shirt. What tells me? <laughs> Nothing on the bottom, just long sleeve and t-shirt. <laughs> That's <was> good, Travis. <laughs> Jump. Go back for a second. See what that's gonna do. <laughs> you guys fishing what? all day? Uh, uh, you gonna fish into the night, Cindy? Uh, probably not too late. We was up all night playing games on sand, and then I had to get up at like nine o'clock this morning. So, all right. I don't know though, maybe. If the fish were to suddenly miraculously start biting, me and, maybe, Gary, yeah. me and Gary may go to another spot. It all depends on these turds hit in here. Yeah, this turd I'm still put out hot water. The first river, personally. I think we should go. We'll give it, you know what? We'll give it another 45 minutes here, well, and then we're going to go to another spot. Okay. Whatever you want to bring. I'm pulling right there. 
Yeah. Have a good nap yet, sure. No, you can get in. I wonder what the water temperature is this year. What the deal was with that? It was uh, kind of weird, but it went over that one. You know what I'm saying? But they wouldn't say nothing unless it went over the second. The drum was going to be a jump so, cat. I, just I mean, you could come down to two of the second one and then go off and right here to discharge. They wouldn't say nothing. You're making fit. I can go off the either side. Welcome in. Sorry, I just got a little mesmerized by the water. Listen to them talk about fishing. Happy New Year to you. We're here trying to catch fish on bottle rigs. Santa did not bring us new rods for Christmas, so. <laughs> well, that's nice of you. The weather got you good today? What's the weather like where you are? Are you in Jamaica? Hmm, a bit cold. I bet it got colder in the end down there. Down there it is. I reckon the wind blowing. Hope oh, tomorrow gets a south coast. Come in and soak. Rain in Montego Bay. Over here, pulling in the spot. Can you catch another one? Not yet, but uh, the next spot we go to, very, 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 very hopeful compared to this spot. Tyler's back. Tyler's back. What's up? <laughs> We're going to go to the Clinch River in about 45 minutes, bro. We're going to go to the Deer Trail spot in this river in about an hour, 40 minutes. Is it wind and rain on the north coast, so if the weather ease, I cross the island to the other side. Hey, Sam. You should have heard me this morning from Travis's Brewster crowed. <laughs> I was like, oh, get up. Yeah. 
somewhere else about the bottom of the and I know that I can go to the bank. 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 What's going on today, Sam? Man, try to. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Hey there. I think we're having a Yeah. We're having a balloon race. That blue one's trying to catch up to the red one. Well. It looked like there was something uh, messing with that red one. one day in, uh, somebody there. Well, we got, we got we got Tyler showed up. He was here earlier, and uh, but he didn't he didn't know about the bottom contest, so he's using riding reels. Okay. Yeah, I told Travis that I blamed you. Uh oh. For what? Sam's in here with the dark lady. Oh, hey. What's up, Sammy? She uh, had games last night. We played till like three. And then <laughs> we got off there and I thought we were going to bed and trash drags out the bottles in the paint. I was so we're like, not we're not doing uh -uh. that. <laughs> oh, I'm going to switch around. Look at that bottle. Make the barber pole spin, fish. Come on, fish. Excuse me. There we go. These things have to move. Once. Oh, that wind is. I don't have any wind. Oh, I wish we did. It's whipping here. Oh, I, I'm it? afraid this tarp is loud, but I don't think it's as loud as it was last night because I, I got some fishing line tied that crap up. Yeah, I wish it was last night. Was, was Sometimes it got pretty, pretty loud. I bet you did love it, Sam. Um, yeah, that looks like a barber pole, don't it? It's black and white, though. <laughs> I got the zebras. That's what they are. I got the zebra zebra bottles. Mm -hmm. That's a black and white chicken play. For the win, but they're not winning. Start spinning. Yeah. If you want to start winning, you better start spinning. Are you going to keep on bottle fishing after you move, or are you just going to change to rods? Oh, yeah. oh, no, no, no. It's bottles all day. <laughs> oh, Gary's on something. Gary's on something. John Rodney. John. Bottles all day. Come on, bottles. Spin, spin, spin. I wonder if Stacy's phone died. There's a uh, friend up in there on that phone on the left side. If you can't get to it, they got to it. You can't turn me into the road. Inline fishing, you haven't done that, that since you learned how to use a rod. We just thought it would be fun, Jamaican. Yeah, Tyler's down there with them.
Oh, yeah. It would be more fun to, uh, to make him fishing if we could get some more fish to bite. He said he hadn't done him on finished fishing since he learned how to use a rod to make him fish through fishing. Oh. Pretty decent drink, though. Swallow the hook. No skunk. It looks like something's messing with the red balloon. Here comes you to show the drum. Another drum? Woohoo! Let me make it big. <laughs> She's going to make the whole thing. All right. Woohoo! Look, see, that one's giving us the eye, too. Them drum look at you like you done something to their family or something. Oh! It's yeah. like the exact same one. That no, butt. That He's got butt issues. Been eating good. I think Cass Blast has been after him. Uh oh. Yeah, that's <laughs> <laughs> Don't bag, bag fish. Y'all are on the drums. Still got to work on the toss. Did you go have no? You don't have no toss like that. They caught another drum <laughs> on a rod and reel. We got yeah, one. Yeah. We got six bottles out. <laughs> Jamaican fishing said, crack some sticks, roast her up right there. Yeah, you want to eat the drums in the winter. In the summer, they get they get like all these parasites in their gills and worms and stuff on them. So you want to, generally, you want to eat them. You want to do it when the water is really cold. He said, a little salt and pepper. It's perch. All they are is, they're, you know, the drums part of the perch family. So they're, you know, they're good eating. You get a bad rap. <laughs> yeah, take it from me because I eat so much fish. I don't eat any fish. <laughs> you don't eat fish at all. No, they're really good. They're really good. Uh uh. That nine pound drum I caught was a big drum. That's a big one. I was impressed. Yeah. Um, I actually think something is pulling on his line. Well, maybe not. He said, oh, yeah, I love it. Oh, my God, it's you know, you'd think something would bite. Did um did uh did uh Mark bring his uh nephew with him? I think he just got here. Okay. He said oh, okay, this he is Jay. He said he was gonna bring him today. Okay. Now this is Jay that fished with him before the other day. Oh, oh, you mean um uh these Tennessee whiskers, right? No. no, that's Lonnie. That's Lonnie. Oh. Oh. Jay, does he have a channel? BFC. Oh, BFC, the one that was talking in chat earlier. BFC. Oh. He's got a brand new channel. Brand new. Cool. Hey, crazy hillbilly. Having a coffee and enjoying the special smoke, watching you guys have all the fun. It's cold here, Jamaican fishing. 
we've got us a little shelter set up, but it's cold. Put the links, I'll subscribe. How long it take to do all that canopy set up? About 20 minutes? Oh, no. It took us, what, 10 minutes? To set this canopy up. It took That's us actually longer. We're hitting the bottle, Laura. It took us longer to set it up today than it did yesterday. This canopy is just a pop-up. It comes up real easy. And right. then um, we just pulled the uh, pulled the tarp up over the top of it, threw, threw a couple of rocks on the edges of it. It's good to go. Hey, bug man. What's up? Welcome back, Lisa. Y'all, we're hitting the bottle today. But it's not hitting back. We're not getting anything. That sounds funny. We're hitting the bottle today. We're hitting the bottle today. Um, Jamaican, I will have uh, somebody drop some links here in just a second. If anybody's in chat, that uh, okay. Mark's going to drop some links. Uh, Jamaican fishing said that he would subscribe if somebody would drop some links. <laughs> You can also type um, um, pineapple in chat and it'll drop your link. Pineapple, what you gonna do? Pineapple. Where's Sandy Toes? Yeah, Puff Muff and Anthony's buddy just caught another drum on the pole. He's wearing them drums out. Where's Sandy Toes? Is it is it is it sleepy time over there right now? Um, let's see, it's three hours, I think. No, let's it's see. Way more so than it's that. 3 30 a.m., 4 30, 5 30, 6 30. Might be about 6 30 in the morning tomorrow over there. Yeah, yeah, she's always in the future. She's, yeah, out, she's in the future. Hanging out it's with Mike. 6 30 in the morning on Sunday in Australia. Oh. Oh. Come on, bottles. Let me get out of the way. Get away here. Uh, if anybody wants to drop their link, if he didn't get your link from what the ones he had copied, if you want to drop your link in chat by typing pineapple, you're making fish and will pick you up. I hope that tarp isn't too loud for you guys. It's saving our life, saving my life. We can hear it. It's not unbearable, but it's all right. Getting flat. Flat, flat, flat. I tied it down a little bit to where it's not uh, as loud. Are you okay, Bank Fishing? Did your phone die? Yeah, what happened, Bank? You all right? He asked if you were going to catch a fish. Him and the friend have been catching drums there, but. Hey, hunting and stuff. Yeah, I figured that's what it was. I saw your uh, screen go sideways and then you pooped. Hunting and stuff. Um, Anthony and uh, Gary are catching a few drum on the rods. Um, they've caught one striped Wiper. bass on the the uh, bottle. On the bottle. <laughs> and then Bank Fishing Adventures caught a bluegill on the bottle. So the bottles have caught fish. Our bottles, however, have not caught fish. And we've got, even got that fancy drag where the bottles are actually sitting on the ground. Nothing. What do you mean? You got them sitting like in the dirt? The bottom? Yeah, we've got the big bar driven far enough in the ground to where like the top of it is touching the ground. Oh, okay. Cool. Cool, cool. Providing, providing some drag. Yeah. <laughs> 
Not that it's doing us any good whatsoever. That fish won't bite. I'd like to have the worm where to make them fishing is. I realize that you're supposed to be able to get big blues this time of year, but not if uh, they don't settle down and get the eat. a bottle bite. Bottle bite? Come on, bottle. Spin the bottle. Come on, get them, Gary. It's determined. Look oh. at that. Intensity oh. on his face. That's intensity. Oh, oh, Woo. did he get him? Did, did he get, get him? him? Oh, no, he thinks Not he missed good. him. He said he missed uh, him. <laughs> he just sits there still for a second and goes, boom. I had already decided one more pull. But I was he had a bite, and then he, he jerked up on it. Mm, missed it. Like I think it's hard, like it'd be hard to set the hook on a bottle. The only thing I know is like take off the running, maybe. Well, I was watching. It looked like it was on the handle. It was Gary. Gary's got the hot bottles today. He's got the hot bottles today. <laughs> hot water bottles. <laughs> Welcome back, Ashley. You on a break again? Hey, Ash. Bottle bottle. All right, you can go back. There we go. There we go. I might have to recast these bottles down there. Got them all. Bug man be creeping. She's home now. She left work early. Listen, if it was there's anything like there like it is here, you don't want to be anywhere but home snuggled up. Oh, shit. Did you miss one on the pole, Anthony? No. Listen, I'm going to have right. to go get mine. Oh, I ain't. It's okay. It gets for my toes. I'm warm everywhere, but my toes, they're always cold. Go out there, you find out. Yeah. I have to say, it's a whopping 38 degrees there, Bug Man said. It ain't much better than that here, if it is. Any. Where it's, is your coat? In the sun oh here, that's, that's pretty nice in the sun. <laughs> He's dead nowhere in it. I heard it. Good. <laughs> oh my! I looked over at the. I don't know what you're talking about. It ain't cold down here. Uh, uh, cool. Cool yeah, people are I don't know about it. About to go get the core kegs. And it ain't even cold in here. But if you have to step out from under here for any reason, whoo! Doggy. Did you get your feet warm? Did you get in the vehicle? Did you quit fishing? <laughs> Jamaican, I think I had to, because I've seen you somewhere else before, but if I, if not, I'll get you later, Travis, too. Yeah. 
Oh, we got we got the we got the baby bottle out. Baby bottle. Baby bottle. The baby bottle. Yeah. Oh, it is a baby bottle. <laughs> look at that. It's look at that bottle. A mini. That's the dog demon. Dog demon bottle. I said, I do believe it's nap time. Y'all have fun. All right, man. See you later. Thug Muffin said, Anthony, I just flushed a big old brown trout. Probably headed your way. <laughs> Well, I'll have to weigh it. I'll have to weigh that one. <laughs> I'm staying away from his brown trail. Yeah, I don't really want it either. <laughs> I'm glad he sent it your way. Keep it on your end of the Tennessee. He a brown trail. Trail. Gonna, if I see a brown Fish trout, on bottles. Floating, I'm a hot, if I see a brown trout, Floating on the holler. Mid South. Damn it. <laughs> We're fishing with bottles. See this? Mid see uh Cheeto Cheeto. You wrap your line around the bottle and stick it on a stick, and there you are. Fancy rod and reel. There you go, Vanna. Show them. <laughs> Travis is currently working on ours. We've got two out there on a the balloon because it is a very windy day, so we figured we'd let the wind help us. Hello, Scotty. What's the deal? Some line out, free spooling, are you? <laughs> Over here, free spooling the bottle. He's dragging. Oh, oh, hey, air run. Got These guys are on the drums or something over here. Oh, he got another drum. You can't I see our so. balloons, but we've got a red and a blue one out there. We can't quite cast the bottles as far as the rods, obviously. No. Hello, Superstar and Travis. <laughs> Bank fishing. He, uh, Anthony does have some fancy sticks. Little it's drug. a store bought Ooh. sticks. Well, ours are too. We got rebar. But he'd have done just as well letting the beaver cut his because those look, those look pretty good. Aaron said, need a whiskey bottle challenge. Nobody would be able to win that one. <laughs> Falling in the water. Everybody wake up in a field. I'm too old for that. <laughs> Battle, bottles and bone. Bottles and bone. Used to run across Tennessee State a few times on 40. Yep. Goes right through here. Any fish. Fishing for catfish, but any fish that's what's being called. Camera shy, Tyler. Camera shy. He's West Virginia and Tennessee. Can't believe the balloon hasn't worked. I know what we got two out there. I wonder. You were a trucker for 21 years. Cool. Let's 
hours. Later, Taters. Another drum. They're on the drums. They're way out there. There's like, it'd be so hard to hear where they were. Where they Further, it's trying to stay warm. Y'all in a secret location? Did you mention where? I just missed it. We are on the planet. We're not in a secret location. Okay. We're up near. I guess near the point. There's anywhere else? That red balloon looks called real like a red Stacey, what happened to BFP? What happened to huh? What happened to Stacy? He's in, he was in chat. Oh, his battery died on his phone. And now he's warming his feet up, he said, so Yeah, I don't blame him. Same thing. I got double socks on today though, so we're all right. Oh, here goes the cast. Right, there we go. Get, getting better. These cats are starting to get a little better. They're going out a little farther. That was good. <laughs> the carp are biting on my on your pound. Oh, oh, the carpers start fighting on your pond now. <laughs> the carper back on the pond. Oh. Right, got some, got some good sunlight going on over here. We just need to spin a room. Check out Keto Keto. I'm, I'm curious, and it's the most amount of people we had in here today. Have you noticed? Do what? What was the most amount of people we had in here so far? Have you noticed? Um, I think it was about 38. That's not bad. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's not too bad at all. I think that was peak at 38. We held 35 for a while. Well, now we're at, uh, we're at about 24, 25. All right. This next spot I think we're going to is going to be pretty juicy. It's a feeder river into this into the Tennessee River. And uh, I got a good news about that. We're not there yet. Y'all are catching a hound out of some drums. Yeah, but that's on the ride and reel. That's not the deal. Yeah. You know Don't count on the bottle. Right. <sighs> Then you ain't doing it. So what's got on the bottom so far? Uh, so far, the striper, or striper, wiper, swiper, whatever the heck. Well, no, kind of both <laughs> I mean, two things are falling on the bottom, so you can't say if you were needing to use something like this, uh, it sure could catch food on it. Yeah. You know, I've seen more fish caught today than I have in, in like a, two weeks. Right <laughs> For spot. real. Honestly. Yeah. Do you know? Gary's on getting another drum bite over here on the riding wheel, though. At least there's so, I haven't. 
that it is a fishing show. I haven't shown. Uh, we are, what happened? Listen, we what are happened? hardcore dedicated fishermen, but we are not crazy. What happened to? <laughs> oh, it looks like a porta potty. It looks like a porta potty. It uh, kind of does. I'm about ready to get me a bucket and tell everybody to beat it for a minute. What is that? A heater in the middle? Huh? What's that? A heater in the middle? <laughs> Heck yeah. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome. Mark brought his heater. Dude, Mark is the bomb. <laughs> they got a heater. Oh, they got a propane heater. Oh, Look at our little shelter. <laughs> and a shelter. They set up a homeless camp right there at the water. <laughs> we did set up a homeless camp right at the water. Listen, listen, what? nobody well, ever. We got a homeless camp. You know, we got the bottle. Listen, I don't have good sense. I don't have good sense, but I am not crazy. <laughs> so we set up a homeless camp. Homeless camp right here at the water. Yeah. Tent City. It ain't we're, cold we're city though. Yeah, we're, at the homeless camp. we're under the bridge yet. We got our homeless camp established. So uh yeah, all I can say is look and learn. That's it. <laughs> I can't bring all that stuff with me, dude. It's like a freaking so far from where you park. Yeah, if you have to walk in, but like oh, our man, car we, is literally we had to walk, walk down, like we had to cross railroad tracks, we gotta walk down this like little runoff water spot you gotta walk over a bunch of rocks to get to here we also pick our spots <laughs> according to the weather <laughs> it, but yeah but it, this but it's just not like that here you can right. you know, there's, there's very very few places you can drive right to the water here oh okay there's a million places up here yeah remember this is all they may not always be optimal but you know yeah. if you can fish for five or six hours in a place over but freezing to death at, at, at a, you know, after two, we target right. boat ramps. We do target boat ramps. <laughs> yeah, well, they have. You can do a lot of that in, in the lakes behind the dams up here. You know, you can do that all day long. But I'd rather fish the river. <laughs> and these guys are schooling them. <laughs> Puff up and said, "That's sweet homeless camp." <laughs> You know, so y'all, you live a sheltered life? Hell yeah, we do. <laughs> Listen, like I Neither said, I ain't got no sense, but I ain't crazy. Why should I sit out here and suffer when I don't have to? When you don't have to. <laughs> I don't have to. You know, I would like to say that Travis does it because he wants to take care of me. But so listen, here's the real reason. He don't want me to go home. He don't want me to go back and put my cold feet on him. Oh, from the oh, we He's trying to avoid me getting body parts cold because I put them on him whenever we get home. <laughs> I got to warm him up, Travis. Move over. I got to put my feet on him. <laughs> he has to run from me. Right. I'll go all the way down. I said, I'd like to say that Travis does it just because it's, it's already sweet. No, he really does want me to put his cup my cold parts on him. No. <laughs> <laughs> it takes about 10 minutes. You got to watch, too. Though. It only takes about 10 minutes for him to be like I said. <laughs> we try to suffer vicariously through you, as Keto said. Smart one puff, and puff Muffin said, Smart woman, Cindy. Yeah. I tell you what, too, though, it takes 10 minutes for me to get cold and about three hours for me to get warm. I will, uh, we, he built a fire one time, okay, and the front part of me was all toasty warm. I built burnt the skin off the front of my legs, <laughs> but the back side of me got cold through this chair, and we got back to his house. He had the heated seats on in the car and everything for me. <laughs> we got back to the house. <laughs> And I turned around and put my cold butt on him. Oh. And it was cold. Listen, it was cold. Terrible. I mean, terrible. It was just like an ice box. <laughs> did, did, your booty cheek, did your booty cheek stick to a, stick to Travis like a tongue on a frozen pole? 
<laughs> it went out like that. It's the one that they did. <laughs> the thing about it is that, that, you know, I can snuggle up to him and it still takes forever for me to leach enough heat out of him to get warm. And keep in mind, that's a heated seat all for an hour. Yeah, I was on a heated seat for an hour. My butt was still cold. I'm telling you, once I get cold, I cannot warm back up. And I love fishing so much. <laughs> Piggy said, uh, I get cold, I wrap up in a blanket around a heater. Yep. Heat, oh, yep, cold as the dark side of the moon. I hope that don't mean his heater run out of propane. No, it's tank on. Okay. Maybe it's just the one. He said he needed to get a mall refilled. I'm about to get the the thing though for our. You know, I bought goldfish for that um, Juan, and we haven't been back down there to feed him. <laughs> yeah, <I know. laughs> that, that bag of goldfish has been in the car for a while. Ooh, it feels like the wind's shifting. I can't believe Anthony don't even have a jacket on. That's craziness. Three people dropped out of chat because I showed them my shelter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> 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 and stuff said, Cindy, fill the tub with hot water. That's how I throw out meat sometimes. <laughs> hey, that's what I tell her. Go get in a hot shower. I'm like, oh, God. The problem with that is I get out of the hot shower into that cold room and freeze again. What are you doing? I'm trying to get out of shoes off. I'm trying to warm my piggies up. I don't want to be go. What reels they got on that? That one you swung away out there. It broke good, don't it? Yeah, most of them are like robots. So I keep trying to say. Somebody hates me, doll. I like it, hard it, and go on. <laughs> even, yeah. if it, even if it's a negative comment, like it, hard it, because any comment is going to help you out. Um, I, ha I get the cry faces a lot. I had one the other day that was like, uh, I, oh no, it might have been today. I love you. I love you so. <laughs> if you really love me. <laughs> I scooted over some more. Oh, yeah, we can squeeze four people in here. Yeah, you show. Hey, Allie. They've been talking good about your cooking. You bought a radio arm soft marketplace. Cool. We're gonna have a whole production, the whole thing. 
Hey, Lonnie. What's going on? So far, Team Tennessee's not doing it as so well. It's kind of rough everywhere with the bottle action today. <laughs> Alan said, "Welcome, or uh, thanks to everyone talking good about my cooking right now. I'm chowing down on." On a bowl of hot stew. Hot stew sounds good. <laughs> hot stew. Hot anything. Right. What happened to everything? What happened to Mark's uh, screen? Oh, he took it down. Oh. He, he kept hearing the uh, echo. I don't think it was uh, the audience was hearing it, but we could hear it in here. So, yeah, he comes in and drops links. Thank you. I can wrap it around the hand. I took one the other day and wrapped one around the hand. It was a game changer. So you put them flat, they don't hardly warm up at all. Yeah, I don't know if they're, they're designed to stay flat on the bottom, but good, and they don't get warm. But, like <laughs> yeah, the stuff said, beat me to it, Cindy. I was going to tie pot anything. Yep. For real. I think when you got them on the bottom of your foot, they just don't get enough air to them. That and they, uh, the top of your foot just don't get anything. Puff Muffin said, I bet it looks like a homeless camp right now. Everyone in a in a tent, bottles all over the ground. <laughs> <laughs> homeless camp 2023, Lonnie said. <laughs> Listen. Poor boy fish camp. There you are. I thought that's what I would fight my dad going to stand up for that. Poor boy catfishing. That sounds like a good one. Lonnie said homeless camp 2023. <laughs> homeless fishing. Homeless fishing. When the bottles are empty, you can try to catch a fish with it. Cute. Listen, there ain't nothing homeless about us. We got a house here. <laughs> and a heater. Keto said, I saw you have some proper siding. Look what you We'll have a little shack. We need a trailer so we can haul our shack from place to place. But it has to be able to be hauled by the little uh, hole wall. You never have to break it down. You just haul it around. Everybody's pretty light. Huh? Everybody's pretty light. I know it. You get some pallets, some pallets down, then it's official. There you go. Yeah. Yes, we we are able to. Things got wheels on it, don't it? Usually the. Uh... <laughs> I know. I think it was the timber bin. They actually have a. Uh, Funny. I think they had like a case. Uh, yeah, one's well, got the zipper case that they don't have wheels. One side of the bottom of it's got wheels. Yeah, we do. Puff Muffin said you all need to get a photo of you in there and post it. Epic. We need to put up the. Uh, before we leave, we need to. <laughs> I got my shoes off. <laughs> We need to put the uh, the uh, tripod up. 
<laughs> we fish and install. I know they're like homeless camp. I'm like fish and install. <laughs> Bonnie said, reminds me of the Mexicans at the dam. <laughs> Alrighty then. I'm surprised the Russians down there didn't set up camp. Well, no, that's a good one in summer, I'd say. Especially at. Uh, they was probably there all night. Oh, yeah. They, you know, says like Google a, ice fishing shanty. I'm on a, uh, I'm like hobo on a ham sandwich right now. <laughs> a hobo on a ham sandwich. <laughs> uh, Ernest said, you, you guys need to do this again this spring so I can do this with you guys when it's warmer. Definitely. We should do it right before the spawn. Right. When they're, when they're <laughs> feeding, feeding real good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they kept telling us last year we needed to get a fan. My my thing about it is I don't get too hot, really. Do I? We got one. Arctic blast. Around your neck. Yeah, it works pretty good. No way to work. Dang it. Powerball ticket worth uh, $450,000 sold in the California convenience store. What a good What a good bit of good we were buying one to now. Got like two or three or slice slice of beer. We could walk the rest. <laughs> Jamaican said, You guys want to try to get together like that. This side should be fun. Airbnb by the sea with this matching. <laughs> it really would be an Airbnb. Ernest, what's, the uh, what's, what's the deposit on a, uh, a setup like that for an Airbnb? <laughs> city? What's the deposit on a setup like this? Shoot, man, we know what we got. Don't try to uh, don't be trying to low ball us. <laughs> you have to bring. You have to bring a. You have to. You, everybody has to bring a bottle of propane for the heater. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Ernest, we'll do it. Uh, Ernest wants to do this again when it's warmer out, Anthony. Oh, the bottle? Yeah, so he can That's participate. Good. Okay. And the bottles ain't going nowhere. Once they wrap them up, it's just another... Yeah, another just piece. more fishing gear. Yep, keep them, keep them handy. We'll do it again when it gets warmer so a few more people can participate. Yeah. When the lights and stuff go, Don R might want to. <laughs> I'm setting a guard dog on the next one. Hey, you can do it during the ice station. I don't know if you want to ice station. Yeah. Yeah. Jamaican said, check out this nice spot. Sleeps about eight people. <laughs> I'll give him a deal. It can be a $150 non-refundable deposit. Not our responsibility if the wind changes. <laughs> <laughs> if you get blown away, that's your problem. I'd be like reversible. You just pull this side down if the wind changes. Turn it up itself, too. <laughs> Just save the heater. I can't tell you how many times we've used this sucker in rain. It's about wore out. It's okay as long as the wind don't start blowing. <laughs> we said under this thing down there at the silo when I had COVID. <laughs> I know it. You had this thing before we met, I guess. Yep. <laughs> I 
check out this nice place. So it's about 18. You could draw wall to wall them in here about 18. If you pulled out the tarp in the back, <laughs> <laughs> then make it crawl back up under there. Right? <laughs> I tried to see if the Travis would go for one of them little pods. You know what I'm talking about? You can buy them and it, it's got the whole, like a sports mm -hmm. pod. Yeah. Yeah, there was there was one of them that, that you could put a buddy here. The problem with it is it's got a lip in the front of it that's about that high. I guess we would do whatever. I got my her box, right? Yeah, you go you go to the whole thing down. I don't have any faith in me not being able to walk. He just knows I get excited to get television. <laughs> hey, check it out. This is a silver cart backbone right here. Wow, let's see. It's just a piece. It's not like it was able to get from it, but it was probably. Wow. Like you know, if you had a man cave, that would be cool to hang those those bones in there. It looks like a dragon, almost a dragon. Yeah, it, it looks like a dragon. Puff Muffin said, "He rises. I'm sleeping on top." <laughs> Lonnie said, "We'd starve to death if we had to catch our own food right now." <laughs> Room. We'd be. Hey, I don't know. We'd, we'd have to go to Kentucky to get them. Travis would be down there eating crayfish. Can you float that cast net over here to dock and knock it? Can you float that shack down river down here? <laughs> Can we float that shack down river? Yeah, and you have to go through the locks. You should be all right. The sun's gone. Now it's a bit chilly. Now it's chilly. You better. I, I hope you have a coat. I sound like somebody's mom. Yeah. Cindy, no, I brought a coat. That <laughs> guy had a new dog. Like the way the fish are biting, you're not wrong. We'd have to dig some worms if we could get to them. Oh, that's a that's a tough meal. Yeah. What you got for dinner? We well, got a couple of night crawlers here. <laughs> we peeled some bark off a tree and got a couple of grubs. <laughs> <laughs> Scott and yeah. yeah, we had to start getting the bait. <laughs> What's your big so far? Well, I was reeling in like one that was thirty pounds, and then mine was thirty pounds. But out of the water, that was like three pounds. Said twenty. That's good stuff. Bonnie has the flu. Bonnie's got the flu. That's what he said. Uh oh, you've been exposed. <laughs> the one that don't have any line on it. I wonder why I did that. That's that's either that. That's one of what flown. I can't remember when it's That year, it's getting way over it right now. It said it's bad. Oh, really? Long? Yeah. That's tough. Paradise with a paradise. Bring your own, bring your own bottle. What? Yeah, I've got four. Neighbor just dropped by with a jug of Mayfield's eggnog. That's nice. Lord Lonnie says it's bad. Well, oh. He's getting something at every holiday here. Just out of interest, did a search of flight from Nashville to Montego Bay, Jamaica. It's $452. A flight from uh, Nashville to Montego Bay, Jamaica is four hundred and fifty-two dollars round trip. Not too bad. Nothing. 
I'm ready to go to Jamaica. I don't want to come back to a swimmer here. <laughs> I sure do need to win the lottery. No. I could have a one of these help. <laughs> it's probably against some kind of laws. You know, so what would go better, cinnamon whiskey or salty caramel whiskey or straight vodka? I like the salty caramel. Hot cinnamon whiskey, hot damn, or them like that. I mean, they warm you up going down, but no, I'm not a drinker. That's medicine. <laughs> <laughs> It's not store bought. It's the real deal. That store bought won't do nothing to you. So five the fruit. You got to cut it down. This thing. Thank you. That's like them moonshine on that show and stuff. They. It's just so fake. I, I think I don't even think they got moonshine on the show. I think they got water in. It. Yeah, alcohol actually drops. Makes you feel like you're warm, but you're not really. Hey, Sandy Toes. Sandy Toes finally woke up. Yep, she's up and at them. We missed you last night on Sam's. Twenty eight fine people in here. Sandy, we're out, we're out here giving these uh bottles the old try. Anthony's caught something on his, and then Bank Fishing Adventures caught something on his. But so far, we're goosey. What? What? Uh, what? Like, what? You're one million dollars. What's them boys? They're going to take off. <laughs> They're spending time with the kiddos. I was on whether to pull them in and then they get bait on. I sucked at them anyway. I'm trying to figure out how to get them back out there. They gone. Yeah. I hope I don't get that flu. Oh, uh, Red was sick of the dog the other day, too. Keto said, I felt like I was in Jamaica a few days ago, days of days. I'm used to CBD, but a neighbor had some D9 or whatever vape from the store here. Oh, my God, never again or until the next time. <laughs> You better watch that in them sawmills. You'll lose a finger or ten. Yeah, on a on a paper saw. Come on, fish. We got balloons way out there. Well, that blue one's way out there. The red one's coming in towards the shore a little bit. Yeah, around in the corner. But it really does look like something's messing with it. I don't know why it bobs around like it. The sun went down there for Anthony. He's a little chilly now. Mm -hmm. All right, but Jack. And he said he had one. I said I sound like somebody's mom. <laughs> it's like him when he came around the corner without a coat on. I was like, "Where's your coat?" Freeze! Don't freeze! That cold wants to get used to it. 
I'll, I'll never get used to it. As long as I'm fishing, I'll care. Oh, that's Keto said never again. That's actually no one. You know, uh, never again. He's not doing it no more. No more. Get the road, Jack. And don't you come back. You know, I was going to have some um, hay legs close to here with the giant cat. No. Speak. The problem with that is they get the big fish out of places, these, these rivers, and they put them in there and catch them five or six times and they die. The, the places they have to put them fish aren't capable of sustaining them. They live about two weeks. The bottles remind me of the wooden handrails my father grandfather has. Yep. Do what? Oh, in case you have them. It's the road today. Oh. Oh, no. That's a pretty bottle, Travis. That's a pretty one. <laughs> yeah. Did it work? That's what colors of paint you had, huh? <laughs> Sometimes hit forty seven percent. That thing is way louder when you're live. <laughs> That one time it was quiet in the house and there wasn't nothing going on and there was quiet on screen. You weren't saying nothing for a couple minutes and all of a sudden it went brrr and I said, <laughs> a jerk. <laughs> World's slowest catch anticipation, right? I just crunched on a bunch of corn nuts laying down. One piece just went up my nose. Well, you know. That don't sound pleasant. <laughs> Sandy, uh, we'd have to see. It takes a minute to wrap it around the bottle. The way, um, the way Gary pulled it in earlier. Um, is he just hand over handed it and piled up the line on the bank? He was taking great big old yanks of it. Yeah. Depends on how big it is. Stand up and tell me Oh, Yeah. I bet it is. Sandy said that's an interesting way to take yourself out, Keto. A piece of corn nut up the nose. Oh my God. 
he was laying down eating the corn nuts and one went up his nose. <laughs> it's, he said, it's bad when the fish tricks you and swims at you. Yep, swims to you. Oh, your portable charger? Ta uh, Travis's takes forever. I caught the top of the house. His charger takes forever to charge up, but then when it charges up, it stays charged for a while. About this big. So he runs it. Big, probably three lines, about like that, and then a plant one. So he runs it all the time. Was it like a lithium battery or something? It was some type of charger. Is now the right time for Travis to do his cold water swim? I bet you couldn't get him out there if you picked him up and chunked him. He'd stick to you. It'd be a real good time for um, some hypothermia. Because it's in the 30s out here, probably. Might be in the low 40s, but I'm going to say it's more like probably 38, 39. 40. Is it 40? No. With the wind, it don't feel like that. Lonnie, well, get to feeling better. Oh, wow. That's wild. He's just chicken liver. Yeah, we got chicken livers, too. Yeah, he's got the flu. He's Tennessee whiskers does. True. I don't know part of that. Um, and the water temperature probably is in the fifties. Likely. Quench is always a little bit colder than other rivers uh, like too. And since it's don't have a warm water outlet in the city anymore. That bridge. Ernest said, my New Year's wish list is to start doing some live streams, hopefully. Yeah, it's not so bad. Uh, what do you got to do with, with StreamYard? Do you still need 50 subscribers to go live on YouTube? You still need 50, though, right? Yes. Yeah. You got to have 50 subscribers to go live on YouTube, no matter what. No matter what streaming service you use. You bounce in and out of these fishing channels, you get 50 subscribers like that. Oh, yeah. It's not real hard getting pity. I see I see people in these fishing channels. I'll, I'll check them out. They don't have, they don't do any kind of putting on anything on YouTube. They got three, four times the subscribers I do. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. You have a battery charger pack coming. That'll work. Kilowatts. It's way more. All right. Put on the jacket. You can run a house on so many kilowatts. Whole house. There's the coat. Jackie. How much? Put that back back. Kilowatts. Brought some fuel, some caramello. Gotta have that. Caramello! Sugar for the win. Piggy said, if I ever decided to do a comedy gig, the amount of material I could get from these lives would sustain me forever. Get me get cast for blast sure. up. You want to start laughing? Get cast blast up here. Oh my god. I tell you who's funny is Anthony there, especially when he's got somebody in there like Cass Blast. Dude, I'm telling you. 
I love it. It's so fun. I understand, uh, Lonnie. Just knock yourself out. I've I've been there where you just give anything to be able to sleep through it. Yeah. He said, I don't drink liquor, but I'm tempted late here with a bottle of Jack. <laughs> I understand that wanting to sleep through it. Yeah. Take you a couple of slugs of that moonshine and sleep it off, sweat it out. Or make you a, a hot toddy. <laughs> no, no women when you got the flu. Women. Women, oh, okay. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> the wrong idea. I can't help you get better. <laughs> Yeah. Lemon, yeah. Cinnamon clouds. I've always got my head in the clouds. Sandy said a nip of brandy never did anyone any harm, especially when you're sick. But if you can't, really can't, or won't do any of that, take you a shot of knock will knock yourself out. My mom, when we were babies, my mom, when we were babies, you start teething. You put a little brandy on your gums to help them. Yeah. Help them. For, for sure. Not cool. It is. It's about to go on over there next to the bridge. Hot black coffee and a shot of whiskey will make you sweat it out. Yep. Hot toddies and very hot salsa will knock a lot of junk out of you. It really hot will. Hot titties. Did you say hot titties? <laughs> I don't know what that's going to knock out of you, Anthony, but it might. Depends on how, what that does for you. Does a lot. Well, there you are. That's a flu remedy for you. Hey, that I got some. Right on. Oh, oh, oh. Poles almost oh, going oh, in the water. Oh. Some Get blackberry them. spice rum for Christmas. Some hot boobies, man. I step right out of anything. Being <laughs> dead sleep. I could be dead asleep. You put one near me. I'm like, oh, I'm awake. <laughs> I don't even think that would help you out of the flu there, man. Oh, it would. It <laughs> would. It would because I'd start sweating after a couple minutes. <laughs> you got some blackberry spice around for Christmas? Oh, you might want might to take a couple slugs of that. Got another drum. Look at that. Yeah, look at that big old creature. Dang, Go that was on. on the bottle? No. He put it on the bottle to try to catch something. Fat creature. That's a fat creature. It's a fat chubby. Hey, swing it back over here again. Look at that. That's a nice, healthy. <laughs> Dude, he, ate that, a, he ate that big hook. <laughs> he ate that big hook. <laughs> Never tried that's the coffee whiskey combo? That's the kind of chub dreams are made of. <laughs> <laughs> he said that's the kind of chub dreams are made of. And I'll tell you what I love that rod. <laughs> that's a good chub move with that rod oh. there. <laughs> that's it's purple and like teal. Uh oh. If your rod's purple, rod got is. it's a hornet. Mad cat's hornet. Oh, oh the Here. rod. Oh, I thought you I thought you meant look. a different rod. <laughs> yeah, look at that rod, ain't it cool? Ooh, that's nice. Uh, Heck yeah. Sweet. We got no luck. No, I think it's like a goblin. Is a goblin green? Okay. I hope so. <laughs> I got this here. Uh, this is called a Mad Cat's Gatorade. And, uh, <laughs> hey, yeah, it's a big cat feeder ring. Feeder. This is big, yeah, this is a big cat fever uh, model. And, uh, you can pick it up at uh, it's uh, it's custom made, so you know it costs a lot of money. Mm. But uh, you know, to get started, table. visit your local convenience store. Right, right. <laughs> you visit your local <laughs> store. You know, don't steal it. Please buy it. 
and uh, right. and you can have a blast. <laughs> but not a cast blast. Not a cast blast. But not a cast blast. Uh, Sandy, you don't even even know we have a half a house sitting by the river. This Did you see it? Show. You care what you catch, man? You got to show the camera next time, all right? I don't care if it's a minnow. You show it, right? Uh huh. Cool. Sandy, did you see our little setup here, our little camp? Listen, I can't fish long if I'm real uncomfortable, and I don't like to fish from the car because y'all can't see the rods, or in this case, the, the bottles very easily. Hey, he feels good. <laughs> the wind just kind of blew it at me, and I got a wave of warm. I was like, heck yeah. You started at 3 a.m. I wasn't about to join in. I was going to bed. So you saw our set up here? He almost took you right in the water, bro. Yeah, I saw it. You, you, Gary, dude, he put the emergency brakes on it, dude. Wow. That's cool, too. Yeah. I think I like that one better. <laughs> I like that one. Peaky Tard, time for a biggie nap before Ellen's gig tonight. It's been fun to see y'all. Yeah, Lonnie, he said he's dead. He did. I like the blue over the pink one or purple one too. It's big too. Okay, Sandy, here we go. I'll give you the 10 cent tour. First of all, there's our bottle. Oh, a lot. So about but. Look at there. Our little awning that we used with a tarp thrown over it. Heater. Four chairs. Because not only is it really chilly today, it's windy too. <laughs> it does look like a homeless camp. But it's warm, so that's what matters. That looks cozier than a mouse in a haystack. It does. It's a whole lot better than sitting out here freezing or trying to sit in the car and watch watch some dang bottles. We do need a coffee pot, Keto. I could use something. We can make some Billy tea. I bet. This thing's nice to see a bite. Oh, no, no. 
Okay, just making an admission. Thank you for coming in and hanging out with us for a little while. Oh, crap. Where's Anthony? The tour's over. There we go. Thank you for coming in. Wow. We are at um we're at uh well I can't remember. Oh yeah, we're <laughs> we're at Bull Run Park on the clinch. Hey, uh, Ernest said, let's go, Travis. Start calling them fish in, bro. Mountain Hill? It's not really Mountain Hill, is it? No. This is up here behind uh, the uh, the old steam plant that shut down. Bull Run Steam Plant. Dark over here. Yeah, we're going to keep fishing, though. We're going to have to move from this spot. Uh, get to the where it's too dark. We're gonna go to a spot where there's some more lights, actually. I didn't know how close my name was to the camera. Keto said, where's Anthony's crew at? There? Tell him, Anthony, where you are. Uh, we're in Paducah, Kentucky, on the Tennessee River. Under a bridge. Paducah? Yeah. Paducah, Paducah. And, uh, I think yeah. we might switch to the Ohio River here in a minute. Yeah. No, we're not. No. Oh. <laughs> you can't go to the parks. It's going to get too dark. Okay, it's yeah. black. Make it up. You don't have any metal leaders, do you, Travis? You don't have any metal leaders, do you? Morgan was close to metal leaders. Are y'all are y'all getting ready to move, Anthony? I had it facing the camera but the wrong know. way. You're real great. Oh. No, Stacy was on, but he uh, his battery died on his phone. He was on here for a while, but his battery died. So then he said he was warming his feet up. 
facing the wrong way. Oh no. Now I don't feel nothing. Oh no. Oh. It's tough when you use a J hook. You really got to set them, you know, as opposed to. Yeah. Oh, you didn't miss one? Yeah. It's yeah. Like, it's like, woo. Oh, it spun it good? Yeah, it did. It did the barber pole for sure. Oh, dang it. Yeah, but it was right behind the, the camera because I got to face him. Every, you know, the other way. He had the camera on the wrong one. <laughs> Figures. It's did funny good, too, he said. That's cool. Yeah. So. Lisa, we haven't had any luck. No. They're catching some on poles out there, drum and stuff, but. Lisa caught, Lisa caught her PB today out fishing. 37 and a half pound blue. <laughs> Was she fishing from See. a boat? Yeah, pontoon. Wow. That's awesome. She's been traveling all over trying to search for that big blue. Yeah. And it paid off. And it paid off. But that's what we do. We don't travel around looking for that big boy. Yeah. I see you know, you can, like, they would use the leaders and that would have to some books, but they would like get all crowned up. Yeah. There isn't any way to really fix them, is there? <laughs> Rod and reel fish on. Oh, uh, Rod and reel fish on. Yeah. He's down, down, them boys down. <laughs> it, it's hard to cross for them. I've been on Brandon College a little while ago. Randy said we ran almost 300 yards from the ramp. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's hard to read. You could take it up. A little uh, ring, you know, that you can turn and put on the end of it. Yeah, we got Drum City over here. Oh, yep. wow. Ooh, that, that came to the center of this homeless shelter. Is that right? Is that river? Right? Oh, that river looks like it's moving from that, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that, this one's cold. Let me go get the fish. I'll be right back. Okay. Because going to get a fish? Yeah, they caught one on the rod and reel down there on the end again. They're wearing them out down there. He's showing them off. I want a sabiki rig in a contest that's coming from Scotland. I mean, in a giveaway, not a contest. It's a giveaway. Cool. Now they look like they're going back right. Well, no catfish have been caught, Sandy, but... If I had to say there was a winner for today, it would probably be um, Gary. 
the biggest drum of the day, my buddy Tyler. We gotta come real close. This thing's actually a pretty good kind of drum. Well, that's a nice drum. Lisa yeah. said they're at Nachi Creek about to hit home. Go, go down a little bit. Where can you catch that one at today, Lisa? That was off that crawler. Ride them real. Yeah, they're wearing out them drums. <laughs> Goodbye, Drew. Lots of creek is up there in my neck of the woods. We always lost phone service. Phone service down there after Notch Creek. Good service, right? Straight across from the boat ramp, she said. I'm better. On the on the bottle? Oh. Oh. Bell shows. Yes, I do. I'm actually really shocked that we haven't pulled in a channel cat that's close. I know it. I'm shocked that we haven't either. This is the channel cat spot. Right. Randy said it was the closest place out of the wind. They said they said across from the boat ramp. Yep. That was on telecom. Oh. Well, uh, tarp stopped flopping. Nashi Creek. Them balloons act funny, don't they? Yeah, it's just with that between the wind and the current, the chunk of water, probably. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm sure some nibbled on up here, there, but. Yeah, I expected to catch a couple three for sure. We rarely ever come here that we don't catch a fish. I just checked one of the bottles. I still got my skipjack pieces. Nothing's even touched them yet. There you go. I'm gonna recast it. Watch out, Gary. Don't let me I get you now. Yeah. Nice. Woo. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I almost spooled it. I ain't got that much left. <laughs> you about spooled this bottle. <laughs> You got two bars. This is like, you know, nothing. This is not, this is actually kind of fun. Different. I can't believe we haven't caught anything here. Yeah, way down there. I mean, like, right there on the corner. This one, but you know, just the... don't you know when you got the camera aimed at that one, the other one will get hit. Right, I know. <laughs> I 
They both start moving in the same direction at the same time, so. It pulls that line, though, don't it? Come on, bottle spin. Cindy, One of you. Cindy, yeah. remember, um, I don't know if they had them in Tennessee, but it was like in the Kmart days, they had a uh, store called Venture. They were kind of like Kmart, and they had, that was, that was the color, their colors. Uh-huh. Does that ring a bell? What was it called? Venture. It was just like Kmart. It was called Venture. I don't remember them having them here. No. Okay. Because every time I look at this bottle, these bottles, it reminds me of that store because that was kind of like the, the ski. <laughs> we used to have our roses and what other department stores were there? Skyway, Sky Skymart, or something like that. Sky City, that was it. Sky City. You got a yellow bench? Yeah. Well, I wish we could, like, want to take it and run off with it. You have to take off and get to that thing before it spooled it. Yeah. <laughs> it. Before you before it spooled you. Oh, that's a more thing. That. When I was put line on these things, I was, if I twist the line up, I had to cut it all off the first time, and then literally roll it on the thing, so it stopped that line twist. Really? Yeah, it was weird. So, so that, so that little youngest here, Gary. Did I catch another one? Yeah, he, he wasn't even sure it was. I don't even think he knew it was on there. <laughs> well, this is my tip. Size. They're fun, though. As soon as I uh -huh. see the rod, he was on. <laughs> Are you guys able to see the yellow on them? Yeah, the yellow. Acceleration about turn them to the side. Yeah. <laughs> that's a yellow. That's why, you know, obviously that's why they're yellow bass. So it goes. We you eat the white bass anything. here sometimes. He's lucky I got enough to eat. Depending on where it comes from. It's all in the sink. Yeah, they are good bait. We got four different kinds of bait, and not it's all kind of came to the channel cat, yeah. and haven't caught a damn cat. Still had a cat. piece of worm in his mouth, but I, it wasn't. I know it. Worm. That's either. I mean, we got a smorgasbord, a buffet of, of baits. Yeah. Can't get a catfish to buy. Like you guys are using liver too, right? Chicken liver. I heard you say that earlier. Yeah, we got chicken liver, chicken shad, creek chub. Skipjack, carp, right, and a partridge in a pear tree. Hey, Michelle Mason, welcome in. Night but nightcrawler and livers alone should have produced some channel. I, started, started using right. I couldn't see any. <laughs> I mean, we the potential yeah. for blue cat is just as high as channel cat, but you would think. We would have got a, a bunch of channels by now. Right? We expected to get several channel cat. Yeah. That's this place channel is channel. usually good for channel cat. I mean. Yeah. Two days. 
three days ago. Stacy said Anthony needs bluegill. Oh my god. This damn bluegill. Sandy said it's time to spank a pineapple in a voodoo fish dance. You know any voodoo fish dances? Bottle spinning huh? there, Gary? Spinning. Right out there, right? <laughs> yeah, one of them start pouring. Yeah, oh. that's probably what would happen is one of us would do a dance and it'd start raining. Yeah, but you got shelter. You're all right. Hey, guess what, Anthony? No. Guess what? 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 You can, you're not on stairs that are in danger in your life, so it's time for you to teach us how to do you. No, I can't do that right here. Why not? Uh, it's too dangerous. too much rocks on the ground. You can't. <laughs> I told you to do it. I know you're supposed to be breakdancing. I said I would, but not. This is not the. This is not the street. It ain't never gonna be. Let me say you're gonna have to go live from the parking lot before you go to the fishing hole, so that you can show it your moves. Yeah, just I, I can't. I can't do that right here. Teach me how to do things. How to do Sandy this. said that you are chicken livered. Listen here, Sandy. <laughs> Go back to bed. And also, yeah, she said you were chicken livered too. Hey, I tried last time. It was just not the spot. But this is definitely not the spot here. There's, there's rocks all over the place. <laughs> it's not just not the spot. It's definitely not the spot. This one's this one's almost as bad as this one. There's actually better because it was flat. It was just here. It's it was, <laughs> Andy said, I never left my bed. Yeah. <laughs> she just came out. She's ah, oh, I'm gonna wake up and bust Tony's butt a little bit. Wow, we'll give him some hell. <laughs> I tell you what, I really wish Cass Blast was in here. Hey, it's fun to give hell. <laughs> it's fun. It's that was fun the best live he, stream the other day. He totally laughs, which you know. You got on a roll and it was on. That was funny. Somebody needs to get one of them butt removers and have it personalized and send a cast blast. Uh, listen up. Make it like gold. You know. <laughs> Send it to him. Have you seen have you seen lately what the views got? Had did he crack the two million mark? Um no, I think he was at like one nine. One nine? Yeah. <laughs> He said the drag. That's what he's trying to say. I don't. <laughs> Sandy said, "Give people hell's what I was made for." Hell raisins, Sandy. Rooting, tooting, shootingest. <laughs> <laughs> there you are. <laughs> they need a mud flap with with the Sandy on the back of it with their two. Six turns. Old boy over. Yeah. Breakers. What time is it? Four o'clock? Uh oh. They're about to cross. On fish, she said, "Ride or die, sweetheart." You can't stop with a stick. Mister Rogers said, "Looks like some fish moving around in and uh, in out there." Anthony looked big. I didn't, I didn't hear that. Mr. Rogers. Mr. Rogers. Mr. Rogers. 
Oh, Lord bring, some, bring some fish to our neighborhood, Mr. Rogers. To our there you go. To our <laughs> bring some fish to our neighborhood, Mr. Rogers. <laughs> he might bring a big old turtle. No. Well, you know what? Bring a big snapper. That's always fun. That's cool. Did you ever see the video of him with that big old turtle? No. Oh, gosh. It's what, large and in charge. No. What, what, what state was that? Mr. Rogers? Yeah. What state was that? Hey, get a bike over here. Hey, get, get a bike over here. Pay attention. Yeah, it's just a uh, three foot. What you got there? Six. No, you... he, he ripped his six foot one all the shreds. Uh oh. Some rocks there, Mark. Mr. Rogers says it's a good time with those snappers. Indianapolis, Indiana. He's in Indianapolis. Oh, snack. Yeah, that's the kind he used to have, wasn't it? Snapping turtles are the best. Yeah. You can get them big old soft shell turtles. They get pretty. I mean, they don't get snappers, but yeah. they, they can get a good size, though. Mr. Rogers should be Mr. Turtle. <laughs> Mr. Turtle Rogers. That was a big old turtle he had a hold of. Has he got a vid? Is it? Is there a vid up of? Is it? A, is it a long form video or short? I can't remember, Mr. Rogers. Yeah, it's on his page. I'll have to check it. You know, Turtle Lady has a lot of turtle videos. She likes to go in and get them. We should have turtle videos. I wish I had something to use as a privy in here. We've been live for five hours. No fish. Five hours, oh. two minutes, 51, 52, 53 seconds. <laughs> Me too, Mr. Rogers. I wish we could get on them right now. We're supposed to get some big blues here in the winter, but they're just... They won't, they're, they're just not eating. They're not traveling around. They're hunkered down. It keeps getting warm and then cold and then warm and then cold. You've moved and you're all settled in there. There's a few new lakes and ponds, but they're all posted. That sucks. He would have been one third of the way to Australia by now. I don't know. Yeah, you're going to have to go make some friends, Mr. Rogers. Yeah. He'd be a third of the way to Australia if you could fry him out of these hills.
that's what you got to do is make them believe you're just the, what they need to come and fish their ponds. Travis, undoing. I said undoing. We were down yonder, and there wasn't nothing there. There ain't nothing there. There ain't nothing. Yeah, it's a little cold to be cast in. We've been live for five hours. Yeah, them balloons are fixing the curls. Uh, wish it was because that was awful enough. Tyler came by. Tyler came by here. Our good friend. He's over here cleaning up drums on the rod and reel. Yeah. Is, is, is it him that's been catching them, Tyler? He's got, I believe this is his third one. Yeah, something, something flipped right in here just a few minutes ago. Yeah, drum or bubble. Hey, Jane, and Jay. What's going on? Did you say he was new to YouTube? He to be a new channel. Yeah, he just. I'm not sure if he's. Are, are you, uh, Tyler, are you going to be putting content on the channel? Yeah, he just started. You know, they have a channel. Oh, okay. Well, another big drum. Let's see. Look at there, another big. Look at there. Just all six thousand of that people up here will subscribe. Bring it back. Bring it back. All of them subscribe. Thank you. He was grown. There you go. Their mouths are so weird looking. Look at that. He it's like they have. Drum. Yeah. He's been catching the hound out of drum. Freshwater drums. Some people call them sheep heads. Some they have like an yellow. inner mouth and an outer mouth. <laughs> yeah, their teeth are in past. They have like little teeth. It's in inside their mouth as opposed to on their lips and stuff. Stick your finger in there, Anthony. You could use that thing for bait. <laughs> <laughs> he stuck his finger near nothing. Put finger in the fish. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to make him puke. You should never listen to, to Travis. Oh, they got something else on? Oh, I saw that. You thought he had something. To oh, no. So good to be. Still alive. All right, Tyler, get Dad, did you get a nap? Yeah, yeah, kitty, yeah, kitty, yeah, kitty, yeah. Yeah. It's what? Why are the blinds coming back in? 
Well, that, red, well, that line on that red one's keeping that blue one in check, it looks like. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think it's pretty fun to be a big video right there. Check my page. Hmm. The check my page. The page. Hmm. Check my Yeah, they've been kids. They went, went. They've been wearing their drums out. <laughs> My tongue got tangled. Thing got tangled. But um, they've been wearing their drums out over there. Five, seven, one. Oh, okay. Nine hundred thirty-seven thousand. How many total page views I have? I'm trying to bust a million. Those numbers are unbelievable to me. Their trip. Yeah. Has the wind died down or is it just wishful thinking on my part? It's definitely died down. The surface of the water looks different. It looks like I can see a little bit of blue sky too. Man, I tell you what, if these clouds clear out, the bottom will drop out of that temperature tonight. I, uh, I've been doing this since March. Yeah, total page. That's crazy to me right there. Last week. Yeah. 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 Not too long after I started posting content, I did a video of Travis throwing the cast net. He got 11,000 views. I was like, woo! <laughs> it just kept on going up. Okay, Sandy. Time to shed the bed and get started on the day. Ugh. I didn't want to do that this morning. Do what? It's so damn now, though. They are that kind. And I've discovered. There are more. You can scrub. I actually found it. Uh, I found somebody doing it. And
So I know if I was watching someplace and every time I went to the fire thing, I was watching the Oh, and after all, it's annoying. What's going on? Thank you for the like. Oh, that's cool. It looks like a, a like a beacon. Yeah, like a bird skull. <laughs> Anthony's bored. <laughs> Anthony, jump in the water. Hey, what Jesus. river are you on? Anthony? Polar bear. Polar bear plunge. <laughs> right in Tennessee. The it's really cold, man. Yeah. Hey, Arkansas said uh, Anthony catching wood. <laughs> Catch a what? A lid? Arkansas said uh, is Anthony catching wood. <laughs> when Arkansas around, I can't do it. <laughs> Hi, Arkansas. Thanks for the wood. <laughs> Walk around. Hmm. Did you go down there to the Port of John? I was asking Mark if he went down to the Port of John. Yeah. Was it bad? No, the state, but it's someplace to be very cross control. Bring it all over the, everything. Where it went loose with a water hose, the uh, fire hose. It lures. She LOL, Anthony. That's what I was thinking. It'd be nice. Can you go back? Um, we haven't got anything else on the bottles, Chris, but. Um, the Tyler and the Gary, I guess, down there are wearing the drums out on rods and reels. Oh, there you are. It's going to wash you away. Right. There goes the bottles. Welcome back in, Monty. Wow. Ain't nothing. We're still at it, Dale. I'm not sure we know when to give up. Hadn't tried it. What are you doing, Gary? He will be snake. Some juice. Cherry What's just found me. <laughs> what are those Crocs? Crocs. I can see why they. <laughs> And a pair of shoes. 
Did it quit sucking the heat out there? Pair of shoes and socks. Different. It's kind of crazy. You got to take it. This time of year? Right. He's swimming in this water right now. Getting a bite on that one? Caught a night crawler here today. Night crawlers. You have a hand fish from a bottle. Yep. Gary over there with Anthony has caught one. I don't know if she can make out our bottles or not. It's getting kind of dim. They caught one and uh, and then. Uh, Stacy him with Bank Fish and Adventures. He caught one. A uh, got little bluegill, right and here. Anthony it's caught a, a or Gary caught a right whopper. Trapper, whopper. <laughs> hey, Hunter. Guard dogs. <laughs> Monty wants to know what baits you're using, Anthony. It's night crawlers. Got night crawlers, skipjack out, and these those stupid catfish nugget bite bullet square thing from Walmart. I'll show you what they are. These things right here, too, but damn, damn. You know what I mean? I, I don't ever use these. The first time you there, they them. are catfish nuggets. Yeah, catfish nuggets. They're like I'll show you. Let me open one up. It says blood. They're like little blood. Squares. They're like little tiny squares. Yeah, catfish bait. It's like it's got a waxy texture. It's like it feels like it's like wax squares. Three bucks and can't fish nuggets in Walmart. Okay, so we have some girls. Are three blood? Hey, uh, bank fishing. Stacy said, taste it. Pretty go. Tyler just left. Hey, Stacy said, taste it. Taste it. That's what he said. Take one for the team, Anthony. You guys dance. Taste the bait. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> At least it's not a skipjack or a, or a chad. Ain't doing it. I'll try it. Look at the ingredients. See what it says in it. In it. I don't want to look at it. If I got to bite it, it's like five thirty. I know it's in it. <clears throat> yeah, look what the ingredients are. And then if it ain't real bad, then taste it. Well, it doesn't. Nate said the packaging is getting fancy. All it says is blood. Blood squares. Blood squares. That's the only ingredients, blood. One hundred made using one hundred percent real natural oils, proteins, high fatty amino acids, which create a scent a, a scent that cannot resist. That's all. Going to Douglas Monday. Nate said, "Think of it as a pepper." Think of it as a pepper. <laughs> Just eat it. Just eat it. Oh. <laughs> now he stuck his nose up to it. He said, "A thing." Do you want me he to said a bite of catfish nugget, looks like dude. Velveeta or some kind of Velveeta bag with Velveeta squares or something. That's what uh, Nate, Nate said. The packaging is getting fancy. <laughs> it doesn't say not for human consumption. You're good. I don't think dude. he's caught any fish with it, Monty. Catfish. Do you guys hear what Gary said? Say that again, Gary. No, I'm saying 
it doesn't say you might be going to Douglas. That'll be cool. Consumption. You gonna eat one, Gary? No, eat one, Gary. Ah, <laughs> oh, he just whisked out. Come on, Gary. It does it not say you can't eat it. Take one for the team, Gary. It don't say for not for human consumption. Not for human or pet consumption. Is that what? Not for human or pet consumption. Oh, what if you got a pet catfish? That's disgusting. I can't do it. <laughs> oh my God! Keto said crush it to get a straw. Hashtag corn nut. Oh. <laughs> Are we gonna try? Now that he said not for human consumption, he's thinking about trying it. <laughs> Hunter said a dollar if you eat it. <laughs> Nate said double dog bear you. Holler at a dog. Triple dog bear. Oh. <laughs> Wax. It's a what? Wax. <laughs> Dale Hayswip said I wouldn't eat it. Sucking <laughs> <laughs> my teeth. He's confused. Arkansas said, don't do it. Oh my they God. said the fish wouldn't even eat it. Won't even eat it. It's awful. He said it's awful. Why'd you do that? Anything for the team. <laughs> That's awful. Face is all red. Dang it. I hate this channel. I hate this channel. <laughs> hey, Wabbit, Nate said, good man. It was Nate's fault. Don't blame his channel. Anything for ratings. <laughs> Anything for ratings. Keto said, P U K E. <laughs> it's, it's wax. Ralph, Pearl. Subscribe to Ralph. <laughs> Arkansas is laughing. Oh. Hunter said I will when I get home and deal is a deal. <laughs> hey, Hunter and Steph said that's probably what sushi tastes like. You, you Sherry really said I doubt you'll die from it, but it might make you sick. <laughs> Gosh, I said, why said, would you what do What happened that? to Anthony? Well, he ate some cabbage bait. I said, why yeah. did you do that? I didn't think you would. Why did you say scared me? You think you can use those? <laughs> they scared me. Listen, do not get into peer pressure, Tony. <laughs> just say no. They're bad influences. Me and Gary were just talking about no one can influence us on stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you went yeah, right I'm for it. I'm bad influence. No one can influence me. I'm eating cabbage food. Um, you already do. Was, don't you? Hey. He, watched, he watched the Christmas story over the last. He watched a Christmas story over the last few days. <laughs> I triple dog dare you. I triple dog dare fool. <laughs> you know, said teamwork makes the dream work. Hashtag nightmares. <laughs> It did not taste like anything. Nate <laughs> said, "No, don't blame me." Everybody in this stream is guilty. <laughs> Everybody's guilty. <laughs> you can't stop. I, I honestly didn't think you'd cave. Dude, I never do stuff like that. That's like the you most ultimate crazy. Piece of video hey, uh, really though. Uh, Viewers went up to like 36 when you did that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's been almost like the peak in the live. I choose it too because I you know you got to get the savory you know, parts. You, you know? know you are what you eat. <laughs> Just think if you eat two of them, then we might make it to 40. Gary said you are what you eat, and I'm a catfish bro. You know, because Gary says you are. Do a commercial eat. for it now. <laughs> Not only does it stick to your teeth, but catfish like it too. 
<laughs> I don't know, honey. Keto said, way to go, Tone, at a boy. <laughs> Stacy said it wasn't a triple dog dare. It was only double dog dare. They said he the only double dog dared you. He didn't triple dog dare you. Dude, the, the taste that is still lingering is awful. You got something to drink? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm I was going to say, reach down there and reach down there and get you a handful of that river water. <laughs> I'll let you, oh, man. Can't be no worse. I'll let you know how bad it is tomorrow morning. But... <laughs> it may not take that long. <laughs> So far from a bathroom. <laughs> so far from a bathroom, he said. So Can't miles. fishing Fred notes said, do it again. Some of us missed it. Yeah, go ahead and replay it. <laughs> it's to replay. I understand two dollars if you do it again. <laughs> I ain't doing Tito it. said discovered a new dip flavor. Uh oh, Kevin B. Said, do a night crawler. You want to kill your appetite? Chew on some catfish, but chunks. <laughs> Stacy said, brush your teeth with that Budweiser. I'm afraid to drink anything. I don't know if I want to go all the way, all the way down to the stomach. <laughs> Kevin B wants you to eat a night crawler. Kevin B, you eat a night crawler. Hunting <laughs> <laughs> stuff said, did you do you need to lick a fish's ass to get the taste out of your mouth? <laughs> That might be better. <laughs> Drum, I need to lick his butt, Gary. <laughs> I'm going to call him Cash. You can remove his butt first. I'm going to tell Cash Blast, hey, somewhere in them poop hole removers, we got a situation. <laughs> I was going to say, you can take it out and then lick it. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh man. Hey, Keto said Pringles will award you a lifetime surprise if they approve approve the new flavor. Pop in your mouth and you can't stop. <laughs> Hunter said smelling it will ruin my appetite anyway. Yeah, don't do that either. Do gulp minnows. Ugh. I challenge I challenge Stacy to eat some uh, the power bait, some of that pasty yep. Power bait, take a big finger of that. <laughs> Eat some of that, uh, what you call it, bait? What is it, the JVT Center? Stick and all. What is it's it? Pack bait. Pack, pack bait. Eat some pack bait. Kevin B said, I seen a guy eat a night crawler for $5 once. I seen somebody eat one for free. Just to uh, freak some kids out. He just popped in his mouth. Uh, did you chew it? Kevin B said he survived. Well, good for him. <laughs> Hunter said, "Drink the juice of gold minnows. You won't, you won't want no fish. He don't eat Look, fish anyway." Dude, this is nonsense. Tony fishes, but he do, does not eat fish. That's about the fishiest thing I ever ate in <laughs> twenty. <laughs> Hunter said, "My friend, to you, my friend eats grasshoppers. I'd rather eat a grasshopper than that. That's stuff. I, I, did I take those? Uh, you know, you can get those crickets in Gatlinburg that's flavored like different things. I've had chocolate crickets in San Francisco on Pier Thirty Nine. They weren't bad. Arkansas wants some fried bass. You missed it. Sounds <laughs> a bit for you earlier." Huh? Huh? and stuff said there was a kid in high school that would eat dead flies for a quarter goofy bastard <laughs> <laughs> goofy bastard that's gross <laughs> yeah. one with the coat with the label on it it's not tight though. Oh, it is spinning. Spinning. 
Since I had any fried bass, bass turds. All right. Yeah. Hey, Anthony, cast blasters in chat. But he's got us on mute because he's in the deer stand. You missed it. You missed it. You missed it. You missed it. Tito said, wax is flammable. Fire starters are made of wax. See if it'll light. Are you getting a bite? Can you feel it, Travis? It's a weird bite, right? It's like a weird, different, different. It only took a little while to get a bite. I know it. Right? Who is the kid? He's just started a channel. What is the name of your channel? BFC Cats. BFC Cats, Hunter. What's that BFC mean? What's BFC mean? Big effing cat fish. That's what he's going to say. Flathead channels. Blue Flathead and channels is what BFC stands for. Nice. That's nice. That's good one. BFC Cats. Um, go in there and drop your link if you want to get type in pineapple. Hunter will get you. Hunter's about, uh, he's 12, but he does a lot of fitness. I, I can't do Nightbot from there. You gotta do a bunch of commands. You gotta go to Nightbot TV, set up an account. He's gonna come in and drop his link. Link, bang. Well, we got a bite on the thing. I know it. What kind of model do you got there, Travis? Do what? What kind of models are those? So what? Did you already say? What is that? What, what what kind of bottles are you using? Oh, Coke bottles, aren't they? Yeah, they're just Coke bottles. Twenty one ounce. Of the, one of the Mountain Dew bottles. <laughs> Mountain bottle, <laughs> Mountain Dew bottle and Coke bottles. Yeah, and twenty ounces. Do the do. You got two two more subs there. <clears throat> Hundred said 195 subscribers, not bad. I have 185, I think, maybe 186. So I'll have to check. Hunter's done a couple of lives. That sucks. Taste lingers. Oh, we got 105. Arkansas subbed you, Hunter. There you go. Bye. Growing like a weed. Hunter fishes down to Poland Creek a lot. He's fixing to go to Douglas Monday. <clears throat> yeah, 
yeah, they still won't let you do chat on yours, will they, Hunter? How come you can't do chat? I don't know. I think it might be because he's underage. Oh. Oh. But he can still post content. I'll still I'll film Douglas. I'll go up live if we do. That'd be cool. It's got a one bite though. Yeah. Don't see him. Yeah, something definitely is funny. This thing looks brighter. Yeah, give me credit. Bait stealers. <laughs> I wonder if they nibbled bait to death on this on the worm rod over here for the worm Nothing. bottle. Nothing had touched it. I know. Yes, last tuning in from the tree stand. This one with the garlic. The bottles are actually showing up better than they have been, but there's lots down there. There he is. He's reeling in. <laughs> it looks like he's boxing. <laughs> Man, alive. Yeah, I threw these I threw these knife rollers out when we first got here. They're still moving. Uh, wow. He didn't drown. All right, let's cast it. What's he going to do? Eat the worm? <laughs> I don't think so. Arkansas said, I got more subscribers before I actually posted content. Now I don't get as many. That's going to be the mob. That's going to be the mob. No. Oh, yeah. I had to go in. No, I didn't have to start a live. You go into a fast live. I think. You know, I had to go on to the to the. Uh, <clears throat> oh well, he's talking about to set up Nightbot. You have to go in. I had to go into the desktop part of it and go into moderators because it'll give you a list of everybody that's moderators. And you have to actually physically add that. I had to click on the link for Nightbot and add it to the Nightbot. Yeah, that's what he's talking about setting up his Nightbot. I could not set up Nightbot except on my laptop. And I had uh, Tasha from uh, Art and Adventures with Tasha. Tasha helped me set mine up. These are the catfish nugget thing. Nothing. Not been touched, huh? And then I threw these in when we first got here. Hunter's has his most viewed video has eight point eight thousand views. Sweet. I thought my videos were gonna get like three. But nuggets oh, don't even. And then you gotta make make that bought a moderator. <laughs> I tell you what, these uh I am getting real hot on your feet. I keep thinking I've got it too close to the heater. <laughs> but I don't have to worry about cold toes, that's for sure. Yeah. 
They work real good. It takes a while. Oh man. Oh, it's okay. Oh, okay. Okay. He said it looked like something had posted it down. Thank you. Yeah. All right, we got some uh, skipjack pieces. What you got there? Skipjack. Not to be biting on it. Well, bait. <clears throat> We're still waiting on the bottom to spin. Or a rod to take off would be nice too. It don't matter. Something. I guess we might have to get a light out here in a minute. If the wind keeps blowing that blowing out there or what? I, oh, I didn't hear him. I think we're getting pretty good at throwing these bottles out. I would say I got it down. You know what? Hmm. For, uh, <laughs> here, get over here. I can't hardly hear your phone. <laughs> I'm so putting both in there and I'm private time. Get up. Wait, sir. Woo! Yours has got the ring light on it. Ooh. Yeah, that last boat. Ring light. Look at that. Fancy. <laughs> oh, I feel so much better. I think I can stay now. <laughs> I was like, we gotta go. <laughs> we gotta wrap this up. <laughs> no, I'm good now. <sighs> Oh, God. 
dark here. Look at it. It's a lot yeah. lighter there. You can barely You're see that it. much. That much west makes that much difference. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that purple. It makes the sky look purple and stuff. Yeah. What are you beating on? <laughs> He's playing the drums. It's a catfish hour here, you know? Right <laughs> it's hot. I can watch these pictures. Hey, Travis. Yeah. I'm thinking with these chicken hooks, and there's no, no hide, there's no reef. So you definitely have to set the hook on these things if you get catfish. Yeah. He said it's, it's the chase hooks. So you definitely have to set the hook on, on those. It's, oh, okay. Just, right? Yeah, I ended up using some small circle hooks. So hopefully if something grabs it, basically just, you know what I'm saying? I think they're like one ounce. They're pretty The ones we use exactly, the ones we use for trout. Because we were, we were trying to give ourselves the best chance of hooking something. Right. What are you doing? Somebody needs to pop up and check. I got my hopes up on that one. Yeah, I know. I was hoping to check out. You never know. I guess we can set it every day as well. Don't seem like it gets reset. No. There's a noise on here. A noise. There you go. That must be a guy.
I wonder if it's that. Gary's getting some nibbles on the bottle. Uh oh. Nibbles on the bottle. Yep. Nibbles on the bottle. Getting that time got dark by bottle nipper. <laughs> I can't handle bars. Did he get him? No, he just didn't. Oh, he he missed, missed it. Yeah. Just... Still daytime for them? Yeah, they're about five hours away instead of us. Above nine. I wish you got dark at 9 30. Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Crap. Instead of being a five foot light I hate it getting dark early. Yeah, well, we definitely saw you pull it back. <laughs> yeah, these looks are definitely too big for me to pull back. Yeah, I hope that's not this heater. I hope it hadn't been doing it the whole life. That's Chad. Hey, Chad. Everybody out there, are we getting a uh, like a drum noise? Oh, what happened? Do we look? What did you do? Can you answer me? I might have. Message him. He don't care to. I'm pretty sure it's just the heater. It sounds like the heater. I think it is the heater. It's going to do, 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 do. Sounds like the heater. Yeah, I don't hear it now. Oh, yeah, we're still fishing. I either kicked Tony out accidentally. Or, uh, I'll hear it now. I might have hit remove from stage instead of exit solo layout. <laughs> so many I made earlier. First day. Come back, Anthony. He might be eating more catfish pro. <laughs> he just don't want nobody to see. What it is the drag is all the way up. Oh, there he is. Hey, we're There's back. We just we just had a little drum, a little baby drum. Ah. Uh, but you, uh, you catch, I was, it said you, I was in backstage the whole time. Really? Yeah. That's weird. But I went back out and came back in, blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool. I may have done that instead of exiting solo. I may have uh, removed you from stage to right now you're next to each other. I my see the text pop up as you're doing it. The phone don't want to respond to my fingers because they're listen. Look, I mean, you know, because you're chatting the group. They're like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not on there. It's so I have to hit it five or six times. Oh, to get really it. And I see yeah, yeah, I, but I'm, yeah. Uh, I think it's yeah. because uh, you know, they're like four hours. Three or four hours west of us. Hold on. Bring, blow this one up. Here. Sorry. I didn't mean to click on that. <laughs> there we go. This is this was Gary's Gary's hybrid earlier wiper on the uh, on the hand line on the oh. bottle. Yeah, that's what he caught on the bottle. That was the first one on the bottle. Right that's there. awesome. Crazy. 
Yeah. Our bottle spun a few minutes ago, but <laughs> nothing happened. Apple. Laptop. On your box. On Nightcrawlers. The J-Rig. The J-Rig. <laughs> I have to oh, monetize my lives and everything from the laptop. Oh, I tell you, I found an A-Rig. Huh? I found an A-Rig. Oh, really? You could from a desktop, as long as you can sign on to your YouTube and your StreamYard and everything from there. All the parts you can attach it. All I got to do is just... Oh yeah, the gold I got up there. Oh yeah, yeah, that's, that's awesome. Spin. Spin the bottle. Bottle. Get it, get it. It actually spun on the bottle. It spun it. Did it? It went. Come on, bottle. Come on, bottle. Yeah. <laughs> Don't miss it. Come on, man. May have missed the bite. <laughs> you almost don't know what to do. Do I let it run? Do I do I grab it? What do I do? They told you I, I'd let it pull up pretty good on it. Yeah, but it's weird. But you got like, J-Hooks, so. Oh, the other bottle's going off. We got two bottle bites going. Oh, Gary, you get them? No, so. Oh, damn it. I think that's the night crawlers. Gary missed it. No, but he was it. Oh. He was hitting it. Hey, Fishing FX. Welcome in. Bottle bites. <laughs> Bottle bites. I know. All right. We'll put it back on the. Well, it was put. Hung up in the 80 pound leader brake before the 50 pound brake. Wow, it's actually pretty easy fishing using these bottles. It's actually about as easy as it gets, you know what I mean? You just don't get out super far, that's all, right? Oh, Gary's gonna oh, the Oh, the bottle's spinning. Oh, the bottle's spinning. <laughs> Figures. I turn the camera, and the bottle starts spinning. Damn it. You got to watch it. <laughs> <laughs> that thing fits off a lot of light. I see a couple of fish jumping out there now. They have not been doing all of them. I was, I was I surprised. Was I didn't know it was. Let's see this thing spin. At least I have to turn. Oh, yeah. They're uh, um, throwing bottle. and letting come off, off, come off the bottle. Come on, bottle. Come on, bottle. Is it pretty bad if we're talking to bottles? <laughs> as long as they don't talk back, you're good. Okay, good. Good, good. It has to not talk about it yet. So. I talk to inanimate objects all the time. Oh. Hello, Mr. Wall. How are you? Yeah, door, uh, door facings are my favorite because I run into them all the time. Oh, there it goes. Oh. It was pulling mm -hmm. it a little bit. It didn't spin it, but yeah. I see a line in front of him. The one in front of him. Oh, no. I wonder if that's break time. Let's pack it on. Let me use a mirror. Maybe we get a closer view. Here, water spraying. 
Yes, Keto, I, I run into the, into door jams and stuff all the time, so I like to talk to them, tell them to get out of my way and stuff. <laughs> well, check out your turkey video, Hunter. Come on, bottle. What the heck? It's got to be these little yellow bass. They just peck at your stuff. You know, a watch bottle never spins. Right. What kind of game is this? The bottle don't spin. This sucks. <laughs> oh, 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 it's getting bites. I need to put the bottles on a drill. That way, if you get a bite, you can just hit that button and reel it in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like uh, dude did on the Christmas tree. <laughs> Catfish, he'll just take it. You know what I'm saying? Just book it. Oh. <laughs> that today? Yeah. Right now? 300. 29 people in here. Catch one, Tony. I'm trying. I think we missed it. Damn it. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's hard to set the hook on them. These, I, we're pretty sure it's yellow bass and they're really small mouth. So. They're just picking at it. Put Steven in there. At least something's hitting on yours, though. <laughs> mm. Oh, yeah, there's like barely any worm left. I got to rebait it. <laughs> okay, good make it, yeah. Have a good one. Come on, fish, dang it. No, it's not easy. It looks like it would be, but no. Hey, Ken. Welcome in. Oh, <laughs> We can call it a day, bro. Fighting it. Muffin said, I just went back and watched Tony eat that catfish bait, lol. I hate this channel, he says. <laughs> oh, man. Don't do that. No, that was a funny part. Though. That was a good yeah. part. You actually love this channel. I love it. <laughs> We're I not boring. You guys. I, I just hate the crap you guys suggest me to do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why it is. You're, you're just fun that way. <laughs> hey, you know, let's have fun, man. It's all about having fun, right? Boring Fisherman said, it took me so long to come in. been cleaning this mess of a brim and a white bullhead. Cool. I haven't seen a white bullhead in ever. Puff Muffin said, oh, yeah, it's always fun. We try to. Uh-oh. Well, guys, we're going to call it.
It's getting dark. We didn't bring any lights. Yeah, we're getting ready to call it too. Yeah. And yeah. And we just didn't want to place you want to walk around in the dark either. Yeah, we didn't want to call it before you did. So we, yeah, we <laughs> were just trying to outlast you. Hey, if that's the case, we're staying. <laughs> hey, it's a good view right there. It kind of looks like if you if you if you move just right, this can make like animals and stuff right there. Yeah, oh, you're silhouetted oh, 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 just oh, right. Oh, oh. Does my there hat look like the bill of my hat looks like the bill of an ostrich or something? Yeah. Platypus. <laughs> 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 We can do this all night. <laughs> We're here all night, people. <laughs> it's the platypus hour. <laughs> Is that the noise a platypus, platypus makes? I don't even think they make a noise, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> well, it's been it's been fun. It would have been more fun if we'd have caught more fish, but well at least y'all have caught some on the wrong reel. We we beat you guys, and really, that's all that matters. So uh, exactly, yeah. yeah I'm just kidding. that's all that matters. Yeah, it's the first time we tried. It was the crappiest time of year to try anything new, right? And uh, we yeah, could. we'll definitely do it again come spring here in a couple three months. Right, right. I think we'll get a whole lot more people uh, that want to do it. Right, right. Are you guys fishing tomorrow or no? Uh, good question. I don't know. We got uh, dinner with family at round five tomorrow, but I'm not sure uh, if we'll go out afterwards or not. No, we're not oh, back. Yeah. We're not on Fort Loudon Lake Cast Blast. Uh, he just left the tree stand. We were talking about you earlier. Yeah, boring. Yeah, your, cat, your chat messages are coming through. We love talking about you, Cast Blast, in the highest manner, though. And oh, know, yeah. with my regards, of course. Mostly but, about uh, buttholes, but <laughs> hey, it's what you're famous for. Buttholes and bullets. Buttholes and bullets. Oh, yeah, that's it. You All can, right, Gary, you want to uh, All right, Gary's going to say goodbye to everybody. All right. All right. Thanks, Skipjack Sandy. Thanks for having me. Thanks, Thanks for coming out and fishing with us. Apart. First time trying this crazy scheme. First time I ever caught a fish on one. Uh, <laughs> and the first time I've ever seen anybody eat some catfish bait. <laughs> right? <Whatever. laughs> Listen, you never know what you're going to see on this channel. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, come back anytime, and we're going to do this again in a couple of months when it warms up and some more people can join us. The bottle. So, the, bottle. The, bottle. the bottle. Go get it. With the bottle. The, the, the bottle. Not that one, the other one. Yeah, that one. Get a bottle bite. Uh, we are on the river. We're on the clinch. Cast blast. We're not oh. down on the. Uh, oh. We're not down right. there near Chattanooga. All right. We're fishing gonna, FX we're is game. It. You want to do it when it warms up? The fishing FX? Do this bottle challenge? Everybody, everybody, start working on your bottles and your plans, and we'll plan it for like pre-spawn. We'll do it pre-spawn when the fish are eating. Well, if there's people that want to do it, maybe let's do it earlier. That's way off. Okay. I'm just saying, whatever you know. Just whenever. I might bring yeah, a bottle. We can do it once a month for all I care. I might bring we a can... bottle every time I go fishing. One of them now. Right. No. We can do a bottle chat, bottle battle once a month or once every other month. It's called the bottle battles. Battle of the bottles. Bottle, bottle battle. All right. We're, we're going to go. We'll okay. See you guys later. We'll see everybody in chat. And uh, have a good night. Be careful. And, yeah, you guys too. Be safe and everybody have a good evening. Bye. Okay, bye. Oh, him. Yeah. And then not long after that, that one that I had threw out here took off again. Randy said, "We'll be, we'll be uh, uh Keto's got an eggnog jug. Be ready next time." Yeah, we will. Uh, we'll do this again. It's fun. And uh, like if 
if anybody wants, we're always game to do anything different and fun to uh, yeah, what the same, uh but, yeah. change things up a little bit. They've got that, They've got you know. So if any of y'all come up with ideas of something that's feasible to do, you know, I mean, everybody, for everybody on panel, then I'll, I'll, call, I'll call it at least two sixties around the bridge, one off the bridge and one right out from the bridge. We'll stay live until we get a uh, we check our bottles. And he caught a sixty three pounder, and an hour later I caught a sixty. I mean, they're there. I dropped my stuff there. Jacob? Uh, he, he, been, he goes there. I challenge you to use spin cast heads. We've got some tiger rods, boring fishermen. Yeah. We've got a couple of tiger uh, rods that we've used a few times on lives. We just don't have any spin cast on any heavy yeah, he, uh he's, he's, happy new year cast blast yozer you just woke up yeah we've been live uh, about six hours and 20 minutes going on so <clears throat> yeah i'm talking to him yesterday he called me Actually, the night crew is probably fixing to start coming in, but he should, he may be back. I don't know if he's coming back today or tomorrow. Oh, yeah. But we might actually do some, I mean, we could do a, we don't never video ourselves catching skipjack, though. Because you, you show people where you're catching, if you, if you get on the skipjack and you show people where you're catching them, 50,000 people in there the next day. You're on the Guinness this afternoon. <laughs> they can't take my own water bottle. We've got skipjack setups. Hence my name. I love skipjack fishing. We just hadn't been able to catch any around here recently. They're awful. They are not gathered up like they normally are this time of year. Sucks. We're going to have to get out and find some, though. Our freezer's are about empty. I'm not really looking forward to coming out of this uh, shelter. <laughs> it's cold out there. I've noticed around the bridge and around there, though. If we were catching anything, I'd just stay alive. The bite is on. Where you basically ain't catching up. You I might see. catch a thing. I'm trying not to get frustrated about catching a fish. <laughs> Caught a little channel cat last night. Actually, it was a pretty good channel cat. Yeah. We, we don't really use a, a spin cast rod so much because Travis can throw the bait casters out so far. <laughs> yeah, they were under the bridge when the tornado blew through. Have you ever heard about that? It blew the rods and everything. <laughs> We're going to keep our bottles, though. 
or make some more. Every one of them I had to climb over the rail and get down there and yeah. climb back up. They got no fish besides posted to the rail. Ernest said he wanted to do it when it warmed up. They're definitely interested in doing this again. What's well, the time across the pond in eastern U.S. on eastern time? It's six twenty-five p.m. And I don't have it step on. Well, I've got just it. got dark. Yeah. I don't have to hold it down like that. I want people to see how big the fish is. I don't have to do it. Yeah, I could him and this one the same time. Yeah, he looks like a 40 pound fish all day long. I couldn't believe it. That's why we got the other scales out too. It's like, ain't no way. Yeah, we, that's like when we, she got that 38 pounder down there. I, I had to weigh it twice because I was thinking, man. He, he said he could have swore it was 50. I'd, yeah, I'd have, bet, I'd have bet it was closer to 50. That's like, you know. Do you think a camp cane pole would hold a big old catfish? No. <laughs> Not unless it was a real flimsy cane pole. Did I hear clicker? I heard like three clicks. Um, your tiger rods, I think Travis has caught some pretty decent fish on a tiger rod, but it, it, when y'all say big old catfish, you can, catch, you can catch one on a tiger rod, huh? Mr. Rogers said he heard it. It would snap like a twig. It would depend on how you how you finesse it. Line on it. You catch it. You can finesse them. You don't have to let them bend until you break them. You can, yeah, you can get them in. I mean, as long as it ain't one that just takes off and it snaps your line. Uh, yeah. No, you you wouldn't have to worry about it snapping your line. You'd have to worry about that reel that's on that tiger rod. Uh, the tiger rod will handle it in a sense, but. The question is, would the real? I was wondering if it was ours right there. Wow. Almost six pounds. That was a good one. I caught a pretty big one on cut bait. 922 crappie barbecue. Hey, he said I caught a 34. He said I caught a 34 pound flatty on a tiger rod. That's big. Ken said that uh, you're on about the pole. He's been coming. He's been coming around for over three years now, mm -hmm. and it's been smart enough. Oh, a coon. Um, boring fisherman said my tiger rods have Daiwa four thousand reels with thirty pound test Yozuri braid. I won't worry about it. That's cool. <laughs> awesome. That's cool. Yozer said, I have some reels. Yeah. Got some reels on Facebook. That's some good. <laughs> that, those are good reels on your tiger rods. <laughs> yeah, them. Them is fine right there. I wouldn't worry about nothing about them. The original one that comes with it, if I got a big fish on, I might worry about it. I definitely have my drag set. Hopefully, the you'd have to wear him down. That's awesome. My, my personal best flathead's 38. Actually, oh, that's cool. It's weird the way I do the way I've done my personal best. I caught a personal best blue is thirty eight, and I went and caught a flathead that was thirty eight. And then I hadn't caught anything really big until I caught. It's all over. Same summer, what? Yeah, same reels. 
Goring said, I love the tiger rods. I have three of them. One I got at a yard sale with a broken butt end, so I shortened the handle. All I used for years, tigers, Berkeley. Big, mm. big games. Big games. That's what I had before I got these to my cats. Big games. Rods, man. It's, you can break one of them. Your personal best white bullhead was as long as your fillet knife. I was on Chris's. Uh, I don't think Chris's I've ever caught a bullhead. Now, but it wrapped that bird, uh, big game run all the way under the boat. We blood the dam and it got hung. It wrapped it all the way under the boat and finally yanked his uh, rod holder thing clean out of the rack, out of the track. Yeah. That's what Travis said until he got his mad kids. Can't hardly break them. Man, I tell you what, them gentle cats, pound for pound, fight hard. You'll think you've got something way bigger than what you got. Right. Someday you'll upgrade. You got to get your fishing figured out first. Yeah. I mean, me and Travis keep it simple. It's not about name brands and stuff like that. If, but I mean, like he's got that that one um, real cast a mile. But it's I mean it's a it's an older name brand reel. Big cast far. We just keep it simple so we can uh, just throw them in the car and go. The most fun, uh, keep it simple, stupid, it works. That's right. <laughs> you can get wrapped up in all the name brands and all that stuff, and it still won't make you a better fisher person. You got to learn all that first and then worry about what you got. I mean, you had a little bit, especially him yeah. wrapped up in whatever he wrapped yeah. up in. Exactly. Super what he did. Oh, yeah, Travis, uh, his mad cats and my outer rods, uh, we put the back seat down one side of it and just, uh, and you know, you ain't got to worry about messing it up. We throw ours in the back of the car. They, they come up between the front seats, but we don't care. We got everything we need in that little, that little uh, car that he's got. We ne we didn't catch anything, Sandy. Okay, but look, can you just bring it in instead? Too nervous. Oh, that, what, 30, yeah. I need to get on something, something. Down. Yeah, as long as you got good gear that'll cast good. And yeah, well, I guess this thing here, we could have one of them little. I looked at those little pod things that you can crawl into and heat on the inside. But you know, we can we can fold this up. We already had the pop up. You can fold this thing up and throw it in the. Uh, Back of the car and go. 
Huh? Has anyone tried to skip Jacob Bull Run? That's it, yeah, that's it. Yeah. I'd rather fishing poles in the bottle too, but this is this was a cool little thing and it was cool watching Anthony and them catch one. Change of pace. We like doing fun little things. You may able to catch skipjack anywhere. Yes, Randy. Cool. Cool, Ken. I hadn't seen any stickers out in a little while. I hadn't caught any fish or anything for anybody to win any. I'm not going to do another subscriber giveaway until I reach a big milestone. Seems like I'm stacking them up. Welcome back, Stuart. Yeah, we haven't been able to catch uh, Skipjack anywhere locally. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wow, he looks huge. Definitely worth it. Tell Ren the zombies are doing a good job of eating his ankles, too. <laughs> Darren. Got 54. That's pretty good. George is eating the body of the screen. Yeah, uh, we had uh, 38 a minute ago. So I didn't shut down. <laughs> Got the night crew coming in. It'd be nice if something bad. Mm -hmm. 6.38. I'll try to get a few more minutes. Yeah. <laughs> it all changed up, didn't it? Yeah, you got a different group of people that come in during the day from the night. Channel five. Coffee, they're all gone. I'm sorry. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. <laughs> Hello, where's the bot? Yeah, we got everything catfishing here, fishing with us. Bottle fishing. Hmm. <coughs> <coughs> 
I wonder if they eat them pellets like the sick ones eat. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Are they? Oh, yeah, they won't buy her one of those, yeah. But, you know what I'm saying? As long as you don't claim whatever you got to win, like this eight cows that are growing in it, I guess. Maybe they'll get some soup. You gotta make sure it's around. Get some seaweed or something to put in there and it um, starts growing. That one. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, you got it. What? Oh. Ken got to 1100 subs today. Ken, boring fisherman. Oh. Yeah, it's cool to reach some milestones. Lord. I'm trying to uh, catch cast blast. That's my. It has a little ledge at the bottom for your toes there, Cindy. Just hook them underneath and you'll be set. <laughs> oh, I've got hot hands wrapped around my toes. Got one of them tanks at the house. I need to run by and fill it up. I need to buy me one of them hoses. Thanks. Sandy said, Travis, get your hands out of Cindy's shoes. <laughs> Yeah, hot hands. I don't like about this thing too. Turn it off. It's cool. It's cool down. Yeah, that's cool. It don't take that little buddy here long to cool down either. It's cool, buddy. It's not really nothing but a frame, though. Yeah. That little ledge would burn my toes up, but I got I got got the hot hands in. The rules on bottle fishing uh, FX are you just take a bottle of your choice, wrap you some line around it, put a rig of your choice on the end of it, and cat, throw it out there and catch catfish. That's it. You can catch, catch, catch any kind of fish. Yeah. No, we haven't got anything, Hunter. They yeah. caught a fish on it, uh, on Anthony J's part of it. And then uh, Stacy caught one. Yes, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Caught some sort of fish. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody caught some besides us. And this is crazy because this is our go to place if we know that we just need to catch something. Yeah, this is where we come. This weather got them all. Hunter said, whatever you do, don't end it. I'm 10 or 20 minutes away. From your house, Hunter? <laughs> so whatever you do, Tony, I'm 10 or 20 minutes away. I don't know where he's away from. 
Sandy said, I'm loving and leaving you grasshoppers. I'm off with the kids. I hope the last five minutes spell works a treat. So do I. Thank you. You have a good one. Be safe. Yep. Have fun with the with the kiddos. Yeah, it held it. My fishing line did too. Yeah, it was better last night. It was going. Going pretty good yesterday. Yeah. Oh, we're on pretty good yesterday last night. No, we were right here. Oh, what? Yeah, we figured we'd come and test the tarp out. And we knew we were going to have to come back out here today. <laughs> oh, from your house? <clears throat> and that was the crazy thing because it probably wasn't we didn't even go live and we caught that one fish and they act like it's biting a little bit went live didn't catch nothing yeah the good size tail catch you got this No fish in Apex, you don't have to be on the bank. Randy and them ask if they could bottle fish from the boat. Oh, we don't care. However, you can get it out there. It'd be fun. It, I mean, you know, it's, it's just something fun to do, something different. Yeah. Yeah, because you guys will catch something big on the boat. Yeah, I might make sure I put some gloves on. And you might yeah, want to put a rubber line. band on it too to have a little bit of a break on the boat. Yeah. Boring fisherman said, challenge accepted. FX said, I've seen some guys do it and uh, use styrofoam for a bobber. Yeah, we was floating uh, balloons. Yeah, floating balloons out with this wind going on. Figured, well, we'd try to get it out there further. Well, we, won't have to worry, I know. we might need to make the thing longer. The leader from the balloon. Could have been, been too high, you know. Yeah. Oh. yeah, we may we may do one of these bottle challenges, you know, every so often if enough people are interested. It's kind of cuts the monotony of I mean, yeah, we could come out here and stick our our fishing poles up in the rod holder like we always do but it's it's nice to do something different <laughs> it's definitely a challenge that's for sure yeah <laughs> back to basics fishing ain't necessarily uh it's harder than it looks yeah because we had the bottle spin earlier i mean just setting the hook on one is you're back to basics. You don't have nothing doing it for you. That's for sure. You get it out there far enough. <laughs> yeah. Yep. That would be what was cool is to come up with some inventive ways of getting your bait out there. Yeah. People slingshot. be bringing slingshots. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Yeah. That's true. I yeah. said a tater cannon. <laughs> <laughs> a slingshot would work pretty good, wouldn't it? Yeah. Unless you didn't have a real big bait. Yeah. And heavier to weight. Mm -hmm. Underneath the hook. You know? Yeah. I want to fire it off and hook come up. Yeah, I get you. Grab my hand. <laughs> oh, that hurts. That's me about my luck. Hey, Sid. Welcome in. I think the five bucks I usually ain't got none at all. That's right. It's not right. <laughs> I would try and throw that other one back out there, but eh. yeah, in the dark, it's kind of like, eh, I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely a daytime gig, <clears throat> bottle fishing. Like, uh, some of those little glow sticks, little small ones you get fishing. Put one in the blue before you blow it up. Oh, them, them blue light up. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he, 
I should have clicked that one before I put it out there. I should have clicked them both, actually. Yeah, they're LED. LED light. Oh. Huh. Well, we can get them out. Makes light up balloons. Did you get these at the party store? Oh. Line around it to yeah. I just tie, I just tied to straight around the line. But yeah, he tied a knot in the balloon, I think, and then then tied the line around the knot. We are fishing on the Clinch River. Well, we got lines thrown out there. I don't know how much fish we're doing. <laughs> There's bait in the water anyway. Yeah. I tell you what. I've been off work for a week now, and fishing has sucked. Suck, suck. Yeah. I hope yeah. it gets better before I go back. It'll be sad. Hey, we looked at the remote control boats when we were at Bass Pro Shop yesterday. You got one? Something hit it anyway. <laughs> it is way way down there. Got that half a shiner on it. Fisherman Sid? Wait, right there. Boom, boom, boom. And then he's got. <laughs> you can modify the bottle. Yeah, we don't care. <laughs> the only rules, the only rules we had for the bottles is that they be a bottle. <laughs> and that you attach your line to the bottle. <laughs> It would be cool to see how inventive people can get with the bottle fishing. Take them over and show them the bottles. There's a lot of them that's came in that probably since it's been dark. Bottle fishing, that's what we're doing, Sid. Wait a second. Uh -huh. Yeah, put your on one. I'm venturing out into the cold. We painted our bottles up, or Travis did, but you take, we, we drove rebar into the ground, but Tony had longer stakes. He just went and got some stakes, and then you wrap your line around it, and then you put your tackle on the end of it. See, that one we didn't even paint. It's just a Coke bottle. Come over and look what he did to the... Let me get the He set them up with a big so you can on, just so they would. That way you can keep the keep it tight. He hooked the other piece of line around it into it too. That way you can just pull it loose. Cool. That adds a little bit of a drag. That's how I used to be my head. Before I had clickers, yeah, I'm taking open the bell, and uh, then we've got a shel little shelter with a heater in it because it's real cold out here. Right here, front of the yeah, stop the line from coming out, you know, with the bell open. So you can add to or remove from the original bottle, just slide through the styrofoam, you know, so it basically right. turning a regular um, bell. Said we put balloons on two of them because it's real windy today. So we threw them out there and let the wind blow the balloon out to where we had we had it farther out. It's unique. 
We had that peeling and blowing. We'd do a good with a BB gun. Blowing it. Just drop, drop. It'd be like using a drone to carry your yep. bait out there. But yeah. It's a real basic way of fishing, but like, yeah, it's different. It's been fun anyway. I mean, yeah, it's. I was hoping to get several people in on it to to get uh different ways that people do setups and see what was going on. I mean, see what they could come up with, because people can get real inventive with stuff. And come up with some very unique things. Um, Sid, we haven't caught anything here. But um, some, some of the other people, we had a couple other people on panel. Um, Anthony J. All Day, the guy he was fishing with, caught a striped bass, striper. And... Uh, then bank fishing adventure stacy caught a, a bluegill on his so i mean they there have been fish caught on these rigs today we just haven't but the fishing's really sucked around here the last week or so probably last couple of weeks weather's the weather's got them messed up it ain't it's not being like it should be for this time of year how did it get that hung up <laughs> you got the bottle on, on you? There you go. Okay, Hunter. Okay, Ken. Uh oh, he's gone. <laughs> Fine, anyway. He took off with it. Yeah, it, it was <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Thank you, FX, for coming in. Um, no, I like we only had a balloon on two of our four rigs. Um, the balloon just takes it out there further. Um, when you get a when you get a fish on a balloon, it just it might take it down like a bobber or whatever. Yeah, he had one spin his, take off with it. Yeah. But he tried to uh, when he went to try to pull back and set the hook, it it didn't. This is that double ring. It is hard to hook up. It's a little bit harder to hook up the fish on these. That's that double rig too. Hitch that on one. Uh, or from the other. No, it, uh, the thing that makes you know that you've got a bite when you're fishing with these is the bottle starts spinning because you've got your line wrapped around and around it. So the bottle will spin, 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 take off spinning. Cool way to persevere. Yep. It don't hurt to to know the basic skills if you ever needed to catch fish for some reason. As long as you've got a hook and a line and 
something to wrap your line around. You can fish this way. It's not bad, Scotty. <laughs> You know how to fix that, don't you, mad dog? Ken wants in next time. Who else did I say wanted in on it next time? Huh? Oh, yeah, Ernest. Remember that, Ernest and Ken. It won't. You do have a card attached to it, Hunter. That wind's kicking up again. How you come straight up anything like that in heels. Crazy. Oh. It must be. Oh. It's cold. Okay. No worries. That wind had y'all messed up today. It's bad. If we weren't in this little shelter, there ain't no way I could have made it. I'd have to sit in the car. It's cold. We may go fishing tomorrow, Hunter. I'm not sure. If not, we'll be doing them next week. <clears throat> tomorrow we do family dinner. I actually think you can do them on sticker. I mean, on a shorts too, Hunter. Like a sticker, a super thanks or something like that, but you don't need to. We can go to bottom. Hey, yeah, that's cool. I know it's plenty cold out there. And that wind's kicking back up. Gloves on. One thing I like about this stuff. Yeah. Put a pair of gloves on it. Heat them up on the top of it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 
As long as you got some gloves, it won't melt. Okay, I'm going to put gloves up there. I've got dirty gloves. I'm going to set them on for just a second like that. They warm up good. Yeah, it's just like a super chat center. See that bottle spin on the phone, then go good. Dude. No, not that far one. It was the far one, wasn't it? The one that's closer to the ground. Oh, the second one. I got it now. I don't know if it'll show it spin, but it shows it glowing. Ooh. There, kitty, kitty, kitty. For real, though. That rod over there ain't clean. This rod was on it for a long time, mm -hmm. and then I cut it after it died. I don't understand why I'm not getting more bites, period. Especially with that chicken liver. Chance to catch my first chicken liver bro. I know. Yeah, we both brought baits that we were, for, you know, pretty sure would at least get a channel cat just so we'd catch something. Yeah, they probably wouldn't have been any better on worms, but we might have caught something else. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> yeah, I heard it. It was hauling butt. Yeah. And depending on what had it in its mouth. We haven't here, no. Um, Gary, that was fishing with the uh, Anthony J, caught a uh, he caught a um, strapper on one, and then Stacy Bank Fishing Adventures caught a bluegill on his, and then he just uh. Mark here just had a good run. He spun the crap out of his bottle. But he didn't get the hook set on it. It's not as easy as it looks. I'm strike king anyway with a roll. Bottom. Um, we're using all kinds of bait. Um, he's got the double rig with some J hooks, uh, Mark does. And then we've got some small circle hooks on ours. Um, one of mine is a double rig. My my bottle is the one on the left. This one. It's just a plain Coke bottle. Travis painted his last night. And he's got two of them on a balloon. Um, but we've got chicken liver, skipjack, gizzard shed. Carp. Carp and uh, creek chubs. <laughs> We've got everything. We've got a, a buffet of catfish yummies. It's just the weather around here has been like, okay, it'll be warm. It'll be 60 degrees and raining and just it'll be warm for a few days. And then it'll shut down and, and turn off 20 degrees like it is now. And then it won't stay consistent, the weather won't, so the, the fish ain't out here running. They got locked, y'all. Although, Lisa...
caught her uh, personal best off a boat today. She got a 38 pound blue, 37 and a half pound. Very cool setup. It seems very survival esque. Yes. And we've got this little canopy with this tarp over it again tonight, and with this heater in here that's saved our butts from freezing. To... So, Cast Blast said it's very cool setup. Seems very survival esque. What we should have done is got Travis's, uh, but it would have been better. We couldn't really do. We can't really do a video doing this till we can catch something on them. But that'd make a good long form video. Preppers and stuff would probably like it. <laughs> yeah. The homesteading community could probably get into this. But yeah, it's been fun. Find the bottle laying anywhere. Right. Cass, well, I said I might have to give the bottle rigs a try. Braid or mono? He, uh, Mark's using braid on his. We're using mono on ours. So just anything and everything. There wasn't really any rules on this today, no other way. than have a bottle, a stick, and some line, and a hook. Just have some fun. And, you know, have yeah. fun at it. I had a spool of braid that didn't have enough on it to put on the rods. So, uh, Boring Fisherman asked if there was, you know, could you do modifications as long as we don't care. Uh, yeah. However you can, however you figure you can rig your bottle for success so that you can catch you a fish if you needed to catch a fish on a on a, without without a right <laughs> however you want to like let your imagination run wild we've considered different bait deployment scenarios mm -hmm. because the hardest part about this besides setting the hook is trying to get it a distance on your cast that's probably just the that wind over on that Yeah. Hopefully it don't rip the rig into the water. We're hoping not. It hadn't so far. It sets down on that pole so far that uh, when everyone took off with marks a few minutes ago, it just spun. Now, if one of them, like, if a big stripper got a hold of it and it was taken off at Mach 2, it might spin it up off of the... Now, that one on the end down there, that's that little plastic that Jay stuck in the ground. Right. Something so, might spin it off of that one. <laughs> I mean, you might put, yeah, that could possibly happen where it spun it up off of that. Anthony had his on tall poles. Yeah, he had his leg up. Yeah. Cash Blast said he also was using like Gatorade bottles. Yeah. He uh, said, I think I saw a video of someone doing this on the beach catching saltwater fish, probably. Keto's blowing nice. stuff up. Gatorade bottles with the bigger mouths probably let them spin better. Dude. Yeah. Wouldn't have as much uh, resistance on it. And I, I think that he actually had the caps on with a hole in the cap. Because, you know, they have the bigger mouths, so mm -hmm. he, he put that on there, so they'd probably be less li likely to spin up. But, yeah, I'd like to see the different scenarios people come up with. We're going to do this again. We've got a couple more people interested now that they've seen it. That is a drag system, too. I guess you make that hole yep. tighter around the pole, but it wouldn't spin as mm -hmm. spin as fast. Like set the drag on it. So, um, Ernest is wanting to do it if, well, when it gets a little warmer out. He's got him a charging thing. That's, that was his problem, is keeping his phone charged. But he's got a charging block coming. He's ordered, so. It's cold weather. Sure saps the battery quick, too. Yeah, it yeah. does. Definitely. But yeah, we've got a, a few people interested in, in doing it next time, so. We may do another one here sometime before 
spawn happens. Or somebody else can. <laughs> We're always trying to come up with fun things to do, different ways to fish, things that are interesting. We could do it off the bridge. <laughs> that would be hilarious, wouldn't it? I'll drop some in straight down and get cropping. <laughs> I don't know what we put our sticks in or whatever. You'd have to be inventive with the with the sticks, had a rock holders stick yeah. you see down in that. Sit on that That's true. Take you take you away to sit on that end of Mm -hmm. Leaving them carts. Best way to set the hook without the line cutting your hand. Cast Blast said. What? Best best way to set the hook without the line cutting your hand. Gloves. 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 Take off running. Mark <laughs> Mark did it with his today. He cut his finger. With his with his braid, it casting it, yeah. <clears throat> whipping, I had it whipping fast too. I let it go and it. Yeah, that braid will cut into you like a knife. You can hear the thing bubbling now. Yeah, I kept hearing the water, and I was thinking, "What's that water running?" Yeah, probably. Right stuff. I'd say that thing fell off of it, the little board thing. It broke off. The area. Yep, it's a challenge. Yeah. Oh, go, go, go. Is it cold, Mark? It's been cool, though, trying it. You never know what Travis is going to come up with to do. We're going to go gold, gold hunting in the spring when it gets warm. We're going to get one of them little sluice things and we're going to go up to find us a creek. We're going to see if we can find some gold. There you go. He's, a, he's so much fun. He's always looking for stuff to go, do. Go gold fishing. Last year we got into concrete cement. We made so many cement flower pots and stuff. That was fun for a while. It was fun for a while. After we got it figured out, it was. Hey, Juanita needs you to stop and get her some Reese's Pieces on the way home. Cass Flash said Mark needs some more layers, sounds like. It's freaking cold. I'll have to head down that bucket of water. What's the biggest bottle fish today? Would have had to have been the uh Strapper, would it? Strapper, yeah. It was probably over five pounds. <clears throat> I don't know where I got a spotlight somewhere. Yeah, it wouldn't you know that I'm off work during all this mess. We need to go skip Jake fishing. We need to find him. Found it. You found it. What he needs is more layers, but he's wearing my. Yours too. <laughs> yeah, that cold, cold, cold was where I had my hand run down in that bucket. Yeah. Creek water. 
<laughs> I've got on two layers. I don't have my bibs on. I probably should because I'm getting cold. But I've got two layers. I've got two layers on my legs and three layers. Four layers on my. <laughs> I'm pair. Are you talking to me, Juanita, or him? She wants Reese pieces. Skip Jack, skip that. Yeah, you got to stop and get a Reese pieces on the way home. No I did. Uh, I, I I waited like six hours, over six hours before I went, <laughs> and then I went and made the car doors a bathroom. Thermal top. He went down there to the to the porta john. There's a porta john at the end of it. I can imagine fireball does not taste good with eggnog. Well, I'll send him an eggnog. Well, I always try to remember toilet paper in case. Man, I I tell you what, I guess I've peed at every fishing hole we ever go to. I'm just glad to get to go most of the time. Well, we know there's a couple of fish out there, anyway. Yeah. Yeah, I said something the other day. Uh, I had one sock on. What they talking about? <laughs> Yo, I, said, I don't think I would use my sock. I'm gonna cut a sleeve off t shirts <laughs> Yeah, I think. Yeah, we always have McDonald's napkins or some t shirts. I sleeves off the shirt before, especially me out working somewhere in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, I'm going to sleep, but yeah, I'm not going to get rid of the sock. I can sleep in the sock. That's not cold. Um, it's cold. Something I hate is having to wear shoes without socks. Uh, I hate that. My shoes don't find cut socks. Well, no. My socks, I didn't even get the thick ones, so. Yeah. Yeah, I can get rid of my socks about Dingleberries for sure. You just pick more socks. <laughs> oh wow, that light, that flames way out there. Oh, you got that spotlight shining on, but pull that thing light up. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't click that one thing in it earlier. I'm, I don't guess I'm pretty with me here as well. <clears throat> Still getting warm, so I'm really on the other side. Yeah, it'd be nice if it's good. Yeah. So when I go fishing, I don't like to leave unless I caught something. It sucks. I guess technically I caught a whole bucket to it. Yeah. That's it. Don't really count. <clears throat> She goes dropping pineapples. She's got other Peter too with some toes. Did you get that I mean, that other one that My feet ain't cold. I'm going to get that four I could get my thermals. I mean, my. Uh, I said, quit being cold. Yeah, I'm in my 
There's not a problem with that. We've done our district. We've got nice. The 20s. Oh, my God. We're standing in front of the belt of his pant legs. Hmm. Okay. The bibs, too. Like Tommy Gore on that here. That was bad, though. Threw a little mud, you know. Cast blast. Did you do any good today in the tree stand? No, it's when he's in the tree stand. <laughs> well, if he was in the tree stand, I need to know if he got anything while he was in there. He's our deer slayer. I have a ring to see today from on the rod without a lot of No deer today. Hopefully next time. No buttholes to remove today. Oh God! Did you hear me hiccup? Mm -hmm. Here we go again. Had Lisa cracked up. Like that, you'll have to go out and start doing something. See, so you got behind that over. Scare them out of it. Getting fake spiders on. You better not. That'll cause a fight. Get rid of me. That'll be one of them stories, and this you'll tell the story, and you'll be like, and "That's how the fight began." <laughs> <laughs> We don't play with spiders. I can handle anything else in the nature kingdom, in the animal kingdom. Snake, give me a snake, whatever. But they keep them spiders away from me. Well, we went to go to the cabin up there a couple months ago. I went to put something in the mailbox. I said, so there's a spider mm -hmm. in the back of the mailbox. My buddy's going to check the mail for work. I went out there and looked at the bag on the black and cut them. Oh, dang. Keto said there once was a chip that put to sea in the name of the ship was a Billy O.T. <laughs> he said, if I can stay in the weather, I'm going to go camping and hunting fish on the trip up this coming week. Last week of deer season. Who, Gas Blast? Yeah. Um, that song is the one that that, that's the song that uh, Jacob. Jacob sings when we go out on his boat. He said, y'all need a karaoke machine. I am a karaoke machine. <laughs> he knows that I'm highly suggestible. <laughs> Oh, God. Thank you so much for putting that one in my head. I'm like a radio. You mentioned a song and it starts playing in my head. I'm, I thought about trying to see if I could get that classified as a mental illness. <laughs> it, bro it bugs me. Yeah. There's always music in my head. Always. Bad thing. I've got OCD about counting stuff. Like we go fishing, I'll count the rods a hundred times. And if I've got a song in my head, I count them to the tune of the song. <laughs> Austin does that. Who? Austin, he counts his rods. Oh, yeah. Well, we count ours too. But he has to count, he has to know which one he's getting the bottom. Oh, uh, we're done. Yeah. Oh, no. We got to go. <laughs> Where did that other tank? 
Uh, okay. Your feet's going to be cold. My feet are not going to be cold. Everything else will, though. Oh, yeah. Well, then my toes won't get cold, my feet might. Okay, well, that one was a little fuller. That one there was about a quarter. It was maybe a quarter of the way full. It lasted a few hours, didn't it? How long have we been out? Seven, seven hours. And a half. Seven and a half hours. So about a half a tank or so, almost. Yeah. Close to a half a tank. Seven hours. That's not bad. Yeah. I could see Travis and Cindy. Doing the hold down at the Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> Lots and disco ball kiddos in. <laughs> you broke their bull. <laughs> yeah, I've seen people get thrown off their bull. <laughs> yeah, I don't want people to get more than they do to buy the. They've got ridiculous on them, like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, four of them twenty dollars. Well, more you can have one of those filled for forty. Yep, four pounds versus twenty pounds. If you had that hooked to that buddy here, you got way better. Yeah, last year, yeah. Long time. Mm -hmm. Oh, I get a week or two out of it. Hey, Cindy, pass me inside toward the back. Yeah, toward the back. That hole right there. My other blend toy down here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Stop it, Keto. <laughs> that was you. <laughs> Why is your hand so cold? Your things already pulled off. Yeah, they pulled off quick. Yeah, this for running, I guess, what pulled off the quick. <laughs> Thin enough so it don't hold heat, they say. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's a good job. That's, that's, that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. What? Get in front of me. It's a seven back. What did I win? What's your Five hundred million dollars. And you missed it because you wasn't here. You can contact the IRS and they'll distribute it to you. Mm -hmm. What what keeps going on? I don't know. I think we're gonna be crazy sometime. We'll be over here. I'll be thinking what is that light guy? Sophisticated light There is no fish count here. It's out. Um, <clears throat> the miscount. Miscount. Don't be fish. It's called a sophisticated. 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 How do you catch a unique rabbit? How do you catch a unique rabbit? You make up on it. <laughs> you heard that being you made Sal. You make up on it. You make up on it. <laughs> How do you catch a tame rabbit? The tame way. <laughs> Unique up on a tame rabbit, too? <laughs> Unique up on a tame rabbit. What's blue and doesn't weigh much? Blue? Light blue. <laughs> Is Maggie Poo with us? No. I think Maggie Poo's working. The blues we count today are blue and don't weigh much. That's right. I'd like to <laughs> catch a light blue even though. Still here at Bubbler now. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Itself said, Oh, a woman with a job sold. Sold. <laughs> what happened to the frog that parked illegal? It got towed. <laughs> 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 it's comedy hour here. Most of my jokes are too inappropriate. But, 
and just about all of them, my mama taught me. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds so East Tennessee. What car do eggs drive? <laughs> A yolks wagon. I could eat the north end out of a southbound mule. But I think I'm mostly thirsty. Yes, it's open, sorry, you are. Yeah, if you don't care. You can, you can make you a bottle. I'm not Use making it. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really not very hungry. I'm really thirsty, so. flat. I was in the wagon the other day when I was pulling it over the back side of the creek. Thank you. Meanies. Yeah, hey, give me one. Yeah, they got them. Or they had them on sale at Kroger. Get, buy two, get three free. If they're still on sale or not, if it ended. How do you make seven? Seven, seven even? You take away the S. I just had a short. Did you make a short? Mm -hmm. Did you just make a short? Uh huh. It just came across the top of my phone. I got a notification for it. No, I'm not. Take away the S. Turn seven into even. Oh. S even. Get <laughs> the seven, you have even. Oh. Spin bottle spin. Yeah. got two fathers and two sons went fishing each one of them caught a fish got home brought them home now we had three fish how's that possible two fathers and two sons and they brought them home and there were three fish each one of them caught a fish out their own fish. Well, it sounds like man. I don't know. A grandfather, a father, and a son. Uh -oh. Fathers and two sons. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's only three people there. Have you seen the wonky donkey video? I don't think so. The salty caramel ain't great with the eggnog either. 
<laughs> Don't drink them both together, you know. You always get them small bottles. I don't like. I don't like cans. It seems like they, they go flat too fast. And the big bottles you get them if you're in the house, it seems like they get hot within fifteen minutes. Mm-hmm. YouTube wonky donkey. Go look it up. <laughs> Stupid fish. Come on. I'm going to play spin the bottle with you. All you got to do is spin it. Let's see where you land. You might even get a kiss. <laughs> Tennessee, Kentucky Bigfoot said started seven hours ago. What are you crazy? <laughs> yes. <laughs> we are. We kind of hate to give up without catching a fish. We like fishing. Do you believe in big feet, Keto said? In big feet? Well, I mean, you know, some people got big feet. Yeah. You know what they say about a guy with big feet, don't you? I've heard a few things. He's got big feet. <laughs> <laughs> he does have big shoes. He's got big hands. He's got big joints. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <Didn't> see <laughs> he said my wife has big feet does she have big shoes The ocean is flat. Just the bike right there wasn't a sense. <laughs> Seen something streaked by. I don't mm -hmm. know what it was. If it was something flying or something in the water. She's in the other room. <laughs> <laughs> I read everything that comes across the screen just to go off. That's what I was thinking yesterday whenever I was answering people. I thought, boy, anybody watching this live, they're going to think, what in the world is he talking about? They're not going to have no clue what I was responding to. Like, I mean, watch it. Yeah. The replay. Maybe I should start doing that too. Yeah, unless they bring up the replay. The chat. The good thing about reading the chat is like people will be watching on like a big screen and they can't see it. Oh yeah. Yeah, That's I just got in the habit of uh I just got in the habit of reading everybody's chat. Well mostly a lot of times I was reading it to Travis. Right. When I first started this. Yeah. Well, it helps too if you've got other people on panel that they can't see know, chat, yeah. yeah. Got and I just got a post for Anthony J shared the battle. <laughs> <laughs> what the crap? What's still going on, Anthony J. My phone is like fifty two years behind. Yeah, I put a short the, Now we're up on the clinch. Of the fish on there. I titled it with your name in it. I don't know. It probably didn't know if I have it or nothing. But. It may have. Normally it will. Even if I don't get a notification about it, if I go in the anal anal analytics, it'll say anybody that tagged me. We're, yeah, we're up on the clinch behind a steam plant. Put it. Skip Jack Cindy Live. $30 winning fish. There you go. <laughs> there you go. $30 winning fish. Watch for the kiss. There you go. But only didn't get it. 
did it, he'd got the back angle so he couldn't really see me actually kiss it and hear him see where I go down toward it, but you can't tell what I did though because the angle kind of looks like I bent down or something. The dink, the dink. Some pretty big channel cats in here. I was at three shorts while we was here. We're uh. One of them got eighty-eight. Years. We're at the park. Mm. Another one more. Hold on, park. That's pretty good. Down here at the boat ramp. Us and everything catfishing. <coughs> Mark. Turkey get flew down off the roof. All right. I pulled up over the cemetery. You mm. can't miss us. <laughs> right there. On the right mm. side when you pull in. What? Circle is there. I thought somebody dumped a deer down there. I seen them flying down and I thought it was buggers, you know, until I got up there and I seen them all. Turkey. Cool. There's a place on Loudon uh, that's got a field. Mm -hmm. uh, it's kind of across from that boot. But there's always a bunch of turkeys up there on that hill here on the boat. Yeah. Tennessee, Kentucky Bigfoot's coming. Ooh. Tennessee, Kentucky Bigfoot. Oh. Boot Bigfoot's coming. Got right down here. Cool. Yeah. Be there in a minute. Yeah. Yeah, he lives up this way, don't he? Mm -hmm. He's a little late. <laughs> yeah. On when he didn't bring his grill tank with him. <laughs> when he fired the heater back. Back here you go. <laughs> we need some propane. This little, head, this little heater helps. Yeah. But it didn't feel as good as that other one, huh? Ain't got the kids flaming as big. <laughs> yeah. I've stayed warm with these buddy eaters for a long time. Oh, yeah. You get one of them hoses for them that you can attack them to the real tanks and they last forever. I'm, uh, I'm not really cold. I'm not sure why I'm shaking. My hands are You're cold. Shaking. Yeah, I'm shaking. I did in my pocket the whole time. I didn't use them. Say I ain't used them. I guess they like kept some heat around in the <laughs> yeah. mid seconds a little bit. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know why I never thought I had thought about wrapping these um double 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 you know Cheetos double 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 hot toes. Yeah, I had thought about wrapping them around this way. Yeah. Because I tried them in the bottoms of my shoes and it just didn't work. Yeah, my toes were still cold. They wouldn't stay in position right. If you wore two pairs of socks, I don't know if that'd work good or not because they wouldn't really get there between them. But. What put them between them? Yeah. I thought about that the other day. But you'd almost need to put it on the outside of the second pair because it about gets so hot. Sometimes it burns your toes just on top of your socks. They've got to have air to stay warm. If they don't get air, they just don't do it flip. Mm -hmm. I think that's why when you got them on the bottoms of your feet and you got your feet down, they ain't where to get to them. They just cool right off. Yeah. After I had some of these the other day, some of the feet things, and uh, <clears throat> they were still so hot when we went back to the house, I put them in the bed. <laughs> Down there where my feet were. He's like, have, have you got one in thing? Not in the one <laughs> He said, have you got them things off your off your feet in the bed? I said, yeah, they're still hot. 
Yeah, as soon as you get them on the bottom of your feet, they won't be warm. As soon as you pull your foot out of your boot, they get hot. Yeah. Because yeah. that air heat's going to make they get I think there. Kentucky Bigfoot is here. Yeah. The big Bigfoot has arrived. He has. Have you ever seen a Kentucky Bigfoot? You're about to. What is it, Bigfoot? My oh, mom got know. big feet. How about you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I heard right the dink to dink, and I go, I know where they're at. I said, they can't be. Oh, yeah. Tell my wife, she's at home now. Are you here, sweetie? I'm out here. <laughs> I thought that is too fast. I'm going to run down there. Yeah. You heard <laughs> the da dink to dink? Yeah. See? Yeah. And I was like, I'm you. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm kidding. You're kidding. I'm kidding. I'm sitting up there. I, I hear that. I go, da dink to dink. I go, what are they doing over there? <laughs> right? And I'm like, he wouldn't be down there. Yep. And he was looking for me. And I was like, and you said Clint. I was like, I said, hold, hold my beer. I'm going down there. And I didn't get up here. <laughs> you said, what you talking about? I'm Littlefoot. Yeah, yeah, she heard that conversation. She was in the other room. <laughs> <laughs> and, and when you read it, she was like, she didn't hear me. Now she's like, what? What are you talking about? <laughs> she's just catching up. <laughs> she got to rewound it back now. Yeah. Well, that was so cool. I just said, I got to go see him. And we're just living up front of the street up here. Yeah. That's really cool. You fish down here a lot? Yeah, I fish all this place, man. I've been here 30 years. Cool. I know where all the holes are. We fish, uh, we fish here quite a bit. Yeah, Mel, here's a... It's a hard one to fish, you know. Yeah. You got to go on up. You get up to the bridge and up. And you get up in the trout. And then you get down to the Melton Hill down there. You get right below them. You get the stripe. The muskies are in here. That's what I want. That's what we want to catch. Yeah. I'd like to catch a muskie. Yeah. I haven't caught one yeah, yet. I'd love to catch one. 30 second delay, she said. Probably it's, probably help if uh, if I'd fish for one. But. Yeah, yeah. Well, my son, he <laughs> caught one. We were fishing on that top bridge over there. And he caught one. Bass fishing with the oh. line, but it hooked it somewhere like in the side. Wow. So he couldn't throw it. And I didn't know what a muskie was. And he right. pulled it in, you know, and it looked like a big old alligator to be. Yeah. And I was like, throw that thing out of here. <laughs> <laughs> that was what I mean. That was about 10 years ago. I didn't know. Yeah. You know, that changed my whole attitude about swimming out here. Well, I got things right <laughs> No, that's right. That's what I did. I was like, I just throw it back in where you get for hurt you. That thing yeah. is it's like it was like a dinosaur swimming in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cool. I like meeting people in real life. <laughs> it's amazing how I said crap. Yeah. They just worry about me. I'm more than about what He's, yeah, that's everything catfishing there. Yeah. Well, I just, like I said, I, I ain't no, no, I ain't I'm no, no BS. Right? Hey, BS, how you doing? Skip Jackson. Skip Jackson. Okay, there you go. I remember, I, I follow her, and then I found there were other people fishing. But I, uh, <laughs> that's weird to introduce myself to Skip Jackson. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know you introduced her as your Tennessee, you know, I'm Tennessee, Kentucky Bay, but. Because they wouldn't know me. Other, uh, yeah, exactly. You know, yeah, they you start talking. Like, you? Yeah. But I do have my name in my. Yeah. yeah. So. I like to get on some big brown trout, too. I ain't never caught one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They got them. Where is it? Where, where, where'd we go? Up there below Norris. Yeah. Woo. That's the place to get yeah. the new browns. I yeah, yeah right below Norris. Yep. Yeah, from the Norris down Clint, all the way down past Clint and all that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. We went down there below the dam and. We thought we'd go in July and not not use waders. Uh, oh, yeah. Me and Jacob was up there. We went there in the winter. We had waders and everything. And we caught some nice. I mean, some. I caught my casting on my own. Pretty. Live my uh, Live. No, they they're bottom feeders just like everything else. The only thing different about trout fishing is it's just like cat fishing. Just change your gear way life. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we went up there. It was in June, right June, right June right July. Like Ninety degrees outside, and I said, "Come on, we'll go up there and go trout fishing." Yeah. So we went in up in there. 
Man. I was numb from the waist down. She lasted longer than I did because I ain't got. I think my balls was blue in about 10 minutes. I had come out. Well, to me, those little trout, they're like they're little squirmy things. I'm like, uh, yeah, they're little big trout. Good eating, you know, but I'm like, yeah. yeah Those were big ones that we were going after. We waded way across through there and threw over yeah. on the other side. And yeah, I mean, and yeah, then I came know. back and out of the water. It's July, it's 90 degrees. I was still cold. So I changed right there in the parking lot. I was like, I don't care. I'm getting out of these wet clothes. I'm going to put on the dry clothes there. Yeah, and then I put on the heat in July. And it took me 40 minutes before I could feel everything. Mm -hmm. 40 <laughs> yeah, minutes. I drove almost, almost all the way back to Madison. Yeah, you guys have fished a lot. That's a good story. I have to get it here. Four me and my son, I've been fishing like that, man, 30 years. Mountain Hill is pretty much my, what I know, because I mean, I'm right here from the boat dock. And uh, me and him was fishing back there one day. Oh, yeah. There was nothing hidden. There was nothing hidden. And what happened was, uh, all of a sudden, the water, you know how the water, everything comes up and the water just, just lights up like, <laughs> what's going on here? You know what I'm saying? Where everything starts hitting at the top. Yeah. It looks like it's raining. Looks like it's vibrating. It looks like it's raining, right? Yeah. Well, anyway, that, camp, that happened. I mean, they're sitting there, and uh, and you can see cars everywhere, and you could take me and him would take there and just outside the boat pull in, and we will just pull in and go look at this one, look at this one, and we if we're about for about 20, 30 minutes. I was right. I was in fish heaven, first time I ever never ever happened. I mean, it really did happen. <laughs> Once I could contest to it, and then they cut off again. Yeah, that's they Tennessee, were, Kentucky Bigfoot guys hanging out. They're right by my house. So I had to come out and say hi. Right. Logically insane. <laughs> yeah, logically insane. That's my son. Okay. He said, you left me at the house. I was trying to put my smokes in my pocket. <laughs> yeah, he wanted to go. Yeah, he wanted to go. I told him I'll be right back. <laughs> that blew my mind. I still ain't figured out today. It cut on. And you could sit there. It's you didn't weird. even have to cast down. And oh, I yeah. could just go put the lure right there. And, I, and he was up front. We were just laughing. And I was laughing, and I was hooking one up and saying, look at this one. And he's like, look at this one. And we were just putting them in as fast as we can put them. And, and the whole, it looked like it was raining. He's now got them thread pin, wasn't it? Was they, was they, 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 it was just all of a sudden it turned on the whole, Yeah, it, we were up in that cove up in there. Mm -hmm. The whole cove. And you could see gar all over the top. Yeah, but yeah. all the fish came up for yeah. about 20, 30 minutes. I never seen nothing, so I kept my whole entire life. And then, like I said, you didn't even have to cast that. We weren't catching nothing. Yeah. But, but until, I mean, after, before and after, nothing. It yeah, them thread kind of look, they look weird when they do that. Have you ever seen the white bass do it? No. Man, it's crazy. They all come the, water, see, they will, the water won't just vibrate with them. It's big. Yeah, I mean, it's like a, Looks like an like a blood happening. bath on thread pen. It's just like... Whoa. I we mean, every to, war explosion. Oh, yeah, we have done some white bass out here. We cut, we 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 use the tickets. I told you guys we we, we white bass. Right. There's like thirty limit, I think it was. And we just throw them in the boat. Right. Just fill the boat up. Yeah. Get out of here. Right. I hope we got <laughs> under thirty. Get back down. <laughs> dump them in the crock pot right. and come back down. But what we'll do is we'll do drums too, and we'll do cat. We'll do a big old drum, and we got a big old crock pot, and we put that drum in there, and no Dump problem. a whole bunch of rim in there, mm, right. guts and all, just throw them in there and uh, crock pot down. The only thing you'll have is like a big old piece of skull left, and the rest will take and uh, a lot of times we'll just make like fish patties mm -hmm. and freeze them. And then that's the chickens and the cat food, chickens and the cat food. And one year what we did was we used to cut so many bluegill, we would uh, plant a bluegill, and at, at the time we would put a tomato, fish, tomato. My and grandmother. Those, my uh, grandmother used race. to do that. We, it we, makes real good. Yeah, we do. We fire both lines. We do tobacco too, and we'll we'll come down here get about twenty little bluegill, put fish, plant, fish, plant, and and the ones that get fish, they'll be like fifteen foot tall, mm -hmm. right? And they ain't no way to bluegill. But uh, yeah, so we go. Uh, yeah, we logically like insane said yes. We seen the white bass at that yellow line for the swimming area where y'all are at. <laughs> yeah, they'll school up. Yeah, they'll just start blowing up. Uh, yeah, they'll blow. We just we'll go by on the boat go over them. We were down at Concord catch one time, time when they did that. Yep. But at Carolina, I'm gonna catch two at a time. Yeah, me and Lonnie was down there. Uh, disco down there, and 
they was out of where like where that rope swing or whatever is around there. Yeah, it was from the bank, like halfway across the lake. Yeah, man. I mean it was oh, insane. They was like, big school of them so much. Yeah, we've seen them on Mountain Hill like that too, quite bad. Now this year she got to experience the first time skipjack actually doing it right at right before dark. You know how all of a sudden they'll start mm-hmm. feeding real good, and man, right at the bank. I would dip my, after another. Uh, you know, you have, you'll have the three three flies on there. Yeah. I dip them flies down there, catch three fish, three lift them down. up. So He'd take them off. I dip my <laughs> pull back down in there, bring three fish oh, back up. No, it was they're awesome. Right they destroying it as soon as they hit it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's, that's uh, your son said I was slipping on the fish in the boat. <laughs> pulling them in two at a time. Dad pulling them in two at a time. I bet he was slipping. Slime. That's why that white bass are important. White bass are good eating. Or they, or is it the white bass or white? Maybe it's a white fish. I'm not sure. It's a little one. It's probably white. It's a junk well, fish. It's probably a white, white bass. bass. They are actually, you can, if you get some that's big enough. Okay. If you can get some that's about like that, you know, a good crappie size. Yeah. Now you can flay them out. Oh, oh my gosh, they're you're real good. good. Okay, clean. Yeah. White. Actually, they're better yeah. than uh, what was it? What is it? I like now, them as good as crappie. She likes them as good as crappie. Really? Crappie's yeah. got that good sweet. Yeah. Oh, that's where this is. It's got a good, like a good sweet. And uh, not- Jacob, I told him about it, and he said, uh, he said he finally tried them. His son said, "Let's try one." He said, they love them. They said they they're never as good as walleye or sauger. Yeah. Uh, I try one. Bluegill's yeah. good too. Oh, yeah, bluegill. Well, yeah, bluegill. Yeah, they're just like a crocodile. Yeah. Sweet. Keo said he'd seen some nice largemouth bass swimming at once far in by the rocks. Hunting bluegill, probably. Yep. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Man, I went, we went to Bass Pro Shop for the first time the other day, and man, it made me want to fish so bad. <laughs> yeah, she. Jeez. Them bass they ain't didn't I, have no they, catfish up there. No, they but the, the bass and stuff, and I used to bass, bass fish a lot. And, and the way they were hanging out in the back corner of that tank, oh, yeah. the uh, bass were just, yeah. If we things. get a chance and we get to go down toward Memphis, I'll take her to the pyramid down there. Okay. Man, that thing's got like a river running through it. It's got live ducks and everything. Yeah, yeah I've seen that pyramid crossing the cross yeah. here. If, that's, if that you get, bat, that's that bass pro, the big pyramid. Yeah, if you there. ever get a chance, stop in there. Yeah. I'll see the poke I mean, it's crazy. <laughs> There's a hotel in there. Big catfish to put their tank up there. Yeah, they'll pay you for them. Yeah. I wouldn't take them. I wouldn't them. either. Put in there. Somebody will. I'll see them. Well, the thing about it is they, they've had to have had them in there. What happened to the ones they had in there? They probably don't live well in there. Man, you guys got to say that bit. I was wondering what the bottles. You guys were talking about the bottles. What are these bottles? What are they talking about? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so what did you get? What, what's the bottles? What all we done was uh, just wrap line around them and use them as a, a reel. A reel? Oh, you said the reel. No, oh, that is the real. It is the real. Oh, okay, okay. You got the string out. And that was the, yeah. yeah that's the challenge. Stick. Yeah, it's yeah. A, we've got ours on rebar. But yeah. Oh, you got to run at them bottles. Yeah, if it takes spinning, if it goes starts to spin and you've got to get it. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of rigged these over here up with some styrofoam. Right. I was trying to figure out because I I use bottles, but that was stripe fishing. So I was like, what are they doing with that bottle? We definitely made it a challenge. I pretty much give up. You gave up? I give up on catching fish, yeah. Really? Don't you? Ah, you never know. We got a little bit of propane left. I know you guys got a lot. I didn't know you guys got a And, uh, Oh yeah. I like your setup, man. 
That's nice. That's the way to do it. Yeah, like we had this, this uh, canopy thing and figured, well, we'll go by and get a tarp since it's going to be all cold. I'm telling you, that's a great deal there. That's a nice little hut. It's like ice fishing. Yeah, they, they had said yeah. earlier it looked like we'd set up a homeless camp, but, I mean, it does it does what we needed to do. That's a great deal right you there. Feel it in here. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm just standing there here, and it's already blocked off. Yeah, yeah. it's coming back from that side. Yeah. Oh, so, yeah. I said I may be goofy, but I ain't crazy. Yeah. I'll be yeah, out in this what stuff. You doing out here so cold? You know, people <laughs> think you guys must really love fishing, <laughs> but if they seen you, got you a nice fishing. Hut yeah, we came by here last here. night and they tested it. And the first thing we did was we got here. Here come two police <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> running up in here. Yeah, what are you guys doing? Yeah, what y'all? You're gonna freeze this now? We we got this. <laughs> Yeah, well, our backwoods. They, they patrol this area. Yeah, he looking for all my cousins. We uh, actually <laughs> probably live closer to here than we do loud and stuff. Mm -hmm. Or he. Yeah, I'm right up in Jacksboro. Okay. Yeah. So it, it ain't that far down here. Yeah. 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 This lake's a hard one to fish because other than that, you go back up in that creek up there when they run and breed this group bass fishing up in there. You know, mm -hmm. it's all different. I've been like I've been here thirty years, so I know every hole. Right. One of the I first call out for you before I get him. I said, "Move, you see that? Get that, get that black rock over there. That black mass right there." And be like, "What are you talking about?" I said, "He's over. He's always over there, red eye, <laughs> right there." They'd be, "No, you're, oh, you're to the right, to the left." There he is. I the first you. time there we came is. down He's here, always there. Put him back. Oh, first yeah. time we came down here fishing this year, we seen a, a, a dude pull a flathead out of here. Yeah, yeah, nice flathead he pulled out of here. Okay. Probably a good thirty pound anyway. Yeah, you're out of here. Oh yeah. yeah. We wouldn't have been coming back all this time just for some channel cats. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my cats and chickens, they're, they're mad at us because we do. You know, that's one thing we like to do is load up on that stuff. <laughs> that, that one video was so funny. That <laughs> hawk? Oh, that chicken hawk? <laughs> yeah. Ain't that something? Yeah. I had a camera on my chicken coop. I keep, you know, I got like seven, eight on my property. And I had one, and uh, you saw it, man. Yeah, it was I alive, it. dude. And that, yeah. that, it looks like it was, that was fast forward. No, that chicken hawk came in. Oh, bam! And he, he come in, and the rooster moved. He got the tail. No, my rooster right, ain't got yeah. no tail feather. Just yeah. butt's gone. He, got nothing. he still ain't got nothing. About a year later, it got him. And you see a big pile of feathers. And then the chicken went into the, the rooster, went into the chicken yeah. house. And the chicken hawk went after him. Mm -hmm. Trapped him. So and then you see my son come running down the hill. Well, I was 22. He looks in the hole. He goes in. And he says he's up there. And he says he's that chicken hawk's up there looking at him. And he thought, nah, you're dead. <laughs> he, he thought for a minute. He goes, nah, you're dead. <laughs> yeah. He took him, brought him out. But uh, he, caught, he caught himself the chicken hawk. Yeah, but it's in. Yeah. It happens. It looks like I'm in fast forward. It happens so fast. Same thing. They're fast. <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, that's pretty funny. That yeah, was funny. my son. He's he's the protector. He's listening. I'm sure. What was it? PP. It was still in shock. Yeah, little PP. PP. <laughs> it's your uh... <laughs> little PP. PP was just sitting there. He's like, it's what your zip code, honey. On? It's your zip code. Uh, like whatever people use to mail you something. Me? No, oh. Hunter. Oh. Uh, do you live? Where do they live down there near Poland Creek? I guess it would be Louisville. Yeah. Whatever yeah. your billing address is. <laughs> yeah, get something with your address on it, and it's the little numbers at the bottom of your address, Hunter. Probably 37787. Is that Louisville, I think? I don't know. 37777 may be Louisville. I know. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Yeah, stopped. Stopped. <laughs> I saw that one spin. I mean, it's crazy because you guys are live on YouTube and you're live fishing. Yeah. So it all goes down like now, doesn't it? Yep. It's just going to, you know, when you come out and actually see, these people are just, this is live. They're in the creek. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't get caught in there and I go, no. No way. <laughs> so I was like, yeah, yeah live. He's like, oh, like, He's like, I ought to come down there. Okay. I was like, come on. <laughs> we got Bigfoot on the scene. He's, he's, he's still coming in the lives a, a week or two ago because he, he we were talking about Coker Creek and stuff up there, it's Teleco. Yeah, yeah, they got Bigfoot up there, too. They got little ones. They're kind of a little. 
down there in uh, Cocoa Creek. We were down there, me and my son, we were, I'm a prospect, go with that prospect there. Well, that's said. what he's wanting to do. He yeah, was talking about it at this point. Oh, Creek. oh, I can tell you where to go. They can get all over it. That's what you I know. think it'd be a There's blast. There's Tennessee. They don't want anybody to know about it. Trust me. There's gold in Tennessee. There's ways to get it. He's doing it again. Did he? Get him. now. But we've been down there six nights down there on the uh, old camera uh, campground. Hmm. And uh, last night, I heard a herd. There's like a herd of them. You can feel it coming through the ground. Right. The whole family of them ran basically through us. And, uh, and I was in shock at that. And then I heard uh, coming up the creek, I heard boogers down run, there. Run right past it. That's when I knew, man, they're, they're, they're real. You know, that, that blew cool. my mind. I'm still, you know, that was the, I never think one, but that blew my mind. That, that was the beginning of going, man, there's. You gonna get him? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but then a friend of mine, I went up there at Coke Creek and, and I went back on his property. Oh my god. I was like, dude. You know, you got Bigfoot all over this place. They, they were doing all kinds of stuff this part. I, I got a video up on it, but I mean, they did all kinds of stuff on it. I mean, they're, they're all over. I had no idea these Bigfoot were all over. Like, they're all over, all over North Carolina, all over Tennessee, Chattanooga, Coke Creek. Now, Janice Carter, she's, her family's down in that area. And she's got a book out. She was raised on her dad, her grandfather, uh, or her dad either knocked one out of the tree or the tree hit a baby Bigfoot. And they were, they basically raised that baby. Too great. Hmm. Yeah. Hey, I read a book about that. I, yeah. I read a story about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's down loud. That's where she's from. That's for her. That's for that farm. Right? There's something in rural, rural Vale or something? Rural, no. What is the name of that place? So this right down there. It's loud down there. So it's pretty, it's Madison, it was at, right outside of Madisonville. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's this is great with one star park. I feed them and all that kind of stuff. So I'm taking it. Look at this one here. Yeah, I'm clicking spinning. it. Is that normal spinning? Oh, that one's spinning. <laughs> We're getting all kind of bites now. It's starting to pick up now, ain't it? Hey, I'm going to get out here. I, I just want to come say me. hi. Me too. It was nice meeting you. I'm a real person. Good to meet yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> I'll leave that stuff laying up there beside the trash can when we leave. Okay. Swing by in the morning. Okay. Yeah. Well, right. fish. Yeah. Yeah. We'll throw it out the chicken. Yeah, we'll throw chicken. Right. What we don't use, I'll just, I'll just leave it. I'm going to go out there beside the trash can and we'll just dump it up. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah. yeah. Chicken's in the pants. Yeah. You know, make them happy. Hey, y'all have a good evening. You have a good one. All right. All right. Yeah. He's got all the other stuff. Oh, I'm good. Take care. We just had a, maybe they're starting to bite. That pink bottle right there on the end, it actually. That's that balloon, isn't it? Oh, now wait a minute. Yeah, that's that balloon. I wonder if that's the end of it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. <clears throat> Something's going on with the line. That's something we definitely got them. Yeah. Yeah, whenever you're pulling on that, you're I pulling that bottle. Is, you want to put the bottle on the other side? I've got a little active, though. All of that. that actually may have been the balloon that, here, put it down there. They may have been into each other. We may not have had a bite on either one. <laughs> well, something's happened. I'd say the probably get a bite. I don't think it one's deep enough to get the line. Maybe though. 
Oh, I'm going to get in the back. You want catching? He got one on the bottom. We got a couple bites. Here you go. Pick that up. Oh, that is it. Mm -hmm. Still trying to click a little bit. I'm gonna wait till it runs off with it. Oh, we got a bunch of. Fred didn't move back up in here, right? Have I found that line out there and one jump. Yeah, I've seen them going by. Something going by. A lot. Yeah. I'm all over. It's coming loose. It's a little bit. Looks like. Yeah, I'm going to go. I think maybe, maybe that bloom might be in that button. Maybe. Something's happening. I don't want to understand why it's just doing the same. over that line up. It's not moving That's like kind. Mm. That sounds like current. <laughs> I've learned way too much about this stuff. Way more than I ever thought I would. Cass Blast said I had to go make dinner and deer tacos. Got some picked up in here. Mr. Rogers said, by God, something's going on. <laughs> something's happening. Something <laughs> is. Didn't move the balloon when he reeled it. Yeah. Did it? So that's what it was. I was wondering. I kind of thought so. Something definitely hit this one over here a minute ago. It's fun. It's little foot. It never fails when the TKB is around there is fish. There you go. Well, tell him to come back in. <laughs> You had that way out there, didn't you? Now you're making your bottle spin. Yeah. Oh. My phone's at 15%. I'm going to have to get our charger. Does it have any charge left on it? If not, I can grab ours. I thought he still had it on him. He has to get in the tub. He's dirty. <laughs> Right one was at one bar. That's a little cool. That didn't 
Well, that was a little bit of excitement. Mm -hmm. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> Lord, I wish we'd catch something. I'd feel a whole lot better about going back to the house. Right. We probably won't get to fish tomorrow. Yeah, I was talking about going trying to get some coffee tomorrow. If I do, I'm going to definitely save the head. God. Third block. Man, well, it's there. too cold to be driving that, driving that kind of stuff. <laughs> Talking about wind chill. Did we just lose the propane? Huh? We just lost our heat. Chill so I keep your way. <laughs> I reckon it's back on, and one of us must have bumped it. Okay. I'll see if it kicks off again. Yeah. Not yet. BFC, we're still trying. <laughs> this is going on one of our longest lives ever. Oh wow. Uh eight and a half hours sold. There's we've had two that are longer than this one. We had the Ricky's Benefit Tournament was nine hours. Nine hours and 20 minutes or something like that. Yeah, that was a long one. And then we fished 10 hours up at Admiral Point Park and caught one fish. That was a long one. 10 hours. We don't have any cast glass. Mr. Rogers said, is that Anthony? He was sitting at the Taco Bell parking lot. <laughs> Taco Bell sounds good. I might get Taco Bell on the way home. Yeah. I got hibachi yesterday. I had me a half a hibachi in the refrigerator. I tell you, I Juanita told me she ate the rest of hers and mine. I'd like to have a uh, calzone. I'm in the mood for some Italian. That MP hibachi over across the Midland Shopping Center. And people that used to run it they retired that's about the only kind of bait we don't have cast blast <clears throat> your your hat looked good i like that it had your initials on it i wonder if uh what's his face ever got his hoodie Are you hung? <laughs> Probably got the shad off of there. Let me hold that rod up there. Yeah, are you still hung up in it? There's a lot of options for the customization of it. That's all. Awesome. That's awesome. That was good of Brian B to do that. I appreciate him. That was probably the best thing I had for. I had a lot of stuff for the first giveaway, but then I did the second giveaway so close to the first giveaway. I, I just didn't have a lot to give away. I hadn't, I hadn't collected a bunch of stuff, a bunch of stickers. That's about it. I didn't get any uh, spook donations or nothing this time. But hey, what are you sitting at for subs, Cast Blast? I'm chasing you. Okay. 
Next fishing vid, you wear it. Cool. Look like it's pretty good quality. <laughs> We're staying about a thousand apart. I'm at 5,700, a little over 5,700. I'd put another short out today, except I've been live <laughs> forever. Forever, never, never. Why'd it get wrapped and wrapped and wrapped? And it's got a stick on it. Yeah. Hey, do you want to tape them up, Travis, or no? The the uh the line to that bottle. What? You want to tape the line to the bottle? We're gonna fix different bottles for the next time when we go. One point nine million. That's awesome. But yeah, I'm like a thousand behind you. He's got sixty seven hundred and I got fifty seven hundred. <laughs> I can't get any traction on you. If we're gonna um if we do this again, are we gonna fix new bottles? Oh, I don't know. Eighty percent hate comments on it. LOL, we are growing. I get a lot of crazy comments on mine. Don't make any sense. Yeah, hate hate eighty oh, percent hate comments. Said, yeah. Oh, I'm sure. It's crazy that you're getting that many subs, but you got 80% hate comments. Let me know when you're ready. <laughs> uh. no. I didn't say none. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Big Malone. What's up? <laughs> I'm not, I'm not wussing out. That's why I said I said something, then I was like, nope, I didn't say nothing. I'm not listening out. Yes, sir. What's going on, Big Malone? Where is oh, where is the balloon? I don't know. I don't think. I don't think. Got it pulled up. The air may have went out of it. No. I do not think it blew. It was glowing too, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. Man, that balloon is all the way over yonder. No freaking way. Yeah, I don't <laughs> all of it except for the little bit of a head. Wow, look at that. I figured he got it all off. That <laughs> light on that balloon. No way that balloon is there. Yeah, going against the darn wind. Wind blowing up with some water or something. Well, yeah. I was like, what is that bird? That may have been why the mice picked up a little bit. 
sort of kind of weird because the blue one was going back to the right, you know? Yeah. Say a fish point drug it over. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it! Took both balloons in that rod. Yeah, I can see it. I think the line. Yeah, you want me to grab this pole and? It's tough to get a big old fish in on these bottles, wouldn't it? I don't know. That uh, balloon Travis had on that one bottle was way down there, and then when he started reeling it in, it's in our pole that we got out. So, <laughs> I was like the bottles are starting to spin. It is cool, Cass Black. Yeah, I remember when we were in our hundreds of subscribers too. It ain't been that long ago. I didn't I started this last March. This past March. I look at that the hook will go right down into the bottom. Oh, that's cool. You yeah, actually saved the uh, hook and sinker both. The lids. Oh, we can get some more lids. Actually, I'll hook this one into the top of this one. Are we reeling in for the night? Yeah, probably will here in a few minutes. Cast blast ass. It says now we're in the thousands. Yep, we'll be hitting ten thousand subject sub uh, before we know it. You yeah, mess to clean up anyway. Yeah, I've got uh, I'm tripping out because my overall channel views are like nine hundred and twenty five thousand or something. Don't think it'll mess the braid up. Yeah. Oh. Look at that. Yeah. No, I think it messes up. Well, if it'll keep it from unwinding, that'll be excellent. Take a piece of that uh, tape. tape, put it right over. Yeah. I don't think it'll unwind. Yeah. Well, it'd help if I tighten it up some first, I guess. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we got all kinds of balls spin now. Mm -hmm. Got a bottle spin. Cass Blast, I have uh, like 11,000 watch hours. When you go live three or four times a week, you can't help but get them. I remember, though, it took forever to get to 4,000. I was so frustrated. I'd watch it climb a few hours every time I went on a, a, did a live and was like, crap. 
I actually didn't go over. I got the three thousand watch hours on was partially monetized, and then it it seemed like it took forever to get from three to four thousand. Oh yeah, you're at eighteen hundred. Yeah. I mean, like, it, it seems like if you go up real fast on your subscribers, then watch hours are a problem. If you go up real fast on watch hours, then you then you your subscribers lag. You're always waiting on something. But it takes a little bit of time to get both of them moving up. And yours is all mostly, you're getting your watch hours mostly on videos. You don't do a lot of lives, right? Do you ever do lives? Well, that's awesome that you're getting your views, your watch hours without doing lives. I really haven't gotten into editing, so long form videos are very raw. The ones I do are just of catches. Actually, Cast, I think the lives are fun. I enjoy talking to everybody. There are time, like I wasn't going to go live last night. We were just going to video any catches we had so that I had some shorts material and stuff. But um, I just like I enjoy talking to you guys so much. And we have so much fun and stuff that I, I just enjoy being live. Need to try some live fishing in spring. Yep. Once you can get an, a, a base chat, like you can go live anywhere. We, we went live making rod holders one time. We went live in Walmart once. <laughs> but, yeah, just hang out with your chat. Do you want me to reel in that other bottle, Travis? Okay. I feel like that little kid on Christmas story. All these clothes on. Yeah, the one that they had clothes on that he couldn't get stuff off his face. I try to get by that pair. The clothes are like. I don't have a little button. They probably dragged it right by one of their heads and they snagged it. <laughs> I'm going to take that two ounce sinker off of this one and get it in there. I'm going to ask him. Did you lose your head? Two ounce won't fit in the box. Now these bottles this grass bank don't get along too well. That was what you down in there, okay, too. Yeah. Two rounds won't fit, but it ain't meant to clip the sinker back on to it. Got plenty of this tape. 
Eleven thousand uh, watch hours. Yeah, I've only been doing this since March. Nine months. Yeah, so they don't start falling off till March again. I think it was eleven thousand last time we checked, wasn't it, Travis? Yeah. But you got to do a lot of. I mean, you got either got to put out content that people will watch a lot like your uh, short or you got to do lives <laughs> so you watch, watch yours all right i'm gonna start uh putting chairs in the car and stuff Here's a that if you want to dry your hands off with your wet, Travis. Okay. Hey, Ray. What's going on? What do you know? It didn't have no bait on it. I knew something, I knew something had hit it over where I seen the styrofoam and that spun off of it. Good night, Tennessee, Kentucky, Bigfoot. Good night, everybody. I nice appreciate you. Appreciate you coming in. Mm, yeah. We're going to do this again here in a little bit. Hopefully, I'll be going up. Or at least it'll be settled where the fish may be. Yeah. I gotta start biting at some point. Yeah. I don't guess they have to. I guess they could be getting smarter and they'll be on to us and not not take their bait ever. Well, this one here tightened down good. I had it wrapped the opposite way of the lid, so when I tightened the lid down on it, it tightened it up. So we'll put a piece of tape around it though. I never heard of double security. Take that other one. That's good. Oh, okay. You need to take another one. No, they, I poke them straight into the. Oh, that's hard. Oh, it's a small, 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 it's
Karena lu bayu. Thanks for hanging out. Y'all have been there. You too, Chase Thank you, Mr. Rogers, for hanging in there. We didn't get anything from the Postal Service yet. I'm still not home. But, I mean, I'm staying gone a lot. <laughs> but my son will let me know whenever, if anything does come in. All right, guys, it's freezing cold out here. We're going to get going as quick as we can. So I'll get you next time. See you soon.